for app. And it's everyone's problem. No, no more bubble wrap for you. Bubble wrap for me. So satisfying. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, everybody, and welcome to the stream. I've already been eight, up for five hours now. <laughs> I slept for two hours, and now we're going to play Poppy Playtime Chapter 3. Don't sleep. Good morning, everybody. How's everybody doing? ASMR we love. Yeah, I was expecting you guys to get more annoyed by that than anything else, but you guys rolled with it. I was surprised. There's very few ways I can torture you guys nowadays. Although, stroking my beard like this also has a nice little ASMR quiet sound, and that feels quite nice, so... Ah, uh, now I really feel like a cat scratching my chin. Anyway, good morning, everybody. <laughs> uh, if you don't remember, where we laughed off... Laughed off? Where we left off last time... Huggy Wuggy tried to murder us. Huggy Wuggy fell down the stairs. Huggy Wuggy hurt his face. Huggy Wuggy, no one cares. And then in chapter two, we played a lot with Poppy herself, the weird doll who at first seemed like she was trying to help us. But then for some reason, after she was kidnapped by the Dommy Mommy, Mommy Longlegs, um, she came back really creepy and then decided I wasn't allowed to leave and I was very useful. And she came into the train where I was just riding around being a good boy doing my little choo-choos. And she crashed it. 
And so that's where we are now. <laughs> We've been attacked by a cute purple guy called Huggy Wuggy. There's a girl named Missy Kissy who's running around who will not give me a kissy for some reason. She helped us. I don't know what her deal is. Um, there was Mommy Longlegs who tried to murder us as well. Um, and now there's this big old cat friend. It really is a cat-themed day today. <laughs> Holy shit. Look at his cute little cat friend with his little crescent moon. I'm sure he's going to be friendly and adorable, right? I don't think she crashed it. She seems surprised. Oh. Oh. I thought she crashed it on purpose. Interesting. But now I know. Did you really meow on stream? N no. Did I? I don't remember meow. <laughs> she wants you to. I, spoilers, Elena. I don't, I don't know what that is. Um, the face is a little scary. Oh, he's just got big old lovable eyes. Big old smiley mouth. You can't even see his teeth. How can you be afraid of a creature that doesn't even have teeth? He's adorable. <laughs> you did? Yeah. When? I don't believe you. Before Gore? Nah, couldn't have been me. Couldn't have been me. Anyway, my plan for today is to get a smooch from Missy Kissy. I know this is technically Poppy Playtime Chapter 3, but I'm taking it as if it's Sucker for Love Part 2. That's what I'm going to do. Is the Billy Billy stream fake? I don't know what you mean. Well, 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 Billy Billy stream. I, I don't even know what you're talking about. It's, it's craziness. You're just making things up. Anyway, let's dive into the game. Chapter 3. Deep Sleep. In the aftermath of the train crash, you now find yourself stranded in the depths with a new goal in your sights. I don't like that there's a gas mask in this image. I'm worried that that means there's going to be a mechanic where we're going to have to just, you know, not get poisoned to death. That wouldn't be great. Ah, Ikuzo, confidence, let's do this. Ooh, proper VHS. Playtime! Playtime! Play time. Honestly, the production value on these are amazing. Those mouths are too big. They look scary even when they're cute. Oh, God. Oh, man. The wind's really scary. I can't sleep. Hey, we'll be okay, guys. I promise. All winds blow away. Eventually. This is shockingly well animated. Look <laughs> at full on cartoons to. Uh oh. It's him. Catnap! <laughs> Please help us go to sleep, Catnap. We need it, Catnap. Please help us oh, sleep. Oh, he puts sleep. people to sleep. Yeah. <laughs> That's laughing gas. That's what that is. The Everyone knows Huggy Wuggy and Poppy Playtime, but are your children safe from Playtime Co's latest That was toy? some lost episodes well, bullshit. Here is Playtime Co's own Smiling Critters, a limited series cartoon meant to celebrate the release of the toys sharing its name. Yet both now face the fire sparked by the inclusion of one key member. Catnap. Is he's creepy this as fuck? Yep. Is catnap. I kind of want like the plushie the though. Of his line, you just pull his little tail and. Why would they make it? Innocent enough. Breathe gas. However, parents across the country report their children experiencing strange and often violent nightmares, and beside them, their little grinning catnap doll. Now with controversy Honestly, growing, Playtime evolution has announced finest. the recall of all catnap toys from the Smiling Critters line. The weak His don't get sleep, cleared from all promotional and they become weak. Oh. Damage already done, will disappearing be that easy? They're all the that creepy anyway. These incidents still unknown, only one thing appears glaringly certain. Your children are not safe with catnap. You don't know that. They might be. 
they they're actually getting way better each game between these <laughs> like the production value on that was actually amazing the sound editing the cartoon animation why am i in catnap's body or am i being dragged around by catnap i think i'm being carried by catnap hopefully by the scruff of my neck like a kitten you put me in a cage I've played Amnesia. I don't mind being caged. Definitely going to need a gas mask, though. New objective. Find a way out. Oh, shit. The wall is closing. Um. Um. Fuck. Need to wait for things to get closer together before I can climb that properly. Get up there. There we go. What? Did that count as a death? N nothing cr crushed me. Um. Okay. Um. That went well? Yeah, it did. I, I found a secret way to kill myself, so... That's impressive. <laughs> Heep! Wow, you really can't get up there that fast, huh? Come on. Climb, Fuchan. Climb. Yeet! Oh. No, I still don't get why I died. Um. Do I just keep moving forward? I mean... I don't think I'm supposed to go this way. Blessed? <laughs> Did I break the game? Um. Ah. Uh, that simple. We. Oh. I was looking at the silly thing. <laughs> Okay, how do I swing in this again? Interesting. Trying to remember all of the controls. It's been three minutes. I'm allowed to break things in three minutes. No, but seriously, how do you? I can't swing anymore. Eh. Um. No, seriously, what the fuck? It's not letting me swing. Oh my god, am I going crazy? Oh, I don't have to go that way. Yes, I do. It, um. Forward, backward? Nah, I've been trying that. Uh, um, okay. I just... Just needed to hold forward, I guess. Look at the controls. The controls literally said how to pull me up. Don't act like I'm a child. <laughs> I looked at the controls. The controls did not help. I'll get crashed. On that. I wonder if I can go down. No, that looks like death. Don't crush me. Don't crush me. Don't crush me. Okay. Now we're doing just fine. Back area reminds me of Portal. Uh, hopefully we'll get a Portal gun soon then. Oh, the industrial... Turns out you can get crushed there. That was the one part I thought I was safe in. <laughs> really? Okay, we're all the way back here. That's fine. It's only realistically been like two minutes, but it... I'm finding every death in the game. That's my specialty. What happened? I got crushed into the top. Wee. I did not jump far enough. I might be dead. Bam, bam, bam. Speed run! Yeet! Fucking, what the? Still don't get this. There we go. <laughs> At least it's fixed. Yep. One part down. Is that a button? No. 
death count three. We're starting early, I see. Go! Fuck! It's okay. We only went back one. We're fine. <laughs> Get crushed at the top. Just don't get crushed at the top. Uh, let's jump now. Okay. Screw you guys. Enjoy your barrel. Lucky I can't throw it. Dude, should really be able to throw shit, man. We. I can't jump over the. Oh. You can just walk around it. <laughs> that makes more sense. You are noisy, sir. What's going on over here? No. More interested in this creepy shit. I'm hearing footsteps that are not mine. And that's a lot of blood. But where are those footsteps coming from? You know what? I'm not going to question it. There's people walking around. A lot of blood and scratch marks. Is this where I came from? No, the tunnel isn't here. Playtime. What were you trying to build? So, <laughs> so many animatronic pieces here. I want the hung dinosaur. Ah, uh, delicious shower. Okay, that room was just for fun. Okay, but what if that worked? <laughs> I don't think that's the correct word for that. Uh, seems fun to me. Seems like a happy, happy playtime. Uh, I don't think we're alone anymore. He's everywhere. He's in the freaking walls, man. <laughs> we see old Food Chan would have tried to make that in one go. New Food Chan has sensibility. Doesn't mean we're not gonna die. <laughs> Cut nap in chat. Oh no. They're watching us in every direction. What's the point in ladders if you can't climb on them? That's my question. Okay, let's try that again. Speed run! Oh, you can just... Hey! Hey! You're back here! I saw you. Trying to be creepy. You're not creepy. You're just adorable. Wee! Wee! They added the physics. The gravity physics work now. When you're accelerating really fast, it lets you keep going fast. I don't think I'm supposed to be able to get back here, but I did. Give me an achievement. Aw. <laughs> well, that'd be a trophy or something. <laughs> Why, hello there, little guy. You one of his creepy creations, too? I'm gonna walk backwards, then you can't get scared. See? It's impossible to get scared or go where you want to go when you're moving backwards. Hello? This looks cozy as shit, other than the bloody hand and claw prints. <gasps> Video time! Stay energized. Playtime, Co. Yes, All mess. right, Miss Harper. Please explain the situation. Spare no detail. Well, luck any not, all the children were getting asleep. 
It was peaceful, quiet. Quiet. Catnap had the red smoke in the room. Then suddenly there was this scream. Nightmares happen, I know, but this, I mean, dilated pupils and quivering lips. The way her eyes darted around the room, and I swear, her hand in mine, it felt like her blood was boiling beneath her skin. Jesus. She saw something, too. Something horrible. She... Uh, I'm sorry. I don't mean to. Miss Harper, we'll provide the very best care we can offer. You have my word. But this is important. Did Marie happen to describe what she saw? Yes. A monster, she said, said that it was colorless. Gosh. Colorless. Uh, so the poor little heart pounding. For her, it was right there. A and her movements, they were so wild. Arms flailing, legs kicking. Hmm. I don't know any colorless uh, enemies. I want her to talk to her. See how she's doing. I, I just I really need to hear her voice right now. That would not be advice. Miss Harper. She's Playtime Co's child now. Many concerns we must address at this time. But vitals show normal, and we'll continue to monitor. <laughs> She'll be okay. No! Well, pardon me if I'm not comforted by that. What the shit? <laughs> Just bring my little girl back to me. <laughs> that voice actress went off for that line out of nowhere. <laughs> Just the immediate. No! Also, Catnap in chat is pretty damn funny. <laughs> Catnap just being like, I know what she saw. You're next. <laughs> I hope he has a voice. Please have a silly voice. Catnap has an interesting decoration sense too. Can't read any of these. I got a battery. I got two battery. I will never trust one of these machines again. Anytime I touch one, I just assume something's going to try and kill me from now on. That's, that's how I'm living my life. Give me some potato slips. I want dino dots. I want boogie bites. I don't want PJ puffs. PJ was disturbing. Get that dog out of here. The color also changed. Yeah, the wires have a cool, like, electric flow to them now. It's badass. I'm Bubba Bumblefint. Hey, I remember you. Oh, please don't remember me having dropped you down an elevator shot. <laughs> an elephant always remembers. Uh-oh. No way. Want to know what I remember about you? Um, how beautiful my smile is. <laughs> You've seen my movies. I'm Bubba Bubbafint. Okay, Bubba, hey, you have fun. I remember you. An elephant. Phone? F phone? Uh, phone? Where is phone? <laughs> um, oh, and I'm coming. Phone? Phone? Oh, there's phone. Hey, hey, can you hear me? Y you yes. Kind of lost. I don't want you to die, so I'm going to help you. Check this out. Look at the tube thing on the back wall. Ready? Ba Boom! You can use that battery to open the door. I don't know. Last cute, adorable child voice that tried to help me eventually tried to kidnap me. And they have everything poppy themed here. Sounds like Gregory. <laughs> to be fair, I've never played that game. But that is how I imagine Gregory. Did they, they locked the door behind me. Oh. Rude. Really wish I had a flashlight I could actually turn on and off. Okay. Whoa. That's my twain. That? I didn't mean to. I guess that's where Catnap found you. I know you're probably mad at Poppy for not letting you escape, but she needs you. We need you. You are our mission. Together, we can save a lot of people, including you. 
Okay. So this. I'm not gonna have to deal with all eight. Okay, good. Nice to meet you too, murderous child. Definitely gonna do me harm. Catnap did all- A fucking train couldn't stop catnap. What the fuck am I gonna be able to do? That's a big, long, long cat, man. Oh. Hey, Huggy Wuggy. Been a while. This one's colorless. I don't like that. I was told colorless is evil. 10.05 is the next train. Interesting. I don't want to move on. I'm safe down here. With my guy. Ah, no, not you. Shit, why didn't she look like that in 3D? And she might have been a bit more of a spider mommy. How do I... Ah. Security. Need a file. Let me read things. Archivist, you can't do this to me. They've scattered so many files around this time. None of them actually do anything. Oh, okay. See you again soon. <laughs> Please wait for a counselor to meet you before proceeding. <laughs> I love the little, like, additional things they have to add just to be like, yeah, that's for the kids. You guys work your ass off. Kissy Pog. Wait, was that Kissy Missy back there? I mean, they were colorless. They could have been any of them. It could have been any of the creepy huggy things that tried to kill me in that minigame. Oh. Interesting. With Q and E. Aim the beam at the power impulse while touching the powers. What? Power source. <laughs> in chat with the gifted oh kissy missy got a gifted okay that's even more crazy uh, rotate the beam grab the handle ah there we go okay that's a weird mechanic going to take some getting used to. <laughs> Can I do anything else with it? Oh. I have like full control of it. Interesting. Be eagerly waiting for your smooch futan. Please no. Please no. <laughs> Not like this. I don't want to die. You know what? I miss mommy long legs. Hey, I'm kicking chicken. Want to go outside and hang out? No, you have way too much radical energy for me. It's looking pretty rad outside. Pretty rad. Next, you're gonna tell me it's tubular. I've never been outside before. Oh, buddy. It's okay. Here, head pats. You're a good boy. It's okay. That's not your fault. That's on your parents. You don't have to blame yourself. Will you come with me? I'm scared. Mm, sure. Here, follow me. Okay. Step out first. Uh huh. Where are we going? Ah! Cat catnap wasn't very nice to these guys. Also, okay, it's not my imagination. They made mommy long legs a lot sexier. What the fuck? <laughs> Chicken, chicken. Thank Wanna you, kicking chicken. And hang out? That feels better. What did I open? Not this. Oh, that's some ancient shit. We're gonna die. <laughs> you mean mommy yummy legs? What the? Oh, 
shit. Is this one open world? Am I going to have to actually explore and shit? Nah, I wanted to come back. Nah. <laughs> Not that much. Not that much. I'm just impressed. They've upgraded like the art style as well. They've made it much more like 80s cartoon. Look at the puppy. Even the puppy looks cute despite how fucking horrific PJ was. <gasps> I want the backpack. Hello. H Hello? My name is Elliot Ludwig. I know you. You created you this shit. At the world today, what one thing do you think it needs more of? Balls. Once. Money. I never have enough. Bruh. Understanding. I can never get any. <laughs> Faith, the common man has lost it. Dude. His answer was different. And I could perhaps see some little truth in each. But I think each was also missing something. Something simple. Happiness. You see. Not one of them could muster a smile. Exactly. Doesn't matter what you have so much as what you're feeling. Where the... A smile Am I flying? A smile is love. What a the shit? is understanding. Is this area. And there is nothing more gratifying to my soul than being the reason for a child's smile. To be the spark that ignites all their hopes and dreams. Or it is yeah, this definitely looks like a fucking we prison. We create a better world. One where our children need not be afraid. One where they are protected. After all, this company and its toys are nothing without them. These children deserve to smile. They deserve to love. And they deserve a safe home. And you think the best that plan for that is to kidnap is them all? Pleasure. That as the founder of Playtime Co, I announce Disneyland. Playcare. Playcare. Our very own on-site orphanage. But it's not only that. It's a school, a playhouse, a place to belong. Our very own ecosystem beneath the surface, dedicated in every inch and detail to ensuring it's a, a child's smile. It's teachers and it's got fake stars and shit. And That's awesome. Until such a time they have all of that in you. May play care bring joy, inspiration, and smiles to all who enter these doors. For what gives life its meaning if not a smile? I mean, you don't have to smile to be happy, but sure. It's me again, Ollie. What up, Ollie? Cool place, right? Yeah, I want to live here. Used to live here. Now look at it. Anyways, do you see that statue in the middle of the room? Take the stairs that go under it. There's a really cool room in there that powers literally all of Playcare. I can give you a key. Holy to shit! My hands are so much longer now. They extend literally to the top. Oh my god! My next mistress. Wait, which next mistress? That phrasing is just like, wait, what? Okay, see, now he looks evil again. Again, though, they gave her a fucking chest and they gave her bigger hips. They knew what they were doing. She'd been like that in chapter two. Chapter two would have been a very different experience. Oh, he could give thumbs up. High five. High five. I want to do a thumbs up. Would? Totally. Which children here were eating? Oh, no, they're just sodas. They're not beers. We're okay. <laughs> Oh no, the giant! Oh, it's a lamp. Aw, that's cute. I know the kid told me to go in there, but I'm going to go to the toy store. This is very Willy Wonka coded. Come on, give me. Come here, hold me. Toys. Toys. Find a way to get to you. Damn it. Okay, fine. You keep your secrets. Go do what the kid said. Catnap, I'm lonely. I don't think catnap's gonna help you guys. Bobby Bear Hug. A kind, caring soul. Bobby Bear Hug shows compassion for everyone and for everything. People and places and things, large or small, are all receivers of her love. Each is enriched by this attention and affection, and in turn, so is she. Press me. Hi, I'm Bobby Bear Hug. Wanna know how much I love you? Is it gonna be this much that's a lot of love hi i'm bobby bear hug want to know how much i love you hi i'm bobby bear hug 
Wanna know how much I love you? She never says anything, which means she doesn't love me at all. Man. Now I'm just hurt. Chicken chicken. This is kicking chicken, the cool kid of the crew. And he maintains that sense of cool through anything. Even the most tense of situations knock him down and he'll pick himself up. Brush himself off and ask, what's next? He didn't after he screamed. Hey, I'm chicken chicken. Wanna go outside and hang out? No. Hey, I'm chicken chicken. Wanna go outside and hang out? I don't think I'm gonna find out which one was there. Bubba Bubba fan. Oh, I didn't realize you were one of them. You're one of the little critters. Oh. Bubba Bubba Fan is the brains of the critters, bright and attentive. He keeps his friends steady and always cheers them to make smart choices the way they might grow up to be bright and brilliant, each in their own right. I'm Bubba Bubba Fan. Hey, I remember Just go you. under the statue. Shut up, Ollie. I'm exploring. Let me enjoy the game in my own way. Crafty Corn. Oh, you're the best. You're awesome. A conscious observer of both color and creativity in the world, Crafty Corn understands... There was a footstep behind me. <laughs> Sorry. Crafty Corn understands the importance of art and sharing it with others. Crayons, pencils, paint, or words on the page. Unicorn can see beauty in anything. Imagine the given shape. Hey, I'm Crafty Corn. Can you help me with my painting? Pass me the blue, please. Blue is not a creative color. Hoppy hopscotch. I don't like you. You look fucking deranged immediately. <laughs> Unafraid to hop where others might sit. Happy is the friend everyone needs to maintain their energy and enthusiasm. While sometimes louder and patient, she'll always hop beside her friends, even if it means showing, slowing up once in a while to keep their pace. Okay, you won me back over. That's an adorable voice. Piggy, piggy. Of course, you're more important than playing gurning. Piggy, piggy knows the answer. A playful body and keen mind are fueled by what's put into them. This is why she encourages her friend to eat a well-balanced diet. Secretly, PB&Js are a favorite food. Honestly, good protein. Hi there. I'm Piggy Piggy. Let's eat. Why do the pigs always have, like, southern accents? They're always, like, southern males. Okay, Piggy Piggy. Dog Day! Oh, this is Dog Day, the sunny, strong, and determined leader of our critters. Each trusts him to find the bright side in any situation and to have a friendly word of encouragement should they feel down. He will always keep his friends going, no matter what. Dogday says, fetch! Dogday says, fetch! It's the worst VTuber debut line of them all. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Nope. The door, I guess. Wee. Duggo? Yeah, he's kind of cute. Well, the fact that he's the leader, and you know, he's a dog versus a cat, makes me wonder why he didn't deal with Catnap. Would Catnap take him out first? Was it a long live the king kind of scenario? What is this area? Ali! Oh, you were going to give me a key, buddy. Oh, Ali? No, no, no. What, what, what the fuck? No, where did... No. What are these? Okay. So, you got the key. Yeah, the where are you? You're probably asking yourself is, where does it go? No, well, where are you? Out, and you should find a door just to the left of the cable car you took down here. Hmm. I don't trust Ollie. <laughs> the fact they're not revealing themselves tells me something they're even more horrific than most of the scary critters in here. Ba -doom -ba -doom. Looks like a drum set. Or a bunch of evil eyes. Either way. Ollie sus, yeah, Ollie sus AF. Wait, why can't Tommy Mommy sorry, Mommy Longleg speak? Oh, none of these can speak. But this is where we found the other one. Okay. Just to the left of the cable car. This was the cable car, right? So like stage left or <laughs> I like that building. I'm gonna try that building. Ollie's just venting. <laughs> Sus. Among us. Man, they have so much more stuff that looks like you could interact with it in this one. And yet you can't. And I can't even get in the water. 
That is some solid ass water. Sheshibaka. I wouldn't go that far. They haven't shown themselves to be a baka just yet. That's creepy as shit, dude. <laughs> okay. I chose the wrong left. <laughs> Wee. It's the other left. I thought I couldn't escape the Amogus. You can never escape the Amogus. You drop into just about any... I'm sorry, we have a Blitzo in the chat as well? Huh? <laughs> okay. What up, Blitzo? Hey, that's locked too. Now I'm confused. Unless... Oh, it's back here. It's hidden. It really was to the left of the cable car. Left is subjective. Ain't that the truth? I don't like the auto saving feature. <laughs> I know it's probably good, so I don't lose. Pro. Press. But every time it says auto saving, I'm just like, oh, so they're loading in an enemy somewhere in the walls. It's going to jump out at me. Yay. I know you're here somewhere, friend. I wouldn't straight up pause my game to load you in if you weren't. Oh, he's the honey cat thing. I do like that one. That's actually just an adorable idea. Don't forget your mask. Employees always wear a gas mask wherever the red smoke is present. Oh, we're back to playing The Last of Us. Fantastic. Watch your step. Always remain aware of your surroundings. Fools may be lethal. True. Where's my gas mask then? They didn't give me a gas mask. I don't want to Welcome laugh to death. Welcome to the gas production zone. The beating heart of the whole evil play care system. All that gas you see coming from the machine is made right here in the factory. Damn. It's called the red smoke. Right now, it's all headed off to the right. We need to make that red smoke go left instead. What? That's how we can get to him. The machine will probably have a few dumb safeguards for you to work around. But I think you can do it. Okay, but what if it didn't? <laughs> what if I could just literally press the left-right button? Also, where are we sending this gas? I would like that information before I randomly send gas to the left side of the building. Is that a fucking... St oh, no. Okay, that's the weird machine. I thought that was a stockade. It's like, damn. Mommy Longlegs got into some kinky shit. Got a stockade and shit. Okay. That looks like it's powered up, but it's not. We stopping the gas from keeping something asleep? Probably. Probably waking... Maybe they were using the gas against the catnap himself. <gasps> Maybe it's like a perpetuating system where it takes his own gas from one end and shoves it back in the other end. And then it keeps him asleep forever. That'd be sick. Warning! All personnel must ensure the secured entrance closes behind them. Tell you to comply will result in reassignment from class three status. There's not even a door anymore, my dude. I mean, oh, is that a battery? So close, and yet so far. Oh, you don't even have a VHS player. What are you doing here? Okay, let's go talk to this little cute guy. Oh, he's sleeping. I guess that makes sense. He's catnap. I see that right there is my Oshi. That, that's understandable. Okay, I think he's done. I do not like the look of this thing. Hmm. Rumble, grumble, grr. I mean, it's kind of a cute little moaning sound, to be fair. It's just like... <laughs> this 
place is huge. There's going to be something up here. I can feel it. I was incorrect, but now I have barrels. It's a barrel of laughs. Oh, I wonder if I can use these to climb up there. Oh, so that's a battery right there. <laughs> no, but I might be able to snipe it if I'm a bit higher. I don't think that's even a battery after all. I'm just crazy. Okay, I got a green battery. That's something. <laughs> I mean, wood. Is he... Now... <laughs> now I don't feel comfortable because it's... There's a mommy long legs in chat. Now I can't make those kind of jokes anymore. You're going to try to complete this chapter by collecting lore? I love lore. I'm just not so good at finding it. Beep, 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 beep. Big Pomu energy. Hello? Swap hands. Holy sh... What is this one? I would like a green... There we go. Give, give me. Teach me about this purple hand. I'm now the purple guy. Playtime. I actually really like this music. It's very relaxing. Grab pack 2.0. Working prototype. Extended wire length. Yeah, this one actually has huge wires. Swapping hands is easy. Wait, who outfitted me with a 2.0 then? This prototype has... Can I fly? How? How, 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 how? To break long falls. Oh, it just stops fall damage. That's kind of sick. I thought I could, like, jetpack. But watch where you land. Why would you have spikes in this building, huh? We're just a... Toy store, right? Not all ground is safe to touch. Thank you. Use that grab pack 2.0 with care. I kind of want to see it. Oh no, it just shows you. Rec I can get four hands. Sick. What the? Am I imagining it, or does that leave, like, a giant handprint? Oh, they both do that. The window's just weird. Oh, trippy. Comfy grabber unlocked? Yeah. You guys will never get away now. I can't even pick up a gas... Oh. Huggy Wuggy's seen better days. Okay, let's do this. Now I've got my purple hand. Oh, they make you go bouncy. This is awesome. Tony Stark in this bitch. Winning. I'll press you now. Blah, 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 blah. It saved again. Evil is occurring. Why are we in a labyrinth? Yeah. Huh, oh, so it varies. You never know which one's going to send you high or low. He nope, nope, nope. I lived. Failed successfully. <laughs> okay, let's try that again. Maybe if I jump and then bounce. Hut! Yeah, okay. Jumping does help a little bit. Blood River for the win! Ooh. Oopy. Look at all that Kool-Aid. Never drink the Kool-Aid. Shit! I don't know. Look. When I'm dressed like this, I am a scientist. <laughs> I have to discover what things... Oh. Were those blood marks always there? I just, I just didn't even pay attention to them. I was just so excited about my purple hand. <laughs> Yeet. Yeet. Bouncy bounce. 
Don't eat the secret sauce. But it's so tasty. It's made of children's screams. I like this mechanic. This is a good mechanic. I don't want to bounce and then grab. You know what? Oh, I can't. Yeet. And I'm dead. Okay. Oh, you can probably just pull that to you. God damn it, Fu-chan. <laughs> Morning, Fu. You feeling better? Yeah, way better than the last few days. Now what do? Did I ride you? Nope, can't grab you from that side. Can I climb you? No. Oh. How interesting. <laughs> I'll pull you up, though. So I guess. You better send me high! Nope. Fuck. <laughs> Didn't fall. We just wanted to taste it again. Yeah, it's kind of delicious. It's like a raspberry strawberry jam blend. It's it's great. It's great. <laughs> okay, that only sends me a tiny bit up. So... I'm going to guess I have to move it, but... Do I just jump to there, maybe? Yeah, that makes sense. We Oh, oh, am I fucked? I... Oh, maybe I should have aimed for that thing. <laughs> no, it's okay. We're fine. <laughs> Yeet! Shit. Uh, oh, let go of that, sir. Yeet! Okay. Oh. Can't use you anymore. Interesting. This room's full of all kinds of mysteries. Okay. Uh, do I need to open that somehow? Right, that's how you do it. Progress, but only for now. Don't worry, we'll go back to fucking it up real soon. Okay, so I can't... Ah! Can that actually line up then? No, it still misses that. Interesting. Hmm. How about you? Okay. Interesting. But this one leads into here. What would this thing even be supposed to hit? It's my major question. Oh, the graph. Wait, there's a graph. <laughs> what? Maybe I can get over there, actually. Yeah! Eh. Imagine, though. <laughs> yeah, I was pretty sure that wasn't the way to actually do it, but... Imagine. Okay, so what can I point you at? actually be useful. Oh, I can go the whole way. It's kind of funny, but it doesn't offer me anything. <laughs> Is it that controller? Wee! Find dog day, please. No. I don't want to. We find dog day? We'll find dog day. No, it's no big deal. Am I going crazy? How do I? Okay. We've got this electrical thing. Cannot grab it. It leads to over there, which probably means it opens that up. I don't... Hmm. Interesting. And I can hit that, but it doesn't do anything. Do I just not go in here yet? Wee! Oui. 
No, we're definitely supposed to be in here. Maybe I can get in this one. Oh, okay. That was complicated. <laughs> Wait, did that do... There we go. Okay. Jumping is weirdly satisfying. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, I can probably launch that one over there. I quit missing. Oh, I cannot launch that one over there. Okay, how do I hit that one? Unless I just have to... Power that one as well. Oh. We. Oui. Okay, but if that did work... <laughs> there we go. Wait, do I have to hit them both? No fucking way. Oh my god, that's crazy. Good thing they made my arms so long, I guess. Oh, it powered up the equipment. We. Oh, oh, I almost died. Give me a second, sir. Gotta check out all these no signals. The real horror using your brain cells always. The scary jumping things never too terrifying. Meanwhile, when it makes you use your brain, then you get in trouble. Okay, that did nothing for me. I'm literally back where I am. Maybe follow this wire? Wow, well, one wire is down. Shit. <laughs> so we need. Oh. 4,160 volts, 98 degrees Celsius. Oh, we moved it to the middle now. Well, that's something. Ollie, you're going to come tell me how good I did? Oliver? Olivia? Oh, no. Someone killed the power. Was that okay. someone I you... I go, I guess. <laughs> Unless it opened this thing. Shit. It's really hopeful. Okay, all the way back. We need to go find another key. He said under the statue. Right, they must have opened up another way. Nope, okay, they locked it behind me. I'm doing the right thing. This is gonna be a long run back, I guess. I don't like the loading screens. <laughs> I know why they have them. Because they have like graphical intense shit here in big open worlds. But man, the loading screens are more terrifying than the actual jump scares. Everything just starts getting staticky and you're like, well, this is death, I guess. Why is... Oh my god, it's so dark out here now. Okay, kiddo, you got me a second key. Is that always leaking? Yeah, probably. I don't have to worry about that. There is no second key. Okay. Store power in home sweet home. Gas production, 0%. That's a good thing. Oh god, we're going to end up making more gas for these fuckers, aren't we? Fuck. <laughs> we're totally being used by the evil things again. Oh, well. Okay. Where do we think is home sweet home? The judicial building? Probably not. That's the cable car. That's like a ride. That looks like a home sweet home. So does that. That one's actually lit up. I'm going to go to the lit up one because I'm a little bitch. <laughs> I'll stick to where there's lights, thanks. <laughs> hey. Stuff me. 
Come on, fill my mouth. I exist to be stuffed. That unlocked. There we go. Close that door. I don't like this one bit. Key! Loading! <laughs> what the fuck, dude? We're done. Don't worry about it. Everything's totally say so, guys. Everything's fine. Yo, oh, that mommy long legs? Double mommy long legs. That's extra creepy. Hmm. Where'd all the photos go? Okay, you know what? The photos are more. That's just straight up a real fucking child. What the. Yup. <gasps> With a pretty well photoshopped in image. One doesn't even have any playtime co. Oh my god, I just noticed the wallpaper. It's all baby poppies. She kind of looked like muddied in here. <laughs> How does that make it extra terrifying? She's in the fucking walls, man. Nope. No, thank you. That's a lot of claw marks. Any gas masks for a weary traveler? Okay, I guess I'll laugh to death. Yeah. Cool. Zo! Oh. I actually made it. I was just expecting a death. What happened to my pack? What? I can't use my hands. My hands are gone. This is... Very evil looking. <laughs> okay, we're playing PT now. This is fine. Where's the crying baby in the bathtub? Bum, bum, bum. Happy and fun way. Was it done? What? That can't be right. Happy and fun. Why was it done? Happy and fun. Why was it done? I want my hands back, please. Not today, Satan. Hmm. You book. Tragic news this morning, as of 9.45 a.m., local authorities report that the body of a young boy has been found on the estate of the late Elliot Ludwig. Ludwig, how could you? ...and originator of the Playtime Company. At this time, an identity for the child awaits official confirmation. Found in an upstairs bedroom in a large duffel bag, Oof. officers on scene report that the remains appear to have been disturbed. Organs as well as key bones for the skeletal structure were reported missing from the body. It is unknown at this time whether this extraction was, in fact, the cause of death. Who the fuck calls that an extraction? My dude, that is a murder. At the same time, I'm gonna follow these scratch marks. They look fun. Um. Oh, this one? This is what they had to say. Quote, it's sickening. Elliot Ludwig was a great man. And those who knew him understood that he was not capable of violence, let alone what others now claim. He had a deep love in his heart for children like this one. Making yet, the actions of whoever planted this body all the more sick. Someone scooped out the organs of a child. Name, both in the public eye and in the eyes of the law. Stuffed Stay them. Tuned for more. Stay tuned for more. Why did it kind of sound like Ren trying to sound like a badass at the end there? A clap and a half to you. We'll miss you. Playtime Co. was asked for any comment regarding the discovery. Oh, we're good. This is what they had to say. Quote. Deep love for children. Don't, don't, don't read into it that way. <laughs> I hope not, at least. I'm fine with him being a murderer and, like, stealing kids' organs and... Stuffing them into, like, toys and shit. That's one thing. Anything beyond that is... Ugh. 
Ooh, a phone. It's ringing for me. I'm coming, Ollie. Very windy hallway. Why? I'm not turning around. I know when I turn around, there's going to be something behind me. So I'm just going to walk backwards. Cute little fake pigtails. I just walk backwards. <laughs> they literally can't jump scare me. A lot of books around here, though. Really obsessed with this Nick Houghton one. Okay, I defeated the jump scare. I literally... <laughs> okay, let me back my way back in there. So <laughs> This is so funny. I'm going to have to back my way back in there so he can jump scare me. You need to run, says the child. And I say, no way. Is there something? Ba, ba, ba. Find me? <laughs> <laughs> I fucking love that. I love when you can read shit like that in games and just fuck with the setup. <laughs> okay, on we go. <laughs> Bro is just chilling. Despite Playtime's proclamation of Ludwig's innocence, many believe his reclusive and mysterious nature displayed over the previous decades lends suspicion to this claim. When questioned, Ludwig's neighbors indicated that he would often return to his home in strange hours of the night and depart again before sunrise. Some believed he was sick. Others that don't move. Don't move an inch. What if I do, though? It seems. It tends to keep Elliot's name within its brand. What are you going to do? I'm moving. I'm sure to be a long legal battle will follow. You can't tame me. I'm an untamable brat. At least the cat was so polite to wait for you turning around. Honestly, very respectable. He just really wanted to give his dramatic performance, and who am I to say no? Too much music. Sorry? Weeble. Before it. Weeble. Before it. Okay. I don't know what reefer means. I hear you in there. I can do that too. That's not scary. That just means you need an asthma inhaler. can't let you out of there. I'm sorry, dude. All right. Keep it down in there. That's a creepy ass cracked wall. Why'd you go nearer in case it jumped out at me? Oh, I see you. Come back here. Where you going, big guy? He's leading me into the darkness. I was definitely backwards speaking. But I don't know what it means. Well, now this corridor is impossible. Hold on a minute. Yeah, this is very PT. <laughs> Guilt haunts you? What am I guilty of? I guess I did work here. This is partly my fault. I hear you. just burn sounds like it weep hey let me in this is my hole 
It was made for me. No. Am I supposed to have... Have I glitched this game? I feel like I'm supposed to have my hands. Yeah, okay, catnap. Enjoy your creepy breathing. Get up. Get down. Turn it around. And twerk. Diamond city lights illuminate what's inside. And all the love I've been by your side. Get up. Twerk on them. They can't hurt you if you twerk on them. Hey, big kitty cat. Ooh, he's got a big, long, swooshy tail. Get up. Get up. Get up. Head up. He went into a dead end. Interesting. Nani? Repeat there in English, por favor. Sounded like haversed. Hey, kicking chicken. Just hanging around, huh? He really is a cool dude. The crying babies. I knew this was PT. Okay, let's go find this crying baby. Bet he's in a bathtub. The door opened for me. This really is my hole. Happy and fun. Why was it done? Guilt. Guilt. Okay, it was my red VHS. There we go. Blessed. <laughs> Where are mine? I want my hands back. Hey, Huggy Wuggy. Greetings, employees, and welcome <laughs> to your first day here in Playtime. We're certain that in the days to come, you'll find your new family here every bit as loving and supportive as your own. When did the beds close Feel up? Feel free to wander the halls, sit in the mess for lunch, or watch our children play and learn to their little hearts. And the content. door's closed. Join the innovationists where the bounds of science are continuously pushed. Or join the counselors of Playcare whose diligence and care for our children will help shape a brighter future. Just you see. Now, every one of you has your like a part threat. in that future. So should you come back tomorrow feeling unhappy for where you are or what you've done? <laughs> worry not, for your supervisor is here and happy to listen. And should you come back years later? We'll be waiting. Your conscience finally getting the better of you. That's big teeth. May you descend into the dark and the dust, finding all that awaits you are incomprehensible mm. horrors, each hungry for your return, each eager that they might find you. Perhaps they'd smile at you from a shadow, their smiling mouths full of teeth and meat and plastic. Oh, I can't look away. Waiting and waiting patiently for their turn at a warm um, welcome. Um, perhaps they won't allow you such time to figure your place in the world. I can barely even wobble now. A world that's theirs now. Welcome home. Hey. Grandma, what big teeth you have. No wonder they need fucking loading screens. That was hyper realistic. Holy shit. Oh, that was supposed to happen. I'm back. I'm back, baby. And he lost his head. Huggy Wuggy needs a hug. I can give him a big hug. The hour of joy. I don't like the real children being used in this. It makes it extra creepy. Hallucinations. I mean, it feels like it with everybody, everything like closing around me. 
Maybe, I mean, I did run through all that red gas. Chipping balls because of the smoke? Yeah, probably. Bit too much of the pomu leaf. This one gets sliced through. Hello? Oh. This house is getting crazy. Mommy! No! Let me hear the voice. a daddy long legs oh you can't grab them anymore you used to be able to just rip them down damn okay half a sun half a sun we need to do both sides what do we do with both sides maybe i can just go through the door who knows daddy long legs i didn't know he was a thing damn oh that's my way warning Beyond, please use a gas max beyond this point. Red smoke in use. Seriously, what do they use the red fucking smoke for? <gasps> Can I ride this? Oh, get fucked, buddy! Okay, so I couldn't ride it, but that was still pretty cool. Or daddy long legs. I'm gonna make him call me daddy. Oh, when did, is this always open? Creepy gas sounds. Okay, we can't go that way. So I guess we've just got to run. Like this. Oh, it slowed me down so much. Cease. And I died. <laughs> what the fuck? Does Catnap have a wife? I honestly... Don't know. He seems like more of a creepy eldritch horror than the type to have a family. I guess the critters are his family. Critters are always fun. Please. So sad. Look at the baby. Wait, you have children? Man, everybody's getting some except for me. Okay, let's explore. Maybe we could actually find a gas mask. Cat Nap's wife is Cat Nip. Oh no. He's just addicted to substances. <laughs> now I feel bad for him. He's a tragic tale after all. No, I wouldn't be up here, right? It would be down in the hole. Because, I mean, if you miss it up here, that's a problem. It's got to be down in the hole. So, oh. I see. Oh, I hate this. Oh, I breathe funny. But that was just a toy. E. Huh? Wait. Um, car's broken. What the fuck? You know what? Fuck your car. I don't need your car. Just walk through like a fucking legend. Somehow, that worked. <laughs> there was no reason for that. It just felt good. How do you always break things? I'm a trained quality tester. I'm not, but I should be. Nice. Turn around. There's something evil on the other side. I know it. I know it. Hmm. Oh, creepy. <laughs> Bullshit, I can't nail that. Stupid invisible horse. <laughs> hey! 
purple cattle. So full of energy. Get some rest. All employers should adhere to the recommended four to five hours of sleep before work. Four to five hours? It's six to eight, my dude. Why are all the mini toys getting violated like that? Because they're weak. They're not strong enough to keep up with Poppy. Oh, do I go up? Really? It really looks like I should go up. Okay, you're sure, game. Go back the way I came. I just crawl under this. I swear to God, food shine. <laughs> you are the dumbest quality tester of all time. Hmm. Hmm. Hello there. Where is your VHS, sir? Shit, do I actually need to find the VHS? <laughs> Maybe it's under the table. Nope. Oh? There's something floating there in nothing space, though. Can't open those. The terrarium, so we can't look out the window. Or the wall. Or the sweat dripping down my Piachang! Hey yo. Yeah, chat. If you're trying to spoil things that haven't come up yet, you are gonna end up getting timed out. I don't care if you think you're being smart and doing the whole like, oh, something's gonna happen here. Moderators will time you up, so be careful. Huh? What's that? Did I hear puppy playtime? <laughs> Where's the puppy? But where's Dor? Dor can hang out with us and be the puppy. The puppy playtime, really fun. Especially this third one, holy shit. I'm kind of sad, like I wanted to die to that giant thing, but I didn't think it was going to instantly teleport me to a new area. So now I feel kind of lost. Wouldn't have died to it if I knew that was a thing. VHS, baby! But hey, field time, thank you so much for the raid. I hope you're having a good day. Welcome, welcome. What's up, sidekicks? Uh, if you didn't... Yes, <laughs> this is the third chapter of a horror game called Poppy Playtime. Uh, Poppy is this creepy little bitch. She kind of looks like Mari Din. Mari Din's not a creepy bitch, but this girl, definitely a creepy bitch. She's a tiny little porcelain doll who seems to have a human soul inside her, but may or may not be evil. She tried to help us for a little while, and then she tried to kidnap us, and then we had a train crash, and now we're being chased by a giant purple cat. It's actually kind of cool. And they made Mommy Longlegs sexy. So. She got weird in this third chapter. Let's watch a VHS. Subject is stable. Designated 1322. Two. Clear neural abnormalities were detected in his recent checkup. Though highly irregular, we've pulled him from the home sweet home just before lights out to perform. What are you doing with my friend? I. What are you doing out of bed? How did you get in here? It's kind of sick. Why did you take him away? I, I... Yes. Kevin is very sick. Very, very sick. Interesting. We want to make him better. But he can only get better if we take him to where we can provide proper I care. Hey, you catnap. Where are you? Well, do you really think you'll be okay? I should think so. We're good at what we do, son. We paid attention in school. Learned. And got our proper rest when we needed it. Just like you need it now, I should think. Come now. Let's get you on back to bed. Oh, okay. It's been a pleasure meeting you, Joseph. And I promise you, your friend will be alright. Unless... When you see him again, he'll have never been better. <laughs> they turned him into a toy. Sounds like they might have... Okay, with all the creepy, like, sounds I heard coming from behind me, I am not turning around. We're gonna... We're gonna get behind this bitch again. I know you're behind me. I'm gonna back my way up into here. Okay, I think we're good. <laughs> Just got kind of locked in. Everything's fine. We got some more lore. Anyway, what's up, Scythe Kicks? Welcome to the stream. <laughs> Feel free to head out if you don't want to watch a horror game, because I mean, yeah, that's what we do in here. Um, more than anything, I'm getting lost. 
Yeah, we're being pursued by a giant purple. Oh, they opened some doors for us. That's nice. We're being pursued by a giant purple cat who wants to eat us. This guy, Catnap, he puts you to sleep with evil red gas and then murders you. I hope you have a wonderful day, P.O. Chan. What was P.O. Chan streaming today? I didn't actually see today because I was too busy with my sponsorship stream. Help. Actually, that's held. Stupid children don't know how to differentiate their capital D's, tiny P's. Shinkansen. Oh, let's go. Is that is that a chillers one? Because I, I saw that that came out. There's like a train horror game. Uh, I didn't know if that was like... Iron Mouse? Oh, see, what the fuck are you doing here? It is a chillers game? Ah, okay. I'm sure it was good then. So, you guys have already experienced one horror game. Well, welcome. <laughs> We're in a slightly different, slightly more fucked up version. Chillers art games always have that, like, feeling to them where it's like... Can't really be scared because everything just looks so interesting. I need another battery. Row. Zero percent power. Night time. Purple. <laughs> think it's poppy. Wait. Which was poppy? Oh, this changed. Oh, one of these doors actually opened for once. Run. Hide, hide. <gasps> Robot, no! My cousin, the android. Okay. I don't want to do the glitch. What you looking at? Got some good hentai down there. Some of that masterpiece. Really want to see it. Give me the picture. Oh, she's staring at a picture of a child. And this room has two beds. That's the child! You were a human turned into a monster, aren't you? Okay, Kissy Missy, it's time. We've been playing this game for too long. Give me the keys. Give me the keys. I want to give me the keys. And that image has three kids together. Did I break something here? This doesn't feel right. I think the kid is her. Maybe it is her. I think she's this one, though. I think she's the sibling. I think that's her sister. I might be wrong, though. It might be her. She might just be dreaming of what she once had. Less kissable lips. Okay, bye, kissy missy. I'm gonna explore this first, and then I'll climb. Nope, already been this way. Up I go. Anything good? You returned. I did. She was taking care of the child? I, I'm genuinely just thinking they were siblings kind of thing. Like she's a human who's been replaced. But it could be. It could be that she's used to taking care of the children. That just happens to be her special favorite child. So she's still crying about it. I know when I steal this battery from the Mara pet, something's going to come running at me, so... Is that Kissy Missy's womb? It is, but she's gone. Uh-oh. Well, fuck. <laughs> you know what? I will take this. I need this. Nothing, really? Okay, I'm going to head on out. Is this Kissy Missy's? No, it isn't. They just all kind of look similar down here. Um. Everything's boarded up here. You want a battery? No. She do not want a battery. 
Okay, let's go power some shit up. Fifty percent power. Still nighttime though. Is this open? I have to find my own way out. Come on, man! Not like this. Is he missy? Ah, she's fine. Wait. Mm. Back of head kids. She's just trying to take care of the kiddos. Okay, follow this thing. Why are there tentacles coming out of the wall? How do I get... Oh. Maybe this way, actually. This is much more interesting. Goodbye. <laughs> Rudu ruler! My work here is done. Ooh, bathroom. Still can't see myself. Never know what kind of evil I am. I live to serve our angel of salvation. I'm sure. Yeah, I don't know, man. Mommy long legs on the things make them look so creepy. She's nice. She's only whipped us so far. Uh, oh, helped us so far. Well, that was a full-on Freudian slip. You are correct. So far, she only ever, like, pulled a stick for us to help us get forward. Those were very noisy footsteps. <laughs> Don't know what's running around over there, but I don't want to deal with it, so I'm going to go this way. I see you. What are you? You're a chair. <laughs> For me. Hi there. I'm Piggy Piggy. Let's eat. Okay. You like apples, too. I, the only thing I know about Applejack is she also has a Southern Belle accent. Roast beef? Delicious. That's kind of fucked up. You're a pig. Pretty close to a cow. Fuck yeah, but what about apples, though? Dude, elephant? Yum! Elephant? Jeez. Blade unicorn? Mmm! Th those are your friends. Th oh, I'm still hungry. Hey, what do you say you and I be friends? Okay, tell me more. Hi there, I'm Piggy Piggy. Oh. Let's eat. And don't threaten me with a good time and then ruin it. Hey, Huggy Wuggy. And Kissy Missy. And a green VHS player. Let's find out. More lore. Give me more lore. Where to green? Where to green? Where to green? It's got to be around here somewhere. In through here? Over here? Lots of green things to distract me. No green VHS. Do I need to change? Oh, apparently number one. Ah. Okay, now I have green energy. Where do I use it? Delicious. Okay, let's explore. We're clearly missing something. We. Okay, we didn't explore all the way around here, to be fair. Oh my fuck. Oh, that might be bad. <laughs> well, I'll never find the green VHS. <laughs> Shit, did not know there was a hole in the ground. Okay, on to the other side. Wait, is that where I came from? They're both lit up. I thought I only did one. I only did one. This one ain't lit up. I don't think I was supposed to fall down there. <laughs> um. Well, nothing to do but to commit. Arson. Do I have to go back underground and go the whole way around? Coming back was a mistake. You say so, sir.
screen strung up a robot. Arson time? That's the plan. I burned down everything. Nothing can hurt me. I really need to stop just walking places. It really tried to kill me with this gas. Wait, this is where I climbed up. How the fuck did I get on this side of this? Means I've never come through this door. Oh, this just leads back to the beginning as well. Oh shit. Did I actually break it by falling down? <laughs> That's not gonna be good. Hmm. I think I might have broken it. <laughs> I think I might have broken the game. That's okay. We'll just keep walking around. Eventually, we'll find something. There's the batteries. I did those. I turned on the power. I came over here. Went up there. Seems to be the only way I can go. So, let's do that again. Think you have to find the staircase again? Well, mission accomplished on that part. An hour of joy. Ah, uh, yes, 3 a.m. I know it well. There has to be a VHS around here somewhere. This place is too monotonous. There's too much going on. I wonder. Up and down, we're looping around. Hell yeah. Okay, so I have green energy power, but I don't know where to use that. Jump down there. There's nothing to power up with green energy. Unless I am just blind, which I might be. Did I fall down this one yet? I don't think I did. And I'm also kind of scared to go down there. <laughs> Things have not gone well when I've fallen down holes before. me so many views into rooms that I can't access as well. Why would they do that? Can I charge that with a green hand slab? Except I can't get in there. Probably not. There's a hole, there's a goal. <laughs> Honestly, I like the way you think. Okay, green energy power. Nothing else in this room. Not even a VHS, which is really aggravating. Fuck it. We'll go down second hole. Door number two. See where that one leads us. So not this hole. In fact, let me explore over here first. This was the bathroom. Board it up. Can't go through here yet. Doesn't look like there's anything interesting out there either. I... Was he always there? I don't remember him being there. So many locked doors now, man. Okay, let's go down this one and see what happens. Hello? So it's just more of the same. Yeah, it looks like it. the red poison area and this is the big room again am i going insane maybe i go down again maybe i can find a way to the left if i go down start from the beginning again no that just immediately leads us to there huh niji lost for real yeah no this is serious lost times <laughs> Two inches, two exits to that room. This one doesn't lead to anything interesting. That one leads back there. <laughs> Christ, this is 
confusing. Any ways up for a weary traveler? Oh. Well, shit. I don't even remember how to get back to where I was at this point. <laughs> shit. Oh, let's just go this way again. Do you guys know the definition of insanity? Because I do. My dumbass jumped when the moss slipped down. Good. The game is working. Okay, so I definitely fell down there once before. It has to be something up here. I just... can't fucking find what. I may need sack beating in a minute or two. <laughs> Okay, so it needs to be something on this side. Can I, wait, can I just electrocute? No. No way. Oh my, um, are you fucking serious? Okay, it was, I just had to look up. I just had to look the fuck up. Oh my God. Same thing happened to me. I'm glad I'm not alone. But man, that's embarrassing. Oh. Hey, you keep it. Now I need more green energy. Oh, it stays open. Nope, there it goes. Shit. <laughs> I'm sorry, what just did a thing now? Something went crazy over here, man. Bitchan, remember your tool? Yeah, but... <laughs> Doesn't mean I can see the ceiling any easier. Still have to tilt my head up to see ceilings. Ah, we're in this room now. Okay. Imagine if I broke it by not getting through this room fast enough. All the way back there. Oh, I barely got through that on time. Oh, they had babies too. Nope, don't like you, dude. So many cribs. One of you has the VHS tape, right? Really? I really thought they would. Hey, um, friend or foe? Oh. <laughs> Got your eyes. I'm gonna say he's friend. Oh, he follows me. Lovely. That wouldn't be creepy while you're trying to sleep. Anywhere you wander around the room, the creepy creature's eyes are always on you. Okay. Yeah, you keep doing you, sir. Do your little spinny spin. On the catwalk. On the catwalk, yeah. He does his spinny spin on the catwalk. This place is freaking huge. I wonder they have so many loading screens. So many vents too. I don't like that. I'm going to have to escape enemies in the vents. Oh, I hate it when it looks at you. I mean, that's all the time. Get wrecked, dumbass. My battery now. I don't even know what I want it for. I just don't want you to have it. It was easier than I expected. <laughs> okay, where do I take this green green? Into the vents, I think. 
A lab? Oh yeah, they're working on something down here. VSF? VSF would never capture me. Um. Oh, I had to crouch even lower. They have a cat head in that fridge. <laughs> that doesn't look great. Imagine they snatch it back. That would have been a fucking cool twist, honestly. I grabbed this and they just turned around and laughed at me. Oh, I'm on this side of the gate now. And the music got creepy. Sky's the limit. Why have you returned? Playtime. Because I love poppy playtime. It's such a fun time. Hey, Huggy Wuggy. Is this Huggy Wuggy's human room? The music's getting more exciting. We need energy. Okay, one down. Alu. Oh. Wait, no, I've already been here. Um. Shit. Well, now what do I do? <laughs> Even my electricity left me. I should sell the posters. The posters are honestly, yeah, very amusing to me. I just like the little bits that talk to the employees rather than the actual kids. <laughs> that shit's hilarious to me. Wee. I want to get out in there, man. Let me play with the beheaded cat. I'll always confuse me no matter how many times it's done. Oh, there's more rooms to enjoy. Hide. 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 Still haven't found the green VHS. Help. Yeah, I don't like that they have the giant fucking like gas or water valve in here. That was Huggy Wuggy's room. Why is the music going fucking nuts? Okay, now I know what I need to charge. Give to me. I need the energy. I need both of them. Stupid door with your stupid invisible walls. BGM changed? Yeah, it got exciting. That goes out way too fast for me to get that in time, doesn't it? Oh? Oh, it was so close. I think I can do that. Can you hold it? You might be able to extend. Nope. Need another battery. Wait, how did that run out of electricity so fucking quick? What? It's supposed to last for 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six. Okay. Go, 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 go. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, I didn't miss that time. Come on. You guys suck. So if I just keep trading it between the two? No. Okay, fine. I'll find a different way. I can open that up. What does that one do? Interesting. <laughs> There's also a creepy valve over there. Also, no spamming in chat. Goodbye for five minutes. Okay. Oh, oh wait, did I even, even try to open? Oh. Friends forever. 
till he hugs you to death. When he hugs you, he just won't let go. What if I bring this with... Oh, I can't take it out of the wall. This puzzle? I don't even know if this is a puzzle or just me being an idiot and not finding where I'm supposed to go. Honestly, just curious what that one does. Oh. That one charges. Hugs to death sounds like a good way to go. Yeah, but the better option is not going at all. Was that new then? Everything here looks the fucking same, man. No, nope, not a new event. It's just one of these ones again. That's okay. We'll find our way eventually. It's a green thing there. Did the staff have to do all these puzzles too? Uh, I'd like to hope so. I'd like to think that this wasn't just for torturing the children. It was for torturing all the employees too. Okay. So I can come out here. Which can't really do anything for me. Okay, let's try falling down left. Oh! Oh, I'm back here. <laughs> wow, shit. Okay, let's try falling the other way. Let's try falling down right. See what's behind door number two. Oh, this one looks extra creepy. Like something too big has been moving its way through here. But I'm sure it'll be fine. We're back. Oh, fuck me. We've just been going in circles. <laughs> We've been finding the air, the vents we couldn't reach before. Where the fuck is the final green thing? Hey, I can go upstairs, which can also get me out. Maybe I have to go up above? You got this, fool? I'm doing my buff. I do not know that I got this. It's this. It's this stupid door. How the fuck? I need a double charge. So how do I get a double charge? Unless... Can I just... No. Damn it. You should be able to. Just have two green hands at the same time. Um... That one's charged, so maybe I grab that one. That one's so fucking finicky to hit, too. Like this. Then we've done it slightly faster than before. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Oh! Hey, buddy. Oh, we solved it. <laughs> Interesting. A good day keeps the monsters away. <laughs> Does it though? Two hugs a day is better in every way. Okay, bring it in, brother. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Hugging forever. Hugs are non-stop. Do I get to consent at least? I'm gonna hug you until you pop. Huggy wuggy. <laughs> hug a day keeps the monsters away. Okay, that laugh was kind of evil, my friend, but that's okay. You didn't mean it. Can't help that his laugh sounds evil as shit. 
It's just part of who he is. He's doing his best. Hi. 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 Hide. Okay, something that just closed the door behind me, so... No jump scare. Shocking. Absolutely not huggy. But he wants to hug you until you pop. That's so cute. He wants to make it the best and last hug you ever have. Oh, they're dead. <laughs> Child is evil. So it's not even the evil toys. It's the children that went evil and killed everything. <gasps> oh, it's our friend. That nap. Careful. That's a lot of blood. That's a lot of gas. Well, might as well go where the gas is coming from. Hey, buddy. I saw you down there. You keep having your fun, silly cat. He's just a long, long cat. Doing what long, long cats do. <gasps> Finally! Okay, now I just need to get it all the fuck the way back. Hmm. Looks like I have to go the long way back. <laughs> Shit. Really hope there would be a shortcut. Long, long cat? Yeah, he is. He's a long, long cat. Oh. Let's not drop that. All around. Okay. Ah, I got the battery. Now where do I put the battery? Got the doodle do. Is it daytime now? I think it's daytime. I think we win. <laughs> Surprised we haven't seen many of his friends yet. I really thought they'd all be here. Running around. I guess she did say there was only one left. Where's my friend Ollie been? Hope they're okay. Poor tiny child. Dr. Doodle, don't move like in this place. I mean, they told me not to move once. I ignored them. It was fine. I honestly think it's just a suggestion rather than a command. Press E to use the turret. Oh, fuck, yeah. Aim turret at the power pole and pull the lever. Pull the lever, Kronk! Um, it's not working. Um, how do I leave this? There we go. Let me just twist that for you. No, not that. There we go. What button do you want me to press? Power pole and pull the lever. I, oh, do I just... Ah. Okay. I mean, I guess that works. Can I charge myself? Oh. I want to hit that one. Okay. So now we're getting turrets and all kinds of weirdness. I can't even aim you that far. Okay, you're probably going to aim there. The gas? Don't worry about the gas. Gas ain't bothering us anyway. Gas never bothered us anyway. Wait, where would I even aim this? Hmm. Okay, so we somehow need to make it go higher. This does not, but fuck it. Let's pull it. See what happens. That did nothing useful. <laughs> As anticipated. Oh, that's why. I have to twist you too. Probably there, but then I have to lower that. Oh, I have to disconnect it from the side. 
Sorry, your job here is done. Thank you. Did that hit? It hit and it did nothing. Wait, what the fuck? Um. I thought that would open the door. Um. I. Err. Um. Maybe I have to activate them both, but the second one will. Oh. There's another one there. That disconnects the second one when that opens. Ha! Huh. Okay. Puzzle confuses many? Yeah, we'll figure it out. Okay. So that does number one. Does this just say number two? It just says number two, so why the fuck didn't that open? There's a second wire running from it that goes over to here. Right, um, do this again. So that sends it over there. Unlocks the thing. Came from there. I don't get it. Kind of comes from this thing. Um, wait. Can I just do this? No. <laughs> but imagine, though. There's another wire that leads this way. It just disappears into this tangled mess. Huh. What the hell? Okay, so that's done the hand for that one. Okay, we're doing this one more time. Okay, that'll break that. There's got to be something else over here then. over there hits it nice and high there's got to be something I'm missing something tiny oh wait can I use those to block oh fuck I'm an idiot okay now I get it um pull this block this Now it shouldn't be able to fully close. Okay, I thought that was really smart, but apparently <laughs> not. What the fuck? It's definitely this much. I mean, I could redirect that. I don't get what else it wants me to do. Um. Why is that a thing? Is that for locking it in place? Need help? Nah, if I need help, I'll ask. Don't worry. Stop trying to grab that thing. Oh, maybe. Oh. Why are you not aiming properly anymore? So that could lock that, but I, yeah. I'm even more confused because that doesn't even like keep it up. I 
I can keep it trapped down. But I can't keep it up. Huh. But I guess keeping it trapped down is all I really need to do. Keeping it real is what we do. Keeping it real is what we do. Okay, that was very, very fucking confusing. Got to get through there before it locks me out. I get it. Kind of. Yeah, yeah, those environmental puzzles kind of kick my ass. Oh man, these are the things that deliver new hands. Why don't I get any new hands? We got there eventually, chat. No worries. So far, we haven't needed any back seating. It's been a lot of going in circles. Ooh, elevator. To death? Where am I anymore, man? I... I don't even know where I am. I opened that door with the sun on it. More loading. <laughs> Nevertheless, he persisted. Yup. I was full of determination. Oh, we we done? Hey, Ollie. Oh, hey. Yes. No, no, let go. Yeah, let go I of me. Didn't do anything wrong. We're actually here to help. Wait, you're actually a good guy? This place makes her tense. I'm glad that Ollie could help you get this far. He's the reason we found you at all. Why did your eyes get all bloodshot? They didn't used to be like that. Kissy? I know! Kissy Missy held me down. I thought I was gonna Looks get like a kissy. The train crash hurt us both. You've been through so much. You can't say that when you just did the whole like you'll never you leave. An explanation. Yes, please. Unless she just wants me to set all the souls okay. trapped in here for you. Be okay. Maybe she's being nice to Kissy Missy. Why did Kissy Missy suddenly decide to grab me too? She's been so pleasant so far. Ah, <gasps> Poppy secret. Hey, you go first. I trust you about as far as I can throw you. Which is pretty fucking far! But still. Aw, she's hugging herself. Okay, bye, Poppy. Have fun. I mean, she probably killed Ollie, right? Because, I mean, Ollie hasn't been talking to me anymore. Okay. But I'm bringing mommy long legs. Shit, you can't bring those with you anymore. Okay. Listen, I'm not your enemy. But I can't just let you leave. What's happening down here is bigger than all of us. And I need you. So we can get revenge on those monsters who've tortured you. Me? Tortured us. They didn't act alone. Am I a toy? They're disciples of the original. The prototype. Not the prototype. The one who honest? murdered so many. Sure. Um. 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 Prototype knows we're coming by now. If you try to escape, he'll kill you before you ever reach that front door. Did not consent He's to Kissy Missy being inside in me. God awful case for so long. You have no idea of the things he's done. Let me help you kill him. Let me help you save everyone. We've all seen you. How capable you are. You killed Huggy. You killed Mommy. I killed them? You freed me. I guess I you did kill Mommy. She went into a grinder. Yes. Catnap is coming. He's the final obstacle the prototype has placed against us. We can't stay here. Keep yourself safe. Ollie will call you. Um, where are you going? Wait, why can't I just stay with you? Hey! This is bullshit! Fuck you, Poppy! Uh, 
Ah, what do you want, kid? Hey, hey, it's me again. Hey, it's hey, me hey. Like explained everything now, and she turned on the dome's backup power. Now the plan from here is pretty simple. We need to restore power to the gas production zone. First, go back to the home sweet home building you were just in. I don't want to. Oh, oh, this is it. She just peaced out. Yeah, she was just like, okay, my work here is done. She didn't do anything, but she sure thinks she did. It said plug it in underneath the statue, right? I don't like how creepy the music's getting. I'm just going to say it. Sounds fucking evil. I don't like that I'm helping these twisted characters. Oh, under the statue, right. Where to? <laughs> they didn't really tell me where to plug it into. This? Home sweet home? Awesome! Look at that! Remember that generator you turned on inside of home sweet home? Uh -huh. That was a backup generator for just that building. Oh. And every building should have one. Now you've just taken home sweet home's backup power and routed it here. So I have to do We're the other three. School, school, let me go to school. Okay, playhouse it so, is. Your best bet is probably the school. Playhouse, I heard playhouse. Oh, fucking keys. Fuck, this is bull. Let me do it in my own way. Okay, let's go to the school. Maybe we'll find some fun for goddess stuff. Ollie talks like Dora. They really do. Donde esta la school? That looks like a school. Well, any building looks like a school, <laughs> realistically. That could also be a school or a law house. I don't really know. This is not lit up. Probably not the school, but we'll give it a go. <gasps> it is the school. Yay. Donde esta la biblioteca? That's a lot of blood. Oh, and the loading. <laughs> you hate school? Doesn't everybody? Especially if you went back as a teacher, then it's even worse. <laughs> Reading is fun. You're a dog. You can't read. Friends forever. I wonder if the dog would feel bad about <laughs> Just be like, okay, oh, I wish I could. Turn on the generator, leave, and plug the school's power cord into the center. Be careful in there. I don't think I can connect to you on that side of the dome. And you won't be alone. There's someone hmm. else in there, too. They're not your... Enemy? They're not my enemy. They're my friend. When, but why does this look like a husband hotel character? <laughs> School rules, but this is Mr. Light speaking. Oh, you're Mr. Please Light. Please excuse the interruption. Students, remain in your seat until the bell has rung. Okay. And no going in the halls without a hall pass. Um, Mr. Light's definitely gonna wreck my shit, isn't she? <laughs> Rule number one: Pay attention. Rule number two, do your homework. Rule number three, play fair. Rule number four, respect authority. Rule number five, stay in your seat until the bell has rung. Welcome to math. Be smart like an elephant. One plus two equals three. Yeah, she's going to murder me. I'm excited. Homework. Yeah, they better not send me with any homework. Done enough for one day. Just trying to live in here, man. Okay, yeah, that one needs power. Here you go, my friend. Nope, not going that way yet. Thanks, but I ain't stupid. Joy! Bloody handprints and finger marks. <gasps> the kids left their bags here. Fools, now I get all the packed lunches. Mm -hmm. Sandwiches. 
terrible tuna mayonnaise sandwiches. Delicious, sir. Oh, that's covered in blood. Yay. And all the clothes, and that's a lot of flies, and all oh, that's definitely body part. Wow. They're getting more and more gruesome as this goes on. What the fuck? Okay, let's take door number one. Boop. Oh, I can't open that one. Damn, even the school is fucking huge. Moldy sandwiches? This is extra fiber, man. This is extra vegetables that grow onto your food for you. Why would you not want some extra algae? Greens are always good for you. Okay. There's where I need the batteries. <gasps> There's a battery. How do I get in, though? Hmm. Only time will tell. Definitely gonna fall down there at some point. <laughs> there is a toxic foo. I mean, anything is toxic if you ingest enough of it. Medicine is just poison if it's not controlled properly. So, nah, you're right, though. <laughs> Run! Where is my teacher? This is not a very good lesson when there is no teacher. Meh. Screw it. I'll put it in. Um, I think I should put it in the left one because that's closer to this weirdness. I did nothing. <laughs> Shit. Okay. I think I also have to charge it. Maybe if I charge it now, it'll do something. Bum, 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 bum. Wee! There's no way I'm getting this. Oh, maybe. No, it runs out just in time. Okay. If I smash this window. <laughs> if I could, that'd be nice. But they don't want me doing that. Okay, I've been this way. I've been that way. Oh, that's the beginning. Okay. So right is where we put the batteries in. Left is new stuffs. Nope, because this is also closed off. Interesting. It's one of those things where I have to look up again because I swear to God. <laughs> it's a self-taught. Then what's the point in the teacher being branded onto everything? Hello? Teach? S -s -s Sensei? Um. S -s Sensei? What are you up to? There's lots of vents up there. Has to be some way to get up. I'm sorry, was that a giant green creature looking at me through the window? Might have imagined that. <laughs> Honestly, I can't even tell. Okay, there's this room, which does nothing at all. Has a creepy camera. But otherwise, nothing at all. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. Is this room where I got the battery? see anything useful in here. Although this room is very poltergeisty, it keeps making noises every time I try to walk out of it. Wants my attention, if nothing else. One of these areas back here? Maybe I can do the electricity. Maybe I just missed it up. Certainly wouldn't be the first time I'd fucked up a thing like this. 
No, that runs out just in time. They fucking planned that. Hey. Um. Want an apple? Apple a day makes a teacher happy. Am I right? Where'd she go? Um. Wait. I recognize you. Yes, I remember. You used to work here. Mm -hmm. How are you? Alive. Who, hmm? who says I'm alive, huh? Barb? Oh. Barb says you're looking for your co-workers. Barb? Catnap wouldn't like that you're here. You should leave. For your own safety. Okay, I don't know who's doing her voice acting, but she's nailing it. She's like threatening it all the fucking time. <laughs> I don't know, but you should leave. Immediately. On we go. I said no such thing. They just said you did, Barbara Bon. Are you calling Miss Delight a liar? Can't say that about Miss Delight. It's Miss Delight. Damn, I really thought there'd be a secret up there. <laughs> okay, further on we venture. She's kind of, you know, Tuscaru. Yeah, she is. I'm not even going to lie. <laughs> okay, I think I must have to fall down here. I think this is a different room. Oh, I'm in the cage. Yay. This is exactly where I want to be with my life. Hey, Miss Delight, you fucked up. I already got what I needed. I can be on my merry way. You just continue with your fun, creepy, yandere voice acting. You're not going to stop me. Okay. Seemed a bit too easy, but okay. How about now? I'm being a naughty student. I didn't stay in my seat. Well, okay. Let's find the yellow VHS. Yellow. Yellow. I missed the light in the cage. Honestly, if I could lock her in the cage, that would be the perfect. Hey! Get back here! Okay, now how did that happen? <laughs> Four minutes? Wait, why is there a countdown? <laughs> uh, okay. Flaming espresso, it's literally one of my rules to not tell me that you're leaving. So just for the future reference. But have fun. Oh, God. I, I thought I was done, but I guess not. What does letter say? Note four. Holy shit, I've missed a bunch. The pit in me house for food. I can't think about anything other than how hungry I am. Hardly have the strength now to pick myself off the floor. Barb speaks to me though. She gives me strength. I found that if I stand still, completely still, everyone thinks I'm dead. Barb says I need to eat and that the other teachers could never see me coming. Anything to stop the howling. Oh, she's a sexy psychopath cannibal. Let's fucking go. She ate the other teachers. I don't know why that made me so happy. <laughs> Is this the pig? I think, I mean, they literally said it's a teacher. She ate the other teachers. So I think it's Mr. Light. Mr. Light ate the other teachers. Oh, we found note four. I haven't found one to three yet. <laughs> yeah, I should leave that open. Just so I know I've been there. Do not enter. But what if? I need this. Mr. Light, could you open that for me? It would be so delightful. Okay. 
So. Is this door locked? Yeah. How the fuck do I get in this room? Some light might be handy. How did I miss that? What the fuck is wrong with me? <laughs> yep, that'll probably do it. She's a 10, exactly. She's a 10, but she eats people, which, you know, makes her an 11. Honestly, that's just good for the environment. I'm coming. Don't leave me. Mr. Light? You're not a good listener, are you? You're a lot like the other humans in that way. Aww. I wonder if your screams will sound like theirs too. <laughs> I look forward to finding out. Yeah, this is instantly better than mommy long legs. God forbid a lady has hobbies. Exactly. I support women's rights and women's wrongs. Let them eat cake. And also other teachers. Honestly, that gives you good job security, too. You eat any teacher who tries to come for your job, you're never getting fired. What are they going to do? Hire one of the corpses? <laughs> nice try. Not very good at teaching children. Not sure about this one, Futan. <gasps> Yay, my own Mr. L <laughs> yeah, she's definitely has been coded. Hello, students. Find my sisters and I to learn facts across a variety of subjects. Press my button to hear some facts on anatomy. Oh, that button. Did you know that there are 60,000 miles of blood vessels in the human body? No, I didn't. For comparison, the Earth around the equator is almost 25,000 miles. Wow, that's actually a lot of blood vessels per human. The smallest bone in your body is the states in your ear. Still, damage it, and you risk losing your hearing. I feel like she's going to attack me from behind. <laughs> Want to learn more about human organs? Sure. Pay close attention in class. Uh huh. We're going to do some dissections. Hello, students. Find my sisters and I to learn facts across a variety of subjects. Yep. Press my button to hear some facts on anatomy. The biology one wasn't very in depth, though. Did you miss the VHS tape? I have missed several VHS tapes, and at least three notes, possibly more. Ah, oh, fuck, we're doing this again. <laughs> okay, we have one source of electricity. Oh, right, I forgot about these things. I have to do this. It's been a while since we had a simple one like that. Oh, hey! Thank you. New objective run. But... Hey. Are you like a weeping angel? Oh, you are. <laughs> well, oh. <laughs> She's like a weeping angel. <laughs> it's time to harvest. Well, the body is still fresh. Ah, she's going to eat me. And then we're going to be one forever. For all eternity. Oh no, she's hot. I like her. Right. Oh, I have to do this again. I like the glowing eyes too. <laughs> you got a pretty funny looking face right now. I'm going to be honest with you, Mr. Light. What is this you've got? Holy shit! Is that a spiked mace made out of fucking rubber bands and pencils? You are crazy in the best way. I respect that. Okay, so. Probably going the way she came from, honestly. I like how the light in her eyes follows me too. That's sick. No kissy for her? I mean... <laughs> Booty. <laughs> okay, she's actually a little terrifying. Um, She didn't like me slapping that booty. But I'm going to do it again. Oh, 
Um. Could we maybe? I want to be back in the cage again. Yeah, okay, that door is open. She may bite your lips off. That's part of the fun. Also, she apparently has sisters, so. That's got to come up at some point. I'm trapped. <laughs> no, no, no. Don't break line of contact. Come on. Come on. Come on. There you go. Just wanted you in the light. She's fast. Only if you don't pay attention to her. She just likes attention. I get it. We all need to feel respected. Something about the tattered skirt and like the school uniform on top. I don't know, man. I'm a fan. Why she feel fast even in a dress? She ripped the dress up so she could have more mobility. She's not actually that fast. Oh, the evil laughing is not helping. Hey. What if I wrap you up with my arm? Oh, I can do that. Oh, Jesus. Okay, that actually got me. Oh, and now my arm's broken. Could you move on a little bit? You're in the way. Thank you. I'll be right back. Ah! Hmm. Need to grab this. You want some electricity? Okay. Now we're ready. We're locked in. No stopping. She can't catch me. She probably could catch me, actually. Pretty damn fast. Where are your sisters? What is this bullshit? You promised me a menage a how many? Duh. I expected many sisters. Being left wanting. Oh, did she eat her sisters? She might have eaten her sisters. Run. I'm currently in the process. Imagine if she stops caring when you're looking at her. That'd be cool. Oh, oh, um. I just have, uh, okay, that door was locked anyway. Cease. Oh, now I just need to get beyond her again. Um. A lovely cheat. Okay, that's cheating. That's cheating. The research must stay buried. Nobody may leave. She ate them all like the note said? Yeah, I mean, I guess she did say her sisters would teach you, so I guess they were the other teachers. There's only one left. No, come on, really? Fuck up one time and the game's over. What if I block you, though? What are you going to do about that? Okay, I was just curious. To be fair. <laughs> You're not wrong, game. You're not wrong. Get up. Okay. It's time. Let's do this seriously. I wanted to see if it would, like, glitch out when she, you know, was all inside me and stuff. Okay, come on. Give me a battery. Bye. Where is... Ah. I see. <laughs> Don't you laugh at me. I'm not even doing anything funny yet. Wait, where do I need to slap this electricity? I missed. Cease. And assist. Don't laugh. Doing my best. I don't like. 
weeping angels. Come on, come this way. There you go. Come on in. As a good girl. Okay, you stay right there. In fact, you know what? No, you come back here. Perfect. Now I don't have to deal with your shit. I have to deal with her shit. Oh, fuck. Open the damn door. Okay, you know what? I'll go out and open it. I'll, I'll cut. Um. Um. Yeah. <laughs> she got me in the corner. Fuck. But Futan, I thought you liked her. Yeah, she's a bit stabby, though. Don't be selfish. Look, man. I told you. I'm versatile. Sometimes I want to be stabbed. Sometimes I want to do the stabbing. Need a partner who's respecting that, man. She carbid on you. With a knife. <laughs> I don't think that counts as a carbid on. <laughs> That's a murder. Not the time for smashing. It's always the time for smashing. Okay, she's pretty fast, but she's not as fast as me. Okay, this time open this door. Closed doors are evil. Oh, there you are. High five. Don't laugh. That wasn't a joke for you. That was a joke for the confidants. Bye. Cease and desist. Where's Sonny Briscoe when you need him? Um. Okay, what was my next move? Apparently through here. Those arms really do extend so much. Uh, okay, remember our lesson from last time. Don't go too far. Bye. <laughs> Can you lock her in? Nah, they stay open. Where is she? Oh. You made a hole in the wall. Clever girl. And while I am locked in here. Not so clever boy. Okay, I think I just need to go out there. You know what? I'm going to lead her around first. I don't trust this whatsoever. I know how hard it is to open doors in this game. Yeah, now you stay there. Right there. That's perfect. Wait, where the... F what? Oh, she went to the other doorway. Okay, that's fine. That's not fine! Open the goddamn door for the love of everything. Oh, I'm back here? What? Wait, what? How? Where the fuck did she go? Ma'am, that is cheating. You know what? Fuck you. I'm going back that way. Oh, she's being tricky now. She's making her way through the holes. Weird. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. No, no, no. Stop. I can see you. I can see you. That's cheating. I have to fucking power up that one. Okay. So even if you see her through a window, she doesn't count it. She just keeps moving. I really have to get the electricity from this fucking far? Are you serious? That's actually kind of insane. Okay, so uh, ba, 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 ba. Somewhere around here. There. Okay, she came from that way. Let's let her approach a bit. Perfect. Okay. Well, I go charging this way. Oh, shit, fuck, 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 shit, shit, fuck. Okay, she's in my way. Um, now what do I do? Uh, um, kind of out of options. <laughs> I just think it's bullshit. She can kill me while she should be frozen. I mean, if I'm staring at her, she shouldn't be able to kill me. She should be all shy and adorable.
where 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 is she where is she did she circle around she didn't circle around okay good go for chan go for chan go for chan where was it where was it where was it where was it oh thank jesus i see you quit it bad really wish those did close behind you that would make this so much easier oh she's moving faster now um Okay, that's the one I need to charge. Where can I charge it from? I need to charge two. This is bullshit. She's zooming. Yeah, she is. Okay, there's one charger. Where the... Where... What? Where... Huh? Oh, she's right there. She's just glitching. One down. Two down. Bye, Mr. Light. It has been an... Oh, fuck. Um, I'm sorry, where the fuck am I going to get that many batteries? This is craziness. What the? F okay, this will open this one door. Didn't hit it. Okay, let's just carefully go around her. How long is this fucking scene, man? If I die, are they going to reset me from the start? Jesus. Okay, use one battery to get in here, which will obviously have two batteries hidden somewhere, right? Something glowing over there. One battery. Ah, oh, fuck you. Fuck you. Okay, one more battery down. And I take the old one. Oh, can I lock her in here? Yeah, no! Bye. <laughs> what are you gonna do? What are you, what are you gonna do? What are we... Oh. <laughs> That's what she's gonna do. Um, Do I take the exit or do I take the other door? I mean, I gotta find out what's in the other door. Oh, she's so close. So close. So scary. Got your answer? Yeah, apparently. Maybe I should have just taken the exit. But what if there's secrets in here? Lore secrets. Or living sisters. Okay, there's a green thing here. Do I have to like charge my hand to get the Oh my god, fuck me. Okay, I think I have to charge hand. Fuck you. Why did you happen to go into my way? Oh, God. Okay. That actually got me. I didn't expect her to move that quickly. I'm just going to wait for this to run out. I think I need the charged hand and the two batteries. Probably once I get through the next door, I'm going to need the charged hand for something. <laughs> Karma. <laughs> Let me enjoy my murderous wife. Is this just staying charged for... Oh. Oh. For some reason, this is staying charged forever. Nope, it stopped as soon as I was ready to do something. Because of course it did. Yeah, yeah, I know. You're crazy. Bye. It was nice knowing ya. Wanted secrets. I didn't mean... Oh my god, what the... Hey, hey, hey! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Um, she stopped giving a fuck. She stopped giving a fuck. Oh! No, my wife! Oh. Mr. Light, it didn't have to be this way. 
I respect how hard it is to raise children. You did a good job. An apple a day keeps the children happy. Rude. Rude. Goodbye. My love. I wonder if her body disappears. Nope. It stays there. That was terrifying. That actually was. The whole, like, weeping angel gameplay was really fucked up. Up, oh, you smashed her, foo. Good job. Do I feel good about it, though? No, I do not. Man, she was my only friend in here. Other than the creepy child monsters that keep trying to murder me. Your wife is gone. That's fine. I'm better alone anyway. I'm Hoppy Hopscotch. Wanna try hopping to the moon with me? No. All three with me. One, fine. Two, two, three! three. <laughs> Didn't get very far, did we? Fuck you. Again. Okay. One, One two, two, three! three! Nope. Still didn't make it. Okay, maybe third third time's the go though. Listen, this won't stop until we make it to the moon. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh. One, One, two, two. No, no, don't look at your feet. None of that matters. Again, again. How did you know? Um Jump! 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 I'm Hoppy Hoppy. <laughs> <laughs> Kind of, does it like reload or does it like close? Oh, it does just reload. Is the dead body still there? If so, that's attention to detail. They closed it! And it's open and my wife is alive somewhere. She pushed it off of herself. She's doing fine. See chat? Miss Delight is incredible. She's out there to teach some more kids. She's doing just fine. I didn't kill her. I just put her to sleep for a little bit. There's nothing wrong with that. As long as you have consent. It's fine. Okay, where are we actually going? Wait, no, wait. Genuinely, where, where am I actually? I mean, it reloads when I get here, so. Oh, press three to swap hands. I have a gun. Oh. Oh my god, you are so lucky. I didn't have this like 30 seconds ago, woman. Okay, I have a fire gun. That's awesome. It goes a pew pew. <laughs> um. Okay. Time for arson. Batman? Robin? Alfred? Okay, the VHS has to be near here. Come on, man. I can't be missing all these. Oh, right the fuck there. <laughs> oh, that's a claw. You stupid, clucky elevator. What was that, Richie? Nothing, nothing. Let's just get this shipment dropped and go. Hello. Oh. My name oh. Is when you look around. It's just floating in midair. <laughs> I take it you're not a fan of this place, are you? Nope. Never liked the feel of it. I mean, don't you think these kids deserve some oh. real sunlight instead of floodlights and painted skies? Hell, we're not even allowed to talk to these kids. Isn't that... Uh, <clears throat> Sorry, Stu. <laughs> Sorry? That doesn't sound like the rich I know. Well, I'm trying to stop being so pissed off all the time. My wife says I'm a lovely man, but I gotta control my temper. So, I'm doing it for her. <laughs> You're just different, Rich. Honest to a fault. But... I always like that about you. Yeah. <laughs> well, you're one of the few. 
Hmm. You know, Richie, with my retirement coming up, hmm, they've been pushing hard for me to choose my replacement. Oh, you're going to I've choose little Richie? About giving the role to you. But, uh, really? Yeah, really. Nothing official yet, but I think there's a decent guy beneath all that gruff. An honest, hardworking man. You prove me right? Uh, let's say your chances are pretty good. I wonder if Richie became catnap. Jeez, I don't know what to say. I, I'm just glad to see not everyone in this place has it out for me. Not everybody, Rich. Damn it, so close to a giant not penis. Everybody. Not everybody. Just most of them hate you. This is so cool. <laughs> this is low-key really wholesome yeah that was a surprisingly chill tape it was just two a guy taking a kid under his wing and being like you know what you're good at your job okay looking for a replacement do you want to be batman because this is totally fucking batman's cave yay i missed that one work area what um I mean, what do you want me to do with this? That doesn't really help me much. Oh, you want me to go all the way down there? Okay. Yay! We. It's a good thing I've got a jetpack. It never actually makes any noise or anything, but I'm guessing that was just their way of saying, hey, don't worry about fall damage anymore. Oh, no, I need the fucking green one. I don't like switching between them. Too much for my tiny baby brain to handle. Okay, that's apparently not an edge you're supposed to jump. <laughs> oh, death approaches. <laughs> Fire gun. Sorry, distractions. Um, ba doop ba doop. Oh, come to think of it, I can use the fire gun to see where I want to go. Damn it, Fucha. <laughs> now I'm thinking with Portos. Kind of sad, though. People think Richie is the one who got the motive to throw the throw burning section you were in on the previous chapter. Aww. Is there any, like, actual proof of that? Because that would kind of suck. After being told, like, yeah, I want you to do my job. You're, you're an awesome kid. Just be like, nah, I'm kidding. Demotion. You can burn the used things. Okay, now we're going to be able to see better. Interesting, interesting. So way up there. Creepy crack in the wall. And a cri That is also death. <laughs> Apparently the tiny crack in the floor is death as well. <sighs> Your hand really be multitasking? Yeah, it gets kind of busy. Why does it face me backwards every time? Pew. 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 How is that death? I don't know, man. <laughs> there are some areas they just don't want you to walk on. And thus, you must die. Wee. Okay. Can't go that way. Well, it doesn't make any locked sound either. Open up! VSF da. Peo agaro! Eh, got green electricity. Are you fucking. Okay, you could see how that was blocked from my view, though, right? I mean, I. I'm... Really? Right the fuck there. Okay, I powered something. <laughs> what did I power? Oh, that'll be useful. Wee! Wee! Ow. My head. And my thinky parts. My thinky parts are hurt. Oh, shit. I have to do this quickly. Oh, okay. Okay, that's, that's fine. We can do that. 
Cool. Zo. Oh, that's the gun. Fuck. Already fucking it up. Ah, what the? No. Okay. Why'd the hand point that way if it didn't mean to go that way? <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, fucking war puzzles. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I got spinny things. I got so many spinny things. Um, this is fine. Okay, okay. Thinky parts, you're so cute. Unfortunately, my brain don't do good at the thinky parts. <laughs> but hey, okay, okay. I hope you're having a good day. We've been having a wonderful time at Poppy's Playtime. Haven't we, chat? Yes. A brilliant time. Okay, that's good. Bum, bum. We have to spin that one. Oh, God. Have you played this game yet, Uki? It's a pretty interesting horror game. I quite like the movement of it. Ah, uh, that's the wrong thing. Fuck, I keep pressing F instead of E. Which aren't even close together. I'm just weird. Okay, I think that's all done. Now I just need to go find a cannon. Oh, there's a cannon. I just have to get back to there. Come on, cannon friend! Wee! Interesting, he says. It's definitely interesting. Okay, cannon buddy. I aim you there, and then you're gonna pop the fuck off. Ah. Well. About everything being done. <laughs> I didn't do the first one. There we go. And now we should be good. Pull the lever, Kronk! Ooh, look at it do a whole freaking loop. <gasps> That's so sick. Okay, I think it's it's doing whatever it's supposed to be doing. What? Um. The elevator left without me. Um. Do I have to fucking race it over? Are you shitting me? <sighs> okay. Okay. <laughs> now I've just watched other people play it. I know the whole story. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Story is definitely interesting. Definitely once I'm done with this part today, I'm going to look into like everything I missed. I'm going to look at one of those videos that breaks down all the things that you don't naturally see. Maybe I can just fall down. Nope. Invisible wall. Shit, I do have to race it. Okay. But yeah, I want to see like all the things I've missed. I've been missing so many VHS tapes. As unfortunate as it is. Oh, there we go. Can I grab that? Yeah, I can probably grab that from over there, actually. Wee. Wee. I, I can. I'm dumb. I'm just grab it from here. Go, 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 go. Okay. <laughs> Time to watch the theory. I wonder if the game theorists have done a lot about this. Well, they have. One and two were out for ages. I'm gonna get my Bernie hand out. I don't... Oh, hey, kitty. He's religious. That's adorable. What'd you make over there? Pile of corpses? Old friends? Got him right in there. <laughs> oh, he gone. Um. Ooh. He's praying. Yeah, that's what it looked like to me as well. I don't like the idea of. 
I don't know why. I just don't like these creatures. The idea of them finding a religion just seems wrong to me. I don't think it's going to be a religion that suits my lifestyle. You praying to the prototype? Oh, <gasps> wait, that's PJ. Oh, man. When did he collect PJ's body? I don't see any other ones that I killed, though. I don't see mommy long legs or my wife. God damn it. Or Huggy Wuggy. But he got PJ's corpse. Did I even kill PJ? I think I just outran PJ. Maybe that's it. Maybe he just killed PJ himself. Looks like a shrine. Yeah, it definitely has like a religious feeling to it. Danger. Authorized access only. Playhouse. Don't mind if I do. Oh, God. It's all kinds of creepy stuff hidden out in the darkness. Love how I got this and immediately thought, Gun! I'm gonna murder people! It turned out I'm more using it just for illuminating some areas. <laughs> you never killed PJ? And that one looked smaller than the actual PJ. Maybe that's because he ripped off all his legs. And most of his body parts. Mommy Longlegs killed PJ? Oh, poor PJ. Honestly, he was one of the creep. No. <laughs> Be gone, small child. This is how I wish I could deal with certain people in my life. Hi, I'm Bobby Bearhug. Hey. Do you know how much I love you? Is it this much? Oh, that looks sick. Oh my god. Yo, I made you look so much better. Yeah, I have a shiny tail too. Now you're a Charmander. I love you to the moon. Aw, why not to the sun? I'm crazy about you. Yeah, you, you're sounding kind of yandere. I'm lost without you. Oh god, here it goes. Now you're gonna want to leave a toothbrush at my place. I've been lost a long time. Now I feel bad. Tell me more. Please take me with you this time. Aw, you're not a yandere. You're just a little baby. Okay, you can come. Please, you won't leave me, will you? I, I don't think I can bring you. They got rid of that after part two. I would. There you go. I gave you a bigger smile. A very bright smile. Oh, is this a VHS player? That's where I came from. Poor child. I mean, do they not deserve it? Are they not one of the evils? To be fair, I don't know if they're really evil. Poppy is either trying to set something loose that's incredibly fucking evil, or maybe she's genuinely trying to keep things locked up down here. Maybe she's trying to free other people that have been locked down here for evil reasons. Why does that just stay dark? That's creepy. I don't like that. <laughs> oh, yeah. We are definitely in the playhouse now. Hey. How you doing, buddy? Ba -ba -ba Bang. <laughs> hey, where'd you go? Come back. I'm not done with you. How many do you want? I can do this all day. Ah, that's what I thought. Bang. <laughs> it's so cute. Uh, bad dog. <laughs> they bite. Oh, they definitely do. They charge up their little chompers for a while. No way they do that without biting. Hey, not going that. Oh. Bang. Bang. Finger gun go bang. They opened their mouths and I just started blasting. Like bang, kapow. Why don't you growl at me? You're already burning. Get out of here. They look like combinations of mistakes and maripets. Cease. Be gone. Oh, hey, 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 hey. Yeah, back it up. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, there are so many now. Um, 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 oh, there's a door there. 
Get out of here, kill me. Get out of here, Mario Pet. Kill me, cease. I can't open the door. Um, 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 okay, there's two ways that way. Yeet! This one's just full of dead bodies. This one's where I came from. <laughs> Why are they laughing like that? I, I don't get the joke. Well, well, it's the, there's so many. Jesus Christ, get gone. Get the fuck. Cease. Uh, 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 bad puppy. Bad puppy. It's gonna be on my way. You just be on yours. I could start a fire. I don't think they like light. The fan mascots are attacking. <laughs> When the Niji Sanji fans go feral. Oh, hey, buddy. This is where I came. Fuck. This is where I came from. Now, if they go back through the shit tons. Silly little mascot creatures. Oh, shit. They are everywhere. Hey, guys. Can I move this? No. Um. It's a lot of mascot characters. You sure you ain't got somewhere better than me? That's not somewhere I can go. Did I come from here? Oh, shit. Fuck you. Ah, ah. Bad. Bad. We sure we can't open that door? Yeah, it doesn't even make a sound. Ah. God, this is the worst. It looks so cute, though. No, they... Oh, how many times did I walk past this? <laughs> they looked cute. And then they started opening their mouths. Shit got real. Just like children. They seem cute. Then they make noises. And smells. And you have to deal with that. Cease. Hmm. Why is it so dark here? Oh, that one just didn't work for some reason. <laughs> the idea of them being depraved fans is hilarious, <laughs> truly. I like the idea. At least there's no sheepies, so there's no confidants. Am I back on a train? Cease. Fucking many. Get out of here. Cease. God, I hate this maze. Hate these creatures. Okay, one down. Wait, really? Ah, oh, okay. There we go. No, no, no. You stay on. Bad. Puppy. Bad. How fucking many of you are in here? Leave mommy lung legs alone. She's busy. Did you just push that? What the fuck are you fuckers doing? Get away from my damn box. Did they fucking... They glitched the box. Ah. That one fucking jumped at me. Now that was some horror game. Get out of there. Get No, leave my box alone. That'd kill me. Okay, now they should leave it alone. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. <laughs> they, they hug you to death on your face. Just like their parents. This research must stay buried. Nobody may leave sound glitched. Yeah, I think I jumped into a pile of like six of them. It was the softest jump scare. Yeah, it was. Oh, hey, dinosaur. I forgot your name. Okay, fuck these guys. Where are they? I can hear them. I can't see them. Just keep swimming. Just keep... So I'm in a dead end. Well, thank you. You guided me out. Oh, it kept my progress of one of them being done. Now I just need to get to that one. 
Unless I glitch it from here. No, you can't reach it from here. Damn, that would have been great. Don't look at me. Dumb asses. <laughs> Shit. Doesn't let you. Oh, God. Why? Why are you fuckers here? Back to the pits that spawned you. Oh, come on. That's cheating. That's so cheating. That li literally spawned there. God damn it. You're wasting time. I know. I'm having fun with my finger guns. Leave me alone. Get up. Glitches never work when we need them to. No. They always work against us. Okay, both are powered up. We're good, actually. I just need to get up high. I believe I did through this way. Yeah! We climbing. And press the button. Oh. Am I supposed to be on this? I sure hope so. Am I just spinning forever? Um. Fuck you got Oh, I have to do it again. Bammo! Blammo! Kapoom! I hear you. And catch me, little mascots. Why do they laugh like people's? May. You wandered here. Oh, why? <laughs> Wait, why have you wandered here? That makes a lot more sense. Oh. Was that just the game's way of saying, hey, you went the wrong way? <laughs> Shit. Maybe it was. But I can get up there. I believe. I can just glitch to get on top of this. Hit! Shit. Believe in me. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let me through. Let me through. Let me through! Okay, fine. You win this day. I'll be back. And in far greater numbers. Okay, I give up on that area. Ooh. I don't like how the shadows act weird, man. Do I go down? I guess so. Even says exit to tease us. I know, right? I thought I was so smart. There's no room for you here? I can even jump. Maybe six foot three, but this is a pretty tall area. Okay, that's a much more happy character. Fiery face duck. Why do I feel like a boss is going to spawn here? This room looks too interesting. Use each pure. Don't forget to use the blibler. Oh, these are supposed to be like a... Ah, bumper cars, but in water. That's adorable. Wouldn't they... You know, wouldn't the propellers kill all the kids if they fell under? Interesting. I don't like that graphic effect on the floor, man. It looks very abyss-like. Hey, ducky friends. We're all friends here, right? Oh. Really did not expect that to be able to be opened. I'll come back for you. Don't fall, don't fall. Why can't that one open? You, you're a puppy's angel. Come to save us. Nothing left to save. Not here. Holy fuck! Absolute angel. There, home. A million pairs of eyes are on you now. Watching, waiting, hungry. Oh, you can see an organ hanging out of him. Beneath your skin and eat away at you bit by little bit. Fill what feels empty inside themselves. That. Thing. Catnip, the pro 
prototype is his god. Oh, he was praying this to the prototype. This is what he does to heretics. These little toys follow catnap to avoid that very fate. And in return, they are fed. <laughs> we try to fight it. The prototype's control. I am the last of the smiling critters. Jesus, dude. Listen to me. You need to get out of this place. You need to live. You and Poppy could fix this. End this madness. The torment. Oh no. Oh no. Leave me. Leave. No! Okay! No, buddy! Oh, he's an enemy now. Okay. Um. Yep. Yeah, I knew that was going to fall through eventually. Okay, my finger blasters don't do shit. Ah, oh, fuck that. Um. Oh, God. Do not know how I got out of there in time. He was such a good friend until he wasn't. Wrong way. Fuck. Okay. Turns out if there's enemies in a direction, don't try to just shoot yourself forward. <laughs> burn this place to the ground. Get up. I mean, I've been trying to burn this place to the ground. It hasn't been going great. Wait, what were behind those secret doors then? I like it that it looks like I'm giving it a thumbs up. It's like, yeah. <laughs> He's choking on them. Ah. Uh. They did enter all through the different parts of his body. This room was so dramatic, and for what? There's nothing in here. <laughs> we, we, we. Boom. Okay, let's see what's actually behind. Do I not even need to fight, dog? Huh. Hey, do you want help? No. Um... There is one question I want to ask. If I go here, does it do a different thing? Because I want to do whatever's going on with Dog Day. I don't want to, like, abandon that. But I, I want to know what's in this room. Can I go into this room safely? Or will I not be able to get back out? No, you can go down there. Ah, okay, cool. Oh, yeah, you can just climb back up. God damn it, Fuchan. Oh, is this where he lives? This does look very catnap coded. I guess there were scratches everywhere. I don't like these doors that can't even be interacted with. He has hanging friends around him while he sleeps. Yeah, I'm going to guess this is just where catnap lives. And just above him is where he tortures all his old friends. Yay. <laughs> okay. Let's go deal with this again. Oh, no. Leave me. Oh. Please. Just go. Okay. Hi. Ah. Cool now. Cool, please. Cool, please. I would like to run. Thank you. It's more a case of like tight spaces being a pain in the ass at this point. Maybe Fu was right all along about dogs being better than cats. There was never any question about that. Dogs have always been better than cats. It's just cats, you know, they get a better rep. Everybody likes them because they're cute and adorable. Oh, come on. How was I supposed to know that was the wrong way? What tells me that's the wrong way until it's suddenly a fucking dead end? Huh? Says the man with two cats. And yet only one dog. Because one dog is all I need. Why is there gel cells in the play area? Don't worry about it. That's for the naughty boys and girls. That's where they go. Because, I mean, they're orphans. What are they going to do? Complain to their parents? <laughs> it's a fucked up thing to say. But true. That's why they got away with it so long. They technically own these kids. We, we, wah. They're both great. That's why they kept the big bodies. Ah. So they can play around inside of them. Oh, no. 
Please be. I'll save you this time. Please, just go. No. Run. I won't let them take you. I don't want to win in his fucking eye, man. That's fucked up. Run! Oh, God. He's right the fuck behind me. Cease! The fucking shooting him should really slow him down, man. Open, 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 open. Okay. Remember this time, Futan. Don't take any sidetracks. Side tracks are evil. Right. Open. Oh, okay, that works too. Cease. Left. We. I believe in nothing called love. Oh my god. Come on, dude. I was so far away from you by that point. Are you fucking with me? <sighs> oh well. That nap, I know you're trying to be thematic right now, but you are technically spoiling things. It's like subtle spoilers, but it's still spoilers. So yeah, stop. <laughs> That's why you're getting timed out right now. Turning around slows you down. Yeah, but it looks so much more dramatic. <laughs> it looks so much cooler. I like to see him coming at me. The hitbox is crazy. I honestly, yeah, I don't think you should have gotten me that time. Every other time, yeah, I ran into dead ends. That was my fault. That final one? Mm. Part's not very intuitive. It's more than just if you make a mistake, you get surrounded immediately. I like how they tourniqueted him. Like they straight up tourniqueted him to keep him alive. That shit is crazy. Some next level evil shit. Pupils are super scary. Honestly, the fact that he doesn't even have pupils, kind of cute. Kind of cute. I'm for it. Never likes chase sequences like this. Nah, I prefer there being something else you can do. Like if I could shoot him to slow him down, I feel like it would be a bit more enjoyable. Fuck, I did it again. I thought that's where I went last time. I thought I ran to the end and then went right. Shit. Butan didn't realize Dog Day could vent. This is the problem. He's down on his all fours. This is his natural. Well, technically only has two now. He's down on his two. <laughs> He's used to being this small, whereas I have to keep crouching and shit. Go! Went left before? Damn it. I didn't even think I went anywhere. I thought the door just opened for me. I wish it started you here at least, man. You have to run so far and watch this death. Ooh. I see you there. No, that's a light. Okay. <laughs> huh. No. He must Leave be a me. very important prisoner Please. to be the only one who stays no. here. Get into the eye. Bang! New objective. Run away. Oh, left. His footsteps are very adorable. But don't go right. Don't go right, go left. Then go right. And then fall. Straight forward. We go through here. To the left. Because that worked last time. Then he's going to pop out of that one right fucking there. So we go left. Oh, fuck, fuck. Why? 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 Fuck! Okay, I made it. Oh... Do not make me change my hands at last second like that. <laughs> Dog Day was Catnap's polar opposite. He was popular while Catnap got pulled from the shelves. Yeah, they literally said he was the leader too. So yeah, I guess. Oh, hey, Dog Day. Dog Day says, fetch. Fuchan says, you're now full of evil enemy monsters. As far as you can. I did. I got away from you. Why are you just standing there? Uh, um. You can't be here. 
You can't stay. Why not? Don't you love me? I thought we were friends. You telling me we're not friends? I don't think anyone here wants to be my friend. Even my wife fucking killed herself. This shit's crazy. Man. Just wanted to play a nice, cute game. Poppy playtime. Playing with a bunch of kids. But no. Hey, are you alright? No, no, Ollie. Ouchie's not alright. <laughs> no, ouchies are lost body parts. Okay. Damn it. Did you see the shrine? Um. Catnap made it for the prototype. See, before Catnap turned into Catnap, I guess there was some pretty serious accident. He almost died, but they say that the prototype saved his life, giving up his own freedom in the process. Why? In Catnap's eyes, the prototype is a superhero and has saved this place. Catnap treats him like a god, killing everyone that opposes him, us included, if we're not careful. That shrine, did it scare you? No. If you thought that was terrifying, just wait until you see the real thing. Oh, anyway, we're going to see the prototype? Really close to the end. I sent you a new key. You're going to the counselor's office instead. It's not ideal, but it should have enough juice. Oh no. If you can get that generator going and plug it in, I think we'll be done. And keep your eyes open for catnap. Every shadow and every flickering light is a hiding spot. He always stalks his prey first. He'll take away anything you have to defend yourself. And when you're at your most vulnerable, he'll kill you. Catnap lives for the hunt. Good luck. Talk soon. <laughs> After all of that scary shit, just good luck. Talk to you soon. He lives for the hunt. He's going to end your fucking life. Anyway, where's my key? Hey. About time. What's this? Counselor's office key. Okay. Glad we had that talk, Ollie. Yeah, lots of useful information. As if I didn't already know he was trying to kill me. Is that the counselor's office? The thing that looks like a law building? Um, sweet home, play care, toy store, school, play house. Yep, that's the counselor's office. That makes sense. It looks like a law building. Good luck. I know, right? Meanwhile, we haven't even seen Ollie. For all I know, is Ollie just Poppy fucking with me? <laughs> Poppy was like, he won't trust me anymore. Oh, I'll just do a slightly different voice and call him on the phone. Wuggy wuggy. Oh, it's supposed to be Poppy, not Iron Mouse. Okay, that makes sense. BFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFF
Time is the alert system effective? Playtime the following company. message is for all Playtime Company employees. At 11.01 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, an unknown hostile force was declared present within the Playtime Company facility. Oh. Personnel are to begin enacting emergency evacuation protocols immediately. So you believe in the centipedes in the walls now? Belongings. Do not engage with any hostile individuals. If no exit path is available, seek shelter in a hidden location. Use blankets or pillows to cover your body and remain silent. Really? Do not look through any windows. Do not open doors for any individuals. Do not make eye contact. Oh. So not making eye contact may be important for the final fight. Open the doors now. The hour of joy has arrived. <laughs> the hour of joy. They keep talking about that. Okay. Need another thingy thing battery. Um. Why does my hand go right through that? Is the Daco at you? No, unfortunately. God, why have they not made a ring? Well. She'd have to watch the video and then just run around a bunch. A ring video game would not be great. <laughs> They've got enough, like, game villains that kind of look like Sadako. Wait, can I just take the... Oh, I can take the battery out of this one. Damn it, Fuchan. Okay, guys, but what if? What if? What if the teacher's in here? <laughs> what if we only killed one and she didn't actually any of all of her sisters? What if one of her sisters got out into this building? This looks like an area a teacher would hang out in. All the murdered stuffed toys and shit. Imagine. Imagine though. the fucking fuck <laughs> mommy long legs are scaring me even from beyond the grave head of school maria ashokan maririn oh music's kicking in joy lots of flies Okay, I'm getting the fuck out of there. Aww. Oh. Maybe he's gonna put it back together. <laughs> Maybe he being a good boy. Honestly, we assume the worst way too often in life. Maybe he is just helping his friends. I mean, run, help. They won't even let me go to the bathroom to shit myself. Um, okay. Head of Toy Store, Eduardo Gala. Holy shit. Yo, confidants, we're home free. Okay, let's get out of here. We got what we needed. Fuck these cursed kids. Am I... Ooh. Am I right? Got the cash. Let's go. Um. Do I... Climb? Okay, that's bullshit. <laughs> I 100% made that jump. You can't tell me. I shouldn't have done it so smart, Arcee. I should have landed properly. How far back am I? Okay, good. They probably just didn't expect people would die here. <laughs> Man. <gasps> We're back in the back cave. Oh. Propane's coming with me. Okay. Have a ch 
charging thing. What else do we have? Made it to the edge at least. <laughs> yeah. Literally died on the edge. Anything. Hello. Why for am I here? Oh. I guess I have to charge that one then. I forgot how long these hands go now. It's kind of crazy. Okay. I don't see anything I can do down here. Oh, is your time? Yeah. Gonna be another half hour of me exploring and getting lost. Unless I can lift this. Nope. Why? What is my aversion to climbing fucking actual ladders? There are actual ladders in this game. And every time I see one, my character is just like, but j j jump pad. Oh. Okay, I need to get it to that one somehow. Um. Wee. How would I, how would I get up there though? Where do I even need to get this power to? Um. Okay. Let's look around and find where I need to put this. But yeet hand is more fun? True. I like fire hand. Fire hand's a fucking amazing power up. How would I? Oh. Oh. Wait. Come on, man. You should be charged. I'm right here. <laughs> um, how the fuck do I charge that one? I think I need to wrap it around. But no, for that, I need to be able to get over there. So I need chumpy powers. Ah. Wee. Oh, I need to do the other one, too. Ah, uh, shit. Two. Wow. Not even close. <laughs> Maybe the back end is in the way or something? I, I guess. I mean, I guess you have to control the hands with your actual hands. Makes sense. We. Um. Okay, that brings that there. Wait. Need my right hand. <laughs> Dumbass. Okay, let's try this again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeet! Come on, come on. Okay. Okay, I don't think it'll go the whole way, so I think... That activates this one, but where would I... Still doesn't tell me where to shoot it after this. Hmm. one thing oh yeah the two is up there I'm stupid <laughs> wee 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 bum there we go wee Okay, that wasn't so bad. We've had much worse puzzles that took forever. Okay, are we back into horror mode now? Just gonna get my blasty hand ready. <laughs> oh, I heard something. There is something else moving around this room somewhere. Let me out, man. Let me out. Head of Playcare, Stella Graber. Okay. 
candy cat snacks. I need a pink VHS tape. Or I could just start a fire. And everything would burn down. Oh, you are creepy looking. Oh, Mr. and Mrs. Hartman. Come on in. Please, have a seat. How was your ride down? It was, uh, nothing like we were expecting. It looks uh, like Damien from The Omen. Was, well, it just confirms for us that you're the orphanage we want to go through. It's a truly magical place. I felt right at home from the second I entered. Is that my wife? You opened that door the first time and you just know. You're never going to leave. That's my kind wife. Like finding Back a home when she was as a human. child and always thinking of it when you want to feel comforted. <clears throat> I understand you want to give Jeremy that home? Yes, and we would like to adopt. Ah, amazing! You'll be perfect for... Oh. What? Well, it appears there's been some complications. Jeremy was the one that they said was sick, right? What kind of complications? I... I don't know. Um, the form says... Testing. <laughs> what does that mean? Tell us, what does that mean? Miss Graper, we deserve a better explanation than that. Uh, don't you think? You're in charge of all this! How could you not know? And why are we only finding out about this now? I... I don't. I'm sorry. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> so, Jeremy... Wasn't the sick kid. That was Kevin. Okay. So Jeremy just started testing for something. Maybe he was the prototype? I don't know. What were they testing on that child? Probably whatever turns children into toys. I, I think I might be wrong. I thought that was Mr. Light's voice, though. I mean, I'd imagine it's actually this woman. Stella. Yeah, they called her Mr. Gr Miss Grader. So it was Stella Grader, but she had a similar voice to Mr. Light. Ah, we'll see when this chapter ends, seeing the voice cast list. Maybe it's just the same voice, or maybe it is a suggestion that she got turned into the teacher. Bum, ba -da -bum. Hey, Folger, can I please chase you? I would like that. That was fun earlier. Oh, I still didn't find a key. Guess it's magically unlocked? Shit. Well, there's got to be a key in here somewhere. Really wish the fire gun killed the bugs. Playtime. No keys. No keys. But I need a key. Hmm. It must be in her office. I must just be blind. It's hanging on a wall? Where would I keep a key? Probably in my desk. Got a USB? Grab that. Find out what kinds of crazy shit they've been up to. I knocked over the chair. I see no key. The buzzing thing makes me feel like bugs are near me. Yeah, especially when you've got headphones on. Just open noise, not too bad. But with headphones, yeah, that's a pain. Huh. There is no key. Means I need to be looking up. Yep. Oh. Up is the key. He <laughs> got fucking... Every time I get stuck. Fuchan, look the fuck up. This is a very vertically inclined cave. <laughs> Ah, feel like I want some coffee? Yes, please. Get me a nice green tea. Gamers don't look up. I've been too used to Valorant, man. You never need to look up in Valorant. Your time is running short. Turn around and go home. Hi, I'm Crafty Corn. Can you help me with my painting? Oh. Blue, blue is not a creative color. Quit asking. Thanks. Now, can you give me some red? Oh, 
sure. Let me just... Do all the red... You need... Now you're pretty. Okay, if you say so. The biggest smile for you. Out. We can't be out. We're out of red, I'm sorry. You're hiding more red from me. I know you are. I mean... She's gonna cut me open, isn't she? Okay, I like her now. She she won me over. She started reminding me too much of don't hug me, I'm scared. Now, creepy. I like it. Why did he kill all of them, though? The hour of joy. Help. Why did he kill all of them if all of them were kind of evil and twisted and creepy? I think we're the red. I, yeah, I get a feeling that we're the red. <laughs> Bichan is now a brony. How fucking dare you. Bold of you to assume I haven't always been a brony. I do the... I forget what it's called. Shit, I can't even fake brony well right now. What was it? Was, isn't it like clopping or something when they high five each other? Clopping or hoofing or something? Can't go either of those ways. What about your cutie mark? You can literally see it. It's on the side of my eye. That's my cutie mark. I'm going to fall through this. Oh, I didn't. What is causing that light, though? That's not it. What is it, then? Clapping and huffing. Bro hoof. Bro hoof. There we go. Thank you. Yeet. Um... Oh, fuck. Okay. It's gassy here. Now the question is, is this gas flammable? Nope. We lived. That's a good start. Head of home sweet home, Lisa Bochan. Holy shit. This area is so fucking dark. Coughing sounds like fisting. <laughs> Jesus. I don't know. There's definitely something. I, bro hoof. Somebody else said it. Bro hoof. I guess that makes sense. I was around like the same time PewDiePie became big with like the bro fist and stuff. Bro hoof, brah. Okay. The green thing here. We just need a way to charge it. And now. I have a battery. Head of gas, gas, gas production. Is this just a whole series of fucking offices? So many. Greg Fictal. Lovely. Oh, that was a useful office. Why did all the clocks start right after 10? It was 11 when people apparently showed up, too, so I don't get that. Music. Just another thing to charge, and I still don't... Oh, wait. Yeah, okay. Still don't have any charges for that. <laughs> clipping is something different. Yeah, clipping is when you, like, accidentally, like, phase through something. We've done that a few times today. We've really been testing this game's... <laughs> QA assurance. Okay, that's locked, as expected. Hmm. Put a battery into here. What did the battery do? I don't seem to have done anything. Ah, is that what I need? Yes. How many of these fuckers do I have to charge? I, th I charged two of them, didn't wait. What's that green light?
Oh, because there's the third one. That makes sense. Let there be light, maybe? This area is way too fucking dark, man. Oh, it opened the door. Okay. Considering the fact you broke the game three minutes in. What? Okay, what is chat talking about right now? Why is half chat just bronies? Don't look up clopping. Oh, is clopping something bad? I'm definitely going to look that up later. <laughs> Wait, is it actually to do with bronies though? Or did I get that completely wrong? Also, damn, his breathing's getting loud. It is sussy and it is. Okay. Don't look that up to save your sanity. It might actually be a... I genuinely don't know what type of bad thing it is. I'm going to check that out later. But it is interesting. Um, turn and go home. I don't like this area. <laughs> Why is it? Oh, I can take this off too. That makes it much easier. Why do you stop breathing? Not today, Satan. Help? Yeah, help. Um. Interesting. This area is very anxiety. Yeah. Oh, that's just you again. God damn it, mommy. <sighs> mommy always freaking me out with her electric sounds. Did I charge the thing I needed to charge in here? I mean... Grab it. Oh, it stays there. Mommy is everywhere, yeah. Still causing problems for me. Did I ever go in here? I did. So did I miss something here? Maybe now that I've turned all the power on. God, it's still so fucking hard to see. If only they would clear this fucking smoke. Maybe it's just, yeah, that I've charged everything. Oh, no. Not another puzzle. <laughs> Wait. What beeped at me? <laughs> Did I already do this one? Um. I am such confusing. Okay, two batteries up there. So I guess I just need to play with this. Game really said live, laugh, mommy. They, they wanted her everywhere, man. They got it. Okay, that for sure. Don't you ding-ding-ding -de -ding me. I don't even know what I did yet. Ooh, jumpy hand. Love jumpy hand. Boom! Boom! Huh? I went too far. Uh, let's try that again. Boom! 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 Fuck. Boom! Boom! Too far again. Why am I this good at the game? Fuck. Okay. One. Fucking bounced my head. One. Two. Three. Fuck. Okay. One. And. Softly. And. And. Okay. Not just over there. God, I have too much power. Why, why can't I?
do I do I just knock it off the edge to break it? I, um. Okay, kiddo. That's more like it. Okay. Ah. God, these are so hard to control. The physics. No. Okay. One down. One to go. <laughs> Where do I think the second one is? Okay, I can open that. Why do I want to open that? The tuny power in your right hand? I'm telling you, man. I told you many times. There's a demon sealed in this left hand. Uh, physics, our old nemesis. Uh, it's not been so bad so far. Wee! Damn it. <laughs> okay, there's not one up there? No. So I can use the elevator to get up if I want to. Oh, maybe there's something underneath the elevator. And there's a battery spot there. Maybe I can get... Can I steal this battery back now? Nope, it ate it. <laughs> it ate the battery. Oh, maybe I should try that battery down here and that'll lead me to the other battery. Really hope I haven't sock locked myself by putting it in that one position. Judgment night so. Fuck yeah with the Kaido reference. Yeah. Wow. Okay, I'm getting better at that. Okay, let's go put it in that door. Oh. Oh, and now I just need to get it up top so I can crack this one open. Well, I should also see what's in there. Do, 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 do. The demon ain't helping you here? That's the secret. But I don't need any demon. I'm strong enough by my lonesome. Okay, just need to get it to the top, so... Goodies? Oh, but I have to ride it, too. Um... No, what? Oi! Oi, 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 oi. Cheating, cheating, cheating. What the fuck? Okay, there's a delay on it. There's a super fucking huge delay on it for some reason. Let's just wait this time. Oh, man, that's so aggravating. You can use the jump pads, Foo? I could. I, I have to get this up here, though. So I couldn't actually use the jump pads this time because I have to do these. Wee! Okay, now I could use the jump pads. But I mean, honestly, the elevator is easier. Okay, now I need both of them. You get in there. You come to me. Yeah, and now one in each hand. And we call this the pleaser. I just broke. Okay. Thank God. I thought I broke the game by putting in both at the same time. It just couldn't handle it, man. It just couldn't handle it. Oh, now I need to get the electricity back to here. Okay, um, that's fine. I think we just need to do the jump pads again. Perfect. Double penetra- Ha huh? Blue Jay! How could you say something so kinky? This is a children's game. How- how dare you? 
I would never say such a thing <laughs> in such words. Okay, we just need to turn this one a bit. Perfect. Okay. E. Cool. Zay. I do not like the noises that I'm hearing. Return to the dome? O okay. Um, how do I get up there now, though? I mean... Will it stay open if I turn this again? Is that a cat meow? I didn't hear one, but maybe. We are gonna fight again. Yeah, I'm gonna say that'll stay open. Let us hope and pray. Oh shit, wait, no, I clo I closed this. I have to do the fucking jump pads. Fuck my Um. Oh thank goodness. <laughs> All he does is eat chip and lie. A lot of the times it's not lying. A lot of the times it's just stupidity. A lot of times I don't know I'm lying. It just kind of happens. We. Okay. Jump pads. Ikuze. Jump pads. Oh, thank God. That took a while. I'm free! Finally! Fuck you! Um, where do we go? Take every step like it's your last! Playtime! Play care, it may be your last. Bum, bum, bum. Dead by the originals. Come, come. What? The original is Oma? O Oma? Dead by the origin. The origin. I don't know what that says. Something weird. Where do we go now? Where do we go? Oh, command? Wow, I really can't read today. Oh, fuck! Okay, I think we're good. <laughs> the red gas just tried to kill me. It didn't manage it yet. You know what? That looks inviting. Yeah, I didn't think so. Dead by the what? Original command or origin command? Oh. Well, uh, the prototype has saved us all. Run. Oh, the music's getting nice and creepy again. Whoa! I didn't even see him. It was so fucking dark. Holy shit. I think that's like all. Third scare throughout these games. <laughs> I, I just casually walked out there and then was like, "What?" Um. Flower, 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 flower. There's no flower. Oh. Do you have any idea what you're doing? No been kind of doing what other people told me to do, honestly. Oh. Do you know what's happened here? Oh, 
we'll kill we'll kill Drin. What's up, real children? Oh, it didn't look like Poppy in the past either. That's a lot of screaming. Do you know who we once were? <gasps> my wife! I know who she was. She was my everything. My reason to be. Now she's gone. We hallucinating? I think so. I to end this. think this is all a really weird gas infested trip. Stop coming at me, children. Get away from me, demon child. Okay. Do you even know what's real? No. Oh, this is the office area. Hey, Huggy Wuggy. Come give me a hug, friend. No, you don't. He's going to open his mouth and come bite you, isn't he? Hello? Oh, the prototype is big. What the fuck? Why would you make something that freaking big? Did you want to die? That's how you die. Okay, Hex. Anyway, thanks for the battery. And don't worry. I promise I'll never let you go, baby girl. Uh, he's massive. Yeah, he's a big boy. Oh, my vision's still all weird. Oh, God. Moving around makes me feel kind of sick. No more evil music. Thank you. Um... Just the way the fuck out of here, because that's where I want to go. Everything looks the fucking same here. That would have been nice. Oh, that's okay. That's the teacher's office areas. So probably this way. X is in this. It seems like it. X is the sleepy kitty cat. No, I don't want to go that way. I just want to get the hell out of here, man. Kind of excited to see Catnap. I'm kind of excited to see what the final fight of this is going to be like. They've been hyping this up a lot. This is definitely way longer than any of the other chapters. They better have something special. Got to go out on a bang. Okay, I'm out of here. I think I turned on the power. You didn't scared? I'm never scared. I mean, I screamed like a bitch three times today. But other than that, <laughs> Ollie or Catnap? Something's gone wrong. Grab the cord from the counselor's office and plug it in underneath the statue. We need to reach 100%. Good luck. Aggie. I don't think I even got the second cord, honestly. What? what um. Uh, counselor cord? Oh, there you are. Come on, buddy. Why do I feel like something's going to interrupt this? Beep. Beep. Um, school, playhouse. Do I have to just guess? I mean, it's one of these. Oh, oh dome. Counselor, counselor's office. It looks like we're a tiny bit short. I'm sending one last key. Oh, Tabs fuck you. Well, maybe Go she should have gotten the power. The cord. Then we'll have enough power. <sighs> Donde esta? Our four fucking percent power. Oh, it's literally a poppy key. Cute. 
recruit power from the Sky Dome. Don't mind if I do. This chapter has just been too many fetch quests. <laughs> it's too often doing the whole thing of like, oh, you're almost done. Just do this one thing. Oh, drat. That didn't work. Well, you can go this. Oh, no. They got in ahead of you, huh? Cute key. Yeah, it's adorable. Sky Dome. Where? Wait, it's not on the map. They just mean straight up up there. I mean. Okay, where did I meet Poppy? <laughs> She, she went up an elevator. I remember that. I, re I remember. There was an elevator somewhere. I think it was close to where I entered this place. We really need more lights, man. Here we go again. Niji lost, baby. Pretty much most of this gameplay. <laughs> Niji lost. Just running around saying, what the fuck? Why is this game so dark? There was definitely an elevator somewhere around the outskirts. Just got to run around the outskirts. Oh, duckies. Got to run around the outskirts and eventually we'll find it. Or we'll clip out of reality. Nope. Almost though. A child could fit through there. And be lost for all eternity. But not me. I'm a full grown man. I don't get the luxury of just disappearing like that. Seriously, where the... Hmm. Remember, old man? No. Rather just keep running. Eventually it'll work out. This looks right. <laughs> that is right. Oh. We're just getting power. I thought we were going up to the Sky Dome. <laughs> we, Olga, can I chase you? Come at me. You don't scare me, cat. Got a bottle of water right here. Look at my little hoppy skips. We, Hoppy's got her own form of playtime, but I've got my little hoppy skips. Dome! Okay, that should be enough power. Now take that huge battery to the gas production zone so we can get out of here. It's the door by the cable car you arrived on. Good luck. But, but battery? Huge battery? What huge B -b battery? <laughs> Wait, what? Oh. Where did the fuck did you come from, sir? Somehow, I don't think the cat's gonna like that idea too much. Cable car was up here, right? But I wish you never saw me. I mean, I only saw you a few times, to be fair. Give it time. Maybe it'll be a good time. Big battery? Yeah, this is a big boy. Yeah, that's the stupid playhouse. I think they mean this door. Probably, right? Does say exit. <gasps> Yay! You just walked through it. Wait. <laughs> the battery or something else? <laughs> Sweet succulent double A batteries. I mean, this is more like a three times car size battery. Watch your step. Okay, I got power for you. Yeah, this is a much bigger battery. But what if I jam it in the tiny? Oh, hey. Um. Why can't I put on my gas mask? Okay, when it says run, it means run. I'm in a corner. This is not good for me. Fuck! Well, that ended quickly. <laughs> These souls deserve peace. Get up. Oh, God. Ah. Stretch a little bit. This will be fine. That catnap? Yeah, he's big. Um... Where is the blue power cell? You're shitting me. No fucking way I have to do this every time I... Really? It takes you so fucking far back. I even loaded into a new fucking area. What the... Sh okay. 
Ain't no way. Yeah, no, this is kind of crazy. Okay, that should be enough power. Now take that huge battery to the gas production zone. I will. So we can get out of here. Shush, small child. Yeah, I know, because I just did it, like, 45 seconds ago. <laughs> God. Now it's going to load me in as I get out here, and then for some reason, it doesn't save me here. <sighs> An innocent little kitty, I'm cute, what do you mean? I am about to end you, cat. In fact, this is the best day of my life. I get to kill a cat. That sounds darker than it should be. <laughs> but you know what? Everything you did to the dog, you're going down. Okay, let's look around. Okay, so don't run back here. This becomes a dead end. Can I crawl through this? No. So I have to, like, run this way. Which is also a dead end. Interesting. I still can't use my mask. What if I just do this? Nah, I didn't figure. Okay, big boy. Still doesn't work. Okay. Um. And I'm trapped again. No, don't do this. Get it in, 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 get it in. I can't get it in, get it in, get it in, I'm fucked. Get it in, get it in, I'm fucked. And the rest is over. He took your mask when he knocked your ass out. I guess that makes sense. That's why I was in such like a trippy experience. So I can circle around him, but that's about all I can do. I can't even put the blue battery in. Which you'd think would be the plan? Oh, you fucking... Okay, here we go again! Bum, ba bum, ba bum. It says run. Yeah, but there's literally nowhere to run to. So it's just going to be running. It's like a Resident Evil final boss where it's always like, just run. You can't do any damage to it. And then you suddenly get given like, oh. I mean, it was already here. Okay, so. <laughs> now take that huge battery to the gas production zone. Oh, so oh, oh, oh. It's the door by the cable car. You I know. On. Small Come sassy on. child. Done it three times now. Run straight, but there's nothing about me that's straight. Bum, 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 bum. Maybe that was a bug. I honestly don't know. It's weird that it saves in that way. I mean, it doesn't take too long to get back here, but I mean, why wouldn't they just save there at like the loading spot when you have the blue thing? Okay. Definitely something over there. Yeah, okay. The room changes when he comes crashing in. So I definitely had more room to maneuver in when he was around, so. Let's just try to explore for a little bit. Now that I know, I can't put the fucking battery in. Fuck, this is where I got caught last time. This is impossible, huh? Can't get under there. Run, it says. Just run. Just run, forehead. Just run! Oh, okay. There's a way for me to go. Just need to get around him one more time. Go, go, go. Climb, 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 climb. What are you... He got over that every fucking time. Except for the one time I really needed it. Just go up. Just get banned from my channel. Goodbye. You don't say. I'm trying to figure out how to play the game. I guess I'm not. I haven't watched somebody else play the game. I have to do it in my own way. If you're telling me, just do the thing. I was trying to find the thing. So goodbye. Thank you for being here. Have a lovely day. Can you pre-open that cage? I don't know. I don't think so. I don't think the electricity is there when you first start. But we'll try. We shall try, because that will save us time. Okay, so we don't even... It's so weird how it saves when the batteries come out. 
And yet, when you haven't put the power in, it's so weird. From the start? Yep, every time. This shouldn't be too bad now that I know how to do it, though. I just need to fucking avoid him. I don't know how I got fucking stuck on the things that I was jumping over continuously. Jumped over them twice. I did two loop-de-loops. Then just all of a sudden... Nah, so the power definitely doesn't turn on until he starts fucking with us. Okay, let's do this. Guess the battery unlock saves weird because it doesn't have a place to plug into. I, I don't even know. It's just weird. Bye, friend. Hey, where'd you go? Where did friend go? There's friend. Um, I don't feel safe. Wait, was that it? <laughs> Wait, really? You're fucking shitting me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, so I just had to go up the elevator. Oh, new objective, survive. Okay, well, sounds easy enough. I hope this is coming through. There's no time to waste. Catnap is on his way. Good. Okay. Now, in between the hallways, there's those two side rooms on both the left and the right. There'll be green power receivers in those little rooms. They can block off the hallways before Catnap gets to you. Try them. What did she say? Be green power receivers in those little rooms. They can block off the hallways before Catnab gets to you. Oh, um. Oh. Wait, do I need to power that? No, obviously not. Why can't I power these? Everything else is powered. What did that close? I am much confusion right now. We'll figure it out. Am I seriously not double grip? It really looks like you can. Finally breaking free from catnip for now. I can't go there. Okay, maybe keep that on. <laughs> well, at least the gas isn't affecting me. That's a nice change. So many batteries. Yeah, they threw so many batteries at me, but I'm not sure what it actually does. Oh, we've got a VHS player. And the tape. Log code 24459. In relation, experiment 1006. The prototype. The prototype. Uh. Is, and always silent with each passing session. I'm still uncovering fresh data nonetheless. Today's discovery. He can sing. End of log. That wasn't a particularly good log. Ready to talk now, are you? I possess a question. Poppy? Go ahead. Do you feel anything? <sighs> this question referred to what exactly? You stick us, beat us, tear our flesh. Do you feel it? There's a secret inside you, 1006. Valuable beyond all measure. I cut and prod and 
burn at it. And I get closer with each session. It sounds like all of the characters. Oh, don't. Fight or give in. Regardless, I learned something new about Did I just see a spider run across the screen? It excites me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank me. Oh, yeah, they're going to murder you. Oh, it mimics voices. Nice. Do you feel it? Sounds hot. <laughs> okay, Kyanma Chan. <laughs> See, I'm not all about the giant metal thing. Was the prototype the first, maybe? I mean, it has to be because it's called the prototype. I wonder if the reason they're like poking and prodding and cutting away at it and stuff is because they're trying to recreate it. Maybe it was a freak accident when the prototype was created. Maybe it was like a bunch of toys fused together and they like slowly peeled them off one by one. Oh, that's where I came from. <laughs> well, at least we found a VHS tape. Bum, 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 bum. But isn't it 1006? Yeah. But the 1006 that's still around now could be a much more different specimen than what we've been dealing with so far. Okay, she definitely said something about like going into rooms to the left and right. Where the fuck do I put this? On there. Oh, we got a jump pad. Where the fuck did I miss that? Oh, we just got a spare one. Okay, you stay there for now. Do 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 do. We. Ah, this left and right. Okay. Um. You feeling it, Mr. Borg? Yeah, I'm really feeling it, Mr. Krabs. Still nothing in here, though. We need an actual green power source. Absolutely sure you don't want to go in there. They have a green power source and they can block off the hallways before catching them. Try them. I would, but you won't let me grab energy. Ah, okay. That one. What's up, big old kitty boy? Definitely going to be trial and error? Yeah, it is. I still don't quite understand what I'm doing. But she said to do this if he comes near, so... Okay, I dumped some gas on him and he had to run away. That's nice. Oh, he's still right there. Get him out of here. Please insert a new battery. Oh, fuck you. Where? Huh? Jumpy hand, jumpy hand. Be gone, foul beast. Is he coming through the top? I'm just gonna do this one more time. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Fuck. That actually made me jump. I did not see him there. And then he just grabbed me out of the fucking air. Oh, my God. Ah. Uh. Okay, let's try that again. How far back are they going to send us? Okay. Is coming through. There's no time to waste. Catnap is on his way. The 
room you're in used to be a sort of oh, panic ambulance. Not what it used to be. Good. Okay. Now, in between the hallways, there's those two side rooms. Both the left and the right. There'll be green power receivers in those little rooms. You can block off the hallways before Catnap gets to you. Try them. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so as this goes on, it's also going to get more and more fucked up as I have to use more of the battery packs. Gotcha. Fun times. You got this, Futan? Yeah, this is going to be trial and error. If you see catnap, use those. You're probably going to hallucinate a bit. It'll be hard to tell what's real. They dumped gas. It seemed to keep him to the side, but I don't... Try using your flares on catnap to make sure he's real. Oh, okay. He's almost there. Okay, see, this is the problem, because... I don't know if that's real. It didn't really react. Stop grabbing the side. Oh, he right there again. He's coming from the other side again. Hey, okay, I need a new battery. Where is he? Fuck, get in there! My dude! doing the thing it's doing the thing okay this is where i fucked up last time can i get down there really so i just have to watch try not to jump down there because he, he i was hitting him with the fucking smoke shit but the whole point was that stops him from doing anything Gotta do something. Yeah, I'm gonna try shooting him in the face. He opened the roof. I think that the machine opened the roof. There's no time to waste. Catnap is on his... Good. Okay. Now, in between the hallways, there's those two side rooms. On both the left and the right. There'll be green power receivers in those little rooms. We can block off the hallways before Catnap gets to you. Uh-huh. Try them. I don't want to try them. I don't enjoy them. <laughs> we. Good. If you see catnap, oh, that one does there. You're probably gonna hallucinate a bit. It'll be hard that one to does right next to me. Try using your flares on and I can't hit that sure one. He's real. He's Shit. There. Okay. Do you see that computer terminal? Aggressive. I really, most of the time, only have to worry about this one. Unless he starts coming from there or there. He just climbed up to me. What the fuck? Huh. What about above? Above, I don't know yet. Because every time I try to get around there, he just murders me. Every time I jump down at all. The real horror is the lizard cat is <laughs> multitasking. Yep. Okay. 
good. Okay. Really need to do this one first. Boom, ba -dum, ba -dum. boom, boom. What if I just hide in here? Could he even get me in here? I mean, <laughs> probably, but maybe not. Okay, let's do it. What if I just avoid him? Where is this bastard? Okay, that's the real one. Um, charge, please. The game has crashed. Fatal error. Are you? <sighs> oh my fucking god, are you shitting me? I finally figured out how to do it. I finally figured out how to do it, and you crash on me? You crash on me. Okay, back in we go. <laughs> Imagine if it didn't save my game. Oh no. <laughs> Chapter 3, Deep Sleep. Really should be a playtester, man. I push these games to the limit. Okay. If it didn't save my game, I'm just done. Like, it's <laughs> just a fact. Like, I'm not doing another three hours. Continue. Yes. Oh, thank God. Okay. Okay, we got those. Let's try this again. Okay, so make sure he's real by shooting his fucking face with fire. That one appears to be real. That one's not real. That one's very real. Um, so we should jumpy jump. Um, um. <laughs> What the fuck? I, you can't even do that third room. Like what? I said to keep moving. Shut up, Poppy. Fuck you. <sighs> I don't get it. What did I? I was shooting him in the face. Shooting him in the face did nothing but prove that he was real. Wrong side, Fu. I know. It's just like. <sighs> I guess because he was real that way. Yeah, I should have focused on this one. I can't keep climbing up and hiding like a little coward. That's the problem. This one. Good. That's right there for sure. Catnap, use those. You're probably gonna hallucinate a bit. It'll be hard to tell what these ones do. Try using your flares on Catnap to make sure he's real. He's almost there. There might be a way to kill him. If you can hold out. So yeah, that one will do that one. Do you see that computer and terminal? That one. Progressively use the batteries. Just need to, to jump up there if I need to slots. defend the left. Okay. Please don't die. Certainly didn't intend to die, but it's been happening a lot.
Okay, that one's real. Back, foul beast. That one's not real. That one's not real. That one's not real. Um. Not, oh, not real. I know I need a new battery. Can't go. Ah, sure. That's real. That caught me real. Behind me. Oh, you're up there. Oh. <laughs> So he comes from the top. I need to close that. Shit. Okay. Ah, man. Okay, now we're learning. Now we're getting there. Always look up. See, I thought that was going to be my way to escape. I thought I just had to keep him at bay for a while and then I could open that up. I was wrong. used to be a sort of panic We die and we learn. Yep. Kill, die, repeat. That's life, baby. Come at me, you big fluffy pile of crap. Real. Real? How, oh wait, how were they both real? <laughs> Maybe it doesn't count until he starts coming your way. Not real. Not real. Always look up. I mean, honestly, that's been the lesson I've been learning all day, to be fair. That one's real. That one's real. Real? Possibly real? I don't know. Fuck you. Nope. Go, go, close, 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 close. Ah, finger gun! Okay, they've opened up another door of possibilities for pain. Real, 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 real. Um. Real? Can't be real, right? I just killed one. Can't be real. Um. Um, 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 um. Real. Get fucked, kiddo. Um, bam, 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 bam. What do I need? I need a new battery. Now he's fucking everywhere. That's real. Oh, that's real. That's not good. No, no, no. None of you. Back to the pits which formed you. Thank you. Real. Oh, I don't even know how to do that one. Um. Um. 
Which one is that? It must be this one, right? It's not this one. I've never had to do that one before. Um. I, I, I don't know how to... Fuck. I don't know how to activate that one. Don't be selfish. How would I activate that one? Get out there. Okay, so let me look for that button. Beep. 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 I, I was going through. okay. There's no time to waste. He's on his way. The do, 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 do. Not what it used to be. What would make you. that one pop out then? Oh. Good. Oh, it's because I unplugged it. Now, in between the hallways, there's those two side rooms. Does that mean I just can't do any gas? And that's the gas from there. Try them. Oh, fuck. So I have to save that one, for, but I can't do the gas here either. Huh. What do I do if he comes from that way then? Do I have to... Oh, do I have to fucking shift batteries? Can... I have to shift batteries continuously. <laughs> no! I don't want to do that. It's so difficult, man. Good. That one definitely does the one right next to me. Well, that must do that one, right? Let's check. Okay, that does do that one. So is there another one in this room I've just never seen? Oh, you fucking idiot, Fuchi. <laughs> there is a fourth one. Okay, now I get it. Now we got this. We got this. So many things to do. Yeah. Did you blind? No. Did you never went into that stupid room? Get shot. Okay, for now, he can only come through these two. So it's fine. Oh, that one's real. You can't be real. I just dealt with the real one. Did she non perceptive? <laughs> See, that I will accept. That's fair. Hey, one battery's dead, but I don't trust it until I can freeze him. Let me dump gas on you again. I don't trust you. Where the fuck is he? Huh? Okay, finally. Jesus. Okay, that shuts him up for a minute. Um, I should take this one. This one does nothing. Do, 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 do. Oh, fuck. Yeah, right. That's the thing. Bye, bye. Oh, that's the colorless one they were talking about. Okay, so I still have my two defensive sides. That's real. Press the wrong button again. Really? That quickly? That does not feel right, sir. That, in fact, feels like you're cheating, sir. Okay, new battery already. That's okay. He's alive. He's over there. Shit. Okay, you know what? It's a good time to take this. Fuck me, dude, really? Oh, God. Time for a new battery.
Oh, that one's real. You can come through three sides now. He's also constantly circling behind me. Fake, fake. Fake, fake. Honestly, you just stay fake. I don't mind if you just stay fake forever. Some people don't like to show their real selves to the world. That's fine. Oh, that's the real one. Oh, shit. Um, um, um. Oh, fuck. Where do I? That's in here. Okay. Out of power again. I need to use this one. But that's what gives me my powers. No, 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 no. Out of the Um. I'm out of energy. I'm out of everything. Uh. Um, um, um. Oh, I did this. I need this. Get fucked, kiddo. God, eight seconds left. Come on, man. I earned this. Give this to me. That's real. Time remaining zero. That doesn't appear to be correct. Are we good? Oh. We're not good. We're never good. What do I... Huh? Um. 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 Fuck! I pressed the wrong thing! I'm dead. No! <sighs> it is what it is. Foo, you had it? Yeah, I know. Also... Just have to press the button. I think I have to do something with this. I I was just scared. Freaking out, man. Panicking. Good. Okay, at least you got the management down. Yeah. It's a bit nerve wracking, but it's not really actually too hard. It gives you enough time. She's not doing great. Ugh. Ain't no way they're hating on me. You're a good bad guy. Kind of pain in my ass, too. Get gassed. You do it again. Oh, we can totally do it again. Honestly, it was just unlucky. I didn't realize you had to, like, grab the fucking electricity. <laughs> I was like, huh, that thing's glowy. What's going to happen? It says zero time. It says zero time. Why the fuck? Okay, just defeated him. I'll take this one. Oh, that one's jam. That was fast. He came back fast. Did not expect that one to be real. Oh, I've already given away one of my areas. Whoops. That's fine. I can defend three. What the? Oh, was the fucking ceiling opening? Oh, I'm an idiot. 
I didn't even pay attention to that. Ah, oh, man. Giant yellow spotlights. Yeah, I, I heard the ringing, but I just kind of was too distracted by everything else. Oh, my God. Here we fucking go again. Do, 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 do. Okay. Um, um. Really fast at doing that. <laughs> Not a proud fact, but it's a fact. Uh, cube walking shadow cat. Should grab this one first too. Oh, that's a real one. Whoopsie poopsie. Goodbye, kitty cat. Goodbye, fake cat. Oh, damn. Immediately again. Jesus, dude. He wants my booty this time. on the ceiling never trust the ceiling <laughs> he's intense this round yeah he's getting real trigger happy he's just bouncing back and forth from side to side attacking real quick too why hasn't he come from the ceiling yet he's normally done that so much by now wow now he's not coming at all I mean, I guess I shouldn't complain. It just feels wrong. Fuck. Go back to sleep. Oh, it's out of battery. Um, which one next? This one? Sure. Okay, three spots. Three spots to make sure he doesn't eat me from... Oh, fuck me. No, bad, 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 bad you. Go, go away. You do not negotiate with cats in this house. Okay, that one's real. Um, what do I do? What do I do? Where's that one? Oh, uh, it's in there. Okay, um... Okay, okay, we got rid of that one. You're fake and you're fake. The ceiling's opening up again, that's fine. Go away. Bad kitty. One down. Kitty just wants to vor? Vor is a consent based thing. Oh, fuck, final battery. Oh, that one's real. Okay, we do this first. Okay, okay. Final battery. Final battery. This one? Okay, okay, okay. Oh, thank God that was fake. That's not fake! Why are you back so fast, sir? Nope, none of you. Basement cat is enough. We don't need ceiling cat. Oh, that one's real. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Um, hate that one. So finicky. Oh, I can go. Oh, 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 oh. Grab the electricity. Get him! Yeah. Burn for me. Oh, the prototype wants you. 
I mean, that's your god, right? Yeah, I don't think they care about you as much as you care about them. Maybe the prototype's trying to, like, rebuild itself, essentially. If it was, like, an amalgamation of all of the critters... Maybe... Maybe I'm helping it. Store power to the gas production zone. Um... I just want to go home, man. Can I... I just want to go home. How do I... I, I... I did that, right? I... Shouldn't I be free? Shouldn't I please... Oh, he took my arm! No. Yeah, yeah, he took my green arm. I can't use green anymore. Still got purple and fire blaster, but he took my green arm. That's some bullshit. I guess he did do that, like, giant leap at it. Plus, I, I surrounded it with a lot of electricity. Uh, I think because when you killed mommy, she said, what have you done? He will make me part of him. I didn't even, fuck, I didn't even pay attention to that at that point. There's a lot more going on than I thought there was. So possibly we're just helping Poppy like regain her original body essentially and then she's got to use it to fuck us up. We already watched that, right? Yeah, we did. Get me the fuck out of here, man. Oh, God. Rather than took, you destroyed it. Giant electric bass. Yeah. But I can blame him. That makes me feel better than me admitting that I blew it up. <laughs> Lofu, how are you? I hope you're enjoying the game. I am. It was a stressful moment. Honestly, it wasn't even the, ge the game that was stressing me out at that point. It was everybody acting like I was an idiot doing the whole like, Buchan, come on, do the thing. And it's like, I'm, I'm learning. <laughs> like, wow, give me a minute. You must feel pretty good. No, because your voice is annoying. I don't want to join one the prototype. Yeah, I don't trust Ollie. I don't trust Poppy. Definitely don't trust myself. What if I just moved it back to right instead of left? I mean, there's just one button to do either one, so... You didn't have a choice, Ollie? I know, and I never agreed to stay. She's just decided I have. Imagine Maddie invoicing Ollie each time. Oh, but you know Ollie's going to turn out to be evil and probably become part of the amalgamation that is the prototype. Uh, so why did I move the gas to the left? They never really... Regroup with Poppy in the hatch room. Which is... <laughs> I'm going to say this way. No. This way. This way feels more backward. Uh, we can't go through here. Okay, I'm going to go the way that's actually open. Is it a victory? I don't think so. I think we're being led to do something very evil. Like all this gas is being being pumped in. Good, you're here. And you've done it again. Where are you? The impossible. Just like I knew you would. Catnap's gone. The red smoke is diverted. Everything is falling into place thanks to you. I did good. So you're going to let me leave now, right? And you deserve to have the truth. Where the fuck? Oh, there you are. You came back because of your co-workers. You want to know what happened and why? Yes, give me the suitcase. This. This is your answer. Or the VHS tape. We called it the Hour of Joy. Ooh. The hour of joy. You're not going to betray me, right, Poppy? Oh, Huggy Wuggy came to life. Oh, and that's Mommy Longlegs with her huge long arms. Damn, she fucked people up. What is that? Can't even tell it was tiny.
Yay, my my wife's and kissy missy. She broke free. Oh, we haven't even seen that thing yet. Nope. Ah, and there's the kitty cat. There's her sisters. Yeah, there were like six of them back in the day. Man. One cannibal versus six teachers. Hmm. I'll take the one cannibal. One cannibal is more exciting. Hey, there's the giant poppy shaped hole in the wall. So everything came alive. Hearing every moment of it. Oh, her voice is intense now. It went on so long. So agonizingly long. Oh, 60 minutes. It's in the name. To run. Anything to stay alive. I remember their cries. Oof. What's going on? Why is this happening? What are those things? <laughs> Senseless slaughter. That's all it really was. They killed everyone. They Sorry, I had to. Innocent. Didn't matter. All of that death didn't fix anything. What were they trying to then, fix? Once it was all over, they dragged those corpses down below where they'd never be found. And they ate the bodies to stay alive. Oh, hey, Kissy Missy. The prototype has to die for this, for everything. Okay. Kill the prototype. That's cool. I'm on board. As long as I get to leave. Ah, oh, you could tiny little puppy. I'm coming with you. Soon as we reach the bottom, we'll send the lift back up. Mm. Just hold tight, okay? No, I'm coming with you. Fuck that shit. Let's go. After you. She did the shaft head tilt. Boom. You coming, Missy Kissy? Thank you. Oh, she was talking to Kissy Missy when she said we'd be right. right back up. Once we hit the ground, we need to be cautious. There's something. What? What's she doing? This is... The prototype got her. No, no, no! We're coming! Just hold on! Nope, we're getting oh, sealed in. Sorry, Poppy. I still don't know who's good or bad. <laughs> um, so Poppy wants to kill the prototype, but the prototype may be a combination of all of them, which means it may include her. That's why I wanted Kissy to come with us. Yeah, there was really no reason for Kissy to stay up there. I have a thing that can literally throw a switch from like miles away. They just did that to kill off Kissy Missy. I guess they decided it was like too OP for you to be running around with a kissy missy carrying poppy. Chapter 3 end. That was great. Man, the fucking staff on this game has gone higher and higher each time as well. Definitely been getting better each time. I... I feel like a lot of the things in this one were less obvious. <laughs> there are a lot more areas that, like, I got lost in. Maybe that's just my dumb brain. I have been awake. I only slept two hours last night. <laughs> but I don't know. Every other one felt like super intuitive other than that one puzzle I got stuck on. That one was definitely my own brain's fault. But yeah, in this one, I just don't know if they just didn't explain mechanics well enough. Because I didn't understand you had to like close the door on the dude's face above you. Uh, highly recommend game theory videos to fill in the gaps. That's the plan. I also am interested to see if that teacher and the head of the thing are the same voice actress. And now she's sus. I'll die for Poppy. That scene got me fucked up. Her VA needs a medal. Honestly, her VA is freaking killing it. This game better end with her singing a song. Because she fucking killed it in Hasbin Hotel as well. One feels heavy lore based. Oh, for sure. Yo, they have three voice directors. Poppy and Stella. Who's Stella? Scientist, Claire's type, I think I did Harmon, Claire Hoffer, Hartman, White Rich. Scientist, Joseph's type, Ollie. Dog Day, Harley Sawyer, Radio Voice, Mr. Light. Oh, shit! Wow, she was all of the little baby things. Counselor, Hopscotch, Crafty Corn, Bobby Bear Hug. Holy shit. Avalon Delaney, you're a fucking beast. Um... 
And yeah, the prototype is an amalgamation of all of their voices. I didn't see the name of the person, though. <laughs> I don't know if they were the same one. Wait! The voice actress I love is also the fucking director of the 2D animation? And the songwriter? Okay, I'm looking this person up after this. Avalon Delaney. What the? He did a lot on this one. <laughs> oh my god. Damn Slay. Yeah, she did so many voice roles and she fucking directed the 2D animation. That's crazy. Bum, ba -da -bum. Quality assurance. That's me. I found so many bugs today. <laughs> I did my best. <laughs> I mean, you have to do mostly more than one job when you work on indie games. Yeah, but that was just a lot. Like, normally, you can expect... Like, when I saw a bunch of voice roles, I was like, yo, that's impressive. Finding out she not only did that many voice roles, but then also did all... Like, did the fucking direction for the animation. Jesus. Can't believe they left us on such a cliffhanger. Rip kissy missy. Yeah, missy kissy gone. It's fine. Oh, I didn't know this was dubbed in other languages as well. Interesting. Like this, I completely, like, it's not surprising to me when voice actors have multiple roles. That's the point of voice actors. They're incredible like that. Just the fact that she was also, like, the director of the 2D animation was where I was like, ha ha ha. <laughs> Ever got your kiss from Kissy Mishy? That's okay, I'm over Kissy Missy. I'm all about Mr. Light now. Mr. Light is the way to go. That's that's the true end game here. I'm going to kill the amalgamation prototype thing. I'm, I'm going to keep the Miss, Mr. Light part. I'm going to keep that around. Maybe reanimate it. Maybe. That's dependent. <laughs> True passion project. Hell yeah. They did so good. It's interesting that they're different in everything as well. It's like multiple people did multiple languages for each one, but Jesus. Korean cast, Korean translation. I wonder if I'm going to recognize any of the like Japanese say you. See how much of the story you remember in like a year or whenever the next chapter comes out. It's going to be forever, man. I do not. Wait. No. Some of those names jumped out at me, but no, I don't recognize any of them. Maybe the multiplayer project? Play There's going to be a multiplayer poppy playtime. Jesus. They've been doing so many of those games recently. Like horror collab things where it's like four to six people trying to escape from an enemy. Mr. Light in Japanese is an experience. Oh, God. Am I going to have to replay this? <laughs> Play Roblox? Never! For those who waited patiently, thank you for continuing to stand by us and for all that you do and say to support this franchise. We care for so much. We see your videos, speculations, controversies, the love you give us, blah, 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 tenuous, probably plenty of time as much as it does. Horror teaches anything to look forward, not back, and look forward. Bigger, 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 stronger horrors. Stay tuned for more, lovelies. Mom Entertainment! That's a nice message. There's already... Oh, wait. There's already the multiplayer version? Holy shit. Replay and... Ca oh, so can I just... Wait. Let me see if I can... Um, language. Audio language. Nihongo. Yes. Kissy papi. Miss the light chase. That's all I want. <laughs> oh, Mr. Light. Well, he's got a really good voice, too. Ollie doesn't sound so much like a child in this one. Sounds like a young woman. I, I went the wrong way. <laughs> I fucked that up immediately. <laughs> Ollie's Japanese voice is so much better. I like him in both. It's just definitely the English one sounds more like a child. Whereas the Japanese one sounds like a young woman. Yes. He's okay now, though. I don't care, Ollie. I just want to hear my wife. Where? 
where? How far do I have to go? Meanwhile, our voice sounds like Dora. <laughs> yep. <laughs> it's good though. Oh god, I love her. Oh my fucking god. Okay, yeah. Miss Delight is the end game. Miss Delight, in fact. Let me just Google. No, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> but yeah, that voice is actually fucking incredible. Who does that remind me of? Um, Gokugan, yeah. It reminds me actually of the teacher from Danganronpa. Free the anime. The one who went real, real fun. <laughs> I think her name was Chise, but the Danganronpa 3, like, past size anime, the teacher for, like, the Danganronpa 2 kids. She sounds like that. Celestia Ludenberg or Joysama Desu. Fun. Stay till the part she's played Stern Jandere. Oh, that's so long, though. I don't even know how to get to there. <laughs> Who want to hear it, though? Come on, just attack me. I'm out here by myself. Can't do anything. I'm so defenseless. Pretty sure I need to get the two batteries and then we're good to go. Always look up because that's the truth. Okay. Oh, this time. Ah, Yukizome Chise. Yeah! Yukizome Chise was crazy. Walked right past one. <laughs> Shit. Okay, one down. How do I get to the second one? I know I have to get them to the vents somehow. I don't remember where the entrance to the vents was. Oh, yeah. You can just crawl under this. I keep... Don't leave me! No! I'm coming for you. She aras as well. <laughs> okay, she's fucking awesome. Oh my god, that switch to the Yandere mode is so intense. <laughs> it was great in English, don't get me wrong. The English voice actress did amazing, but Jesus Christ. Oh god, this voice actor is doing like the real intense shit. Oof. Okay, come on, hit me with some more. <laughs> come on, I know you're close. Uh, you're right there. Open up. Open up. So close. I just want to hear the laugh she does when she's chasing you more than anything. Shit, do I have... Oh, I don't have the fire gun yet. Yep, up we go. As per usual. When life gives you grabby hands, you go up. Olga getting his special... Wait, what? <laughs> no. She's close, and so are you. Oh, God, that's too far, man. <laughs> there she is. She's super close. I don't get how she teleports like that. that was fucking incredible. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Oh, this is the point. Come on. Come on, break in. Come at me. You're not gonna laugh at me? Come on. Such a prime target for being laughed at and murdered. Okay, that's less sexy than the English version. I kinda wanna get killed. Yeah, okay, she's not. 
She went full monstrous evil with her laugh. <laughs> Holy shit, that's actually scary. This voice actress is incredible. <laughs> She doesn't even just lead into like the sexy yandere shit. She goes ahead and just delivers. Fuck me. Okay, I definitely want to get killed by her too. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay, end me. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah, okay. I'm looking up exactly which name that is. I wonder... Because, I mean, in an indie game like this, there's a possibility she's like a Japanese indie VTuber for all I know as well. Or like a Seiyu that just, yeah. Oh, man. She did a great job. Everyone in the English version did a great job as well. But, man, thank you for telling me to play that in Japanese. That shit was crazy. <laughs> she went full into the Yandere. Okay. Goodbye, Poppy Playtime Chapter 3. Such a good job, honestly. Oh my god. I was surprised how much I've liked Poppy Playtime. Um, I just expected a silly, like, walking simulator kind of horror game. But the mechanics are really good. The puzzles are sometimes really interesting. Sometimes they make me feel dumb. But, I mean, that's part of the fun, too. <laughs> um, let me play... Uh, let's go with your step. There we go. I believe you finished this in one go. I mean, it's only been five and a half hours. This is like small numbers for us. <laughs> Having said that, like I said, I've been awake since 5.30. Um, we have to show up for most like uh, 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 sponsorship streams like two hours early to make sure absolutely everything is in check and stuff. So Chan is a pro gamer? No, that took me forever. The fact that Astro managed to finish all three of these games within eight hours still blows my mind. I wonder if he'd played them before, because he just he must have just ran through them. Um, the game is well crafted and full with attention and love from the developers. Yeah, I definitely need to go check out the lore after this. See like the lore deep dives that people did into it to see what that actually is, all the stories, what they've been able to glean from things. Also, shit! God damn it. I forgot the name. <laughs> I forgot the name of the English voice actress. It didn't even say for sure the Japanese voice actress. It just like listed out everybody who worked on the voices. Which leads me to believe that in Korean and Japanese, they did even more like one voice actor and actress like doing like five to six roles a piece. Because yeah, with like the Spanish dub, the English dub. Oh, thank you. Avalon Delaney. Kind of want to look that up right now just to find out what they're up to. Not gonna lie, this is why VTubers are awesome. So often it's just like, wow, that person has an awesome voice. And then you just Google the name of the person. It's like, oh, they have a VTuber too and they stream. Awesome. Um, Avalon Delaney, Poppy Playtime Wiki. Cut out, cut out. Okay, so she was the counselor. Doesn't actually say whether she was, I don't know if the counselor refers to the one that I thought was the same voice. Bum, ba -da -bum, ba -da -bum. Well, she's on TikTok. Oh, comic, Cosmic Cosmo. Creator of Smiling Critters. Oh, so I knew she did the animation, but damn. 2D art lead for Poppy Playtime, voice actress. Damn. Heads up to a lot. She did the art for the new sexy... Oh. I did the art for the new sexy version of what's her name? <gasps> okay, yeah, I'm keeping my eyes on this shit. <laughs> anyway, it's cool to see indie VTubers pop off in different projects slash roles. Hell yeah. It's nice that just like, because a lot of people don't want to stream because they don't want to like give away their identity. That's one of the great things about being like a VTuber, but also like voice actors as well. A lot of people use like fake names, pseudonyms, nom de plums, just so they won't get recognized in real life. And so the VTuber world and the voice actor world like crosses over so well. Phone nerd, Tascaru. I mean, always when it comes to voices. Too old for TikTok, same. I just saw TikTok and I was like, no. 
Alina, I'm timing you out for the next five minutes. I've told you multiple times I do not plan on playing that game anytime soon. But thank you for the offer. Multiple times, even though I said nah. Yeah, I'm not planning on playing Roblox anytime soon. Boom! Oh, that's the wrong. Oh, God. I clicked so many of the wrong things in a row. There we go. That's what I wanted. Perfect. Def Kuz one out of five. Oh, thank you for donating them a few funds. <laughs> That's long. Today is my third time celebrating my birthday with you in the sheet pile. I may have written an essay here. I'm sorry in advance. There's nothing to be sorry for. It's just, damn, that's a lot of super chats. Thank you so much. Two out of five. Before I met you in the sheepies, I thought I was happy. I need to realize that I wasn't, and I simply was just empty. Then I met you, and it was like a light broke all the walls that trapped me. You're like a ray of light that always shines when I was in the dark. I thought it was just a moment that I'd tossed in no time. But your presence kept growing and unknowingly became one of the sources of my smiles. Oh man, this is so nice. Even after a really tiring day when I saw you retweeting things, interacting with everyone, saw your waiting room, even just the little things, it made me smile and think, ah, I have something to look forward to. Aww. So freaking sweet, man. This is one of my favorite parts of the day, too. Here I know I can only say thank you for being one of the best pages in my book called Life. But I ask you to please, dear sir, multiply it by infinity. I bar you. Ah! You don't over... Wait, that's shit. That's the zoomed in one. <laughs> I was gonna... Bah. Uh, uh, reverse Uno. How dare you? <laughs> Number one, happy birthday. I hope you're having a wonderful birthday, Def Kuzu. Thank you so much for being such an active member of the community and being so sweet to everybody. It genuinely means so much. But that's just really sweet, man. That was just really well worded as well. The whole like, oh, you became an important part of my life without me even realizing it. Like you were one of the sources of my smiles. That's great. I hope you have many other sources to your smiles as well. But thank you so much. That's so sweet. Especially just talking about like just interacting with other people, um, doing things on Twitter. It's just so sweet. Thank you so much, Def Kuzu. Happy birthday. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Thank you so much for being here. Um, God, I don't even, um, you, uh, uh, here. This will do. Squeeze it to sheep. Here. Thank you so much for being part of the sheep pile. Thank you so much for being a confidant. Hope you have a lovely birthday and an incredible year in general. Thank you so much for being here for the really sweet comment holy crap <laughs> so sweet please take care i know right only i could write like that <laughs> i know the feel <laughs> that was just really well worded and really well delivered so thank you so much okay i'm gonna go back to old super chats and then we'll see don't pinch her but it was like not oh not the bubble wrap that wasn't even bubble wrap that's just me touching my microphone this this is the bubble wrap I love bubble wrap. It's so satisfying. <laughs> no, thank you so much. No, thank you so much. You multiply it by 50. Happy birthday. Thank you so much for being part of the community. Thank you so much for being here today, Def Kuzu. I met Jacob. Thank you for donating the full funds. Have a wonderful stream for Chan and an amazing day. It has been an amazing day. Like I said, that sponsorship was such a freaking joy as well. I was genuinely shocked. <laughs> like the whole thing was just like so telegraphed without us like having a script or anything. It was just like, hey, do an introduction, talk about this thing, watch this animation, come back and open some toys. It was awesome. And then coming on to like poppy playtime after this is fantastic. <laughs> you hear the jackpot? Yeah, it's been such a good day. Clowny, thank you for donating the full finds. But John, I'm glad to see you having fun and feeling better. It's been weeks, but Archivist's face still feels viejo sabroso. Um, I'll be joining the VOD gang later. Have a nice stream, everybody. Oh, so you probably already went to sleep, but that's okay. Thank you for being here, Clowny. I hope you had a wonderful day. I have to Google viejo sabroso. I search for that, and I just see a bunch of pictures of Android 17. Uh... Oh, it means sexy old man. <laughs> the literal translation is... I see. <laughs> the literal translation is intense. <laughs> intense. It means curving or tilting. 
I mean, as the English dub for ghost stories told us years and years ago. Yeah. Someday you'll appreciate <laughs> the pleasures of a good curve or however the fuck they rhymed it. Why the fuck is that the literal translation? So yeah, based on those two pieces of information, you should understand what the curving or tilting is. <laughs> anyway, that was fun. <laughs> Thank you for turning the food funds, Clowny. Did not expect to ever learn that, but now... Why is it Android 17? I mean, unless there's like a but Android 17's not... Oh, oh, it's him looking at fucking... Wait. He's looking at Dr. Giro. Is this a ship I've never heard about before? Viejo Super Sabroso? What? Okay, this is a meme. I need to learn more about this later. I... My brain. Because it's a phrase the Mexican voice actor said. Oh... What, did he just release that as like a short video or something? Either way, that's fucking hilarious. <laughs> Wait, Yuri. Sorry, I meant Yowie. Uh, my dear. I have two hours of sleep. I've been awake for almost 12 hours now and streaming for like eight of them. For like eight of them. <laughs> Wait, no. Five plus a one and a half. Six, seven, seven, seven of them. B cream, thank you for donating. The I can't even do math anymore. Thank you for donating the food funds, B cream. Achi foo, it was so much fun watching with my comfy bestie. Oh, that's awesome. One of our cats kept trying to pour at your hair on the TV when it would move during the big cat nap fight. Thank you. Yeah, I can make it go all around the place. It only really works like when we're actually zoomed in like this, though. When you can't see the bottom half, you can't see it like clap near the bottom. <laughs> Perfect cat toy. Hell yeah. Just like Azuki san. <laughs> really helped break the tension. Thank you for always brightening our days. No problem. Yeah, I had a lot of fun with this one. I mean, even, yeah, it actually genuinely jump scared me like three times. I was impressed. She was very determined. <laughs> yeah, she's like, it's moving. Why can't I grab it? Why does it feel so solid? I literally see it there swinging left and right. Up and down, back and forward. I should be able to grab it. <laughs> Four times. I know, right? Worth it, though. Also, this is a popular game. There's definitely some interesting artwork I need to look up later. Thank you for donating the food funds, B Cream. I hope you have a wonderful evening. Please rest well. Take it easy. And thank you so much for being here. Hope both you and your comfy bestie had a wonderful day. Careful with that cat. Be careful. We've seen what happened to Colt. The, the, the cat nap. That's a problem. Rain the Fuchan sheep. Archie Fuchan. Congrats. Oh, shit. I didn't. Even, what the fuck? Oh, break free just keeps climbing. That's crazy. Thank you so much for donating the Fu Funds, Rain the Fuchan sheep. I didn't even know. God. Did we even. I remember hitting two mil. I remember hitting three mil. I don't even remember four mil. But five mil is fucking huge. That's crazy. Thank you for letting me know. Isn't slowing down at all? Yeah, that's awesome. There is, um, I mean, a lot of other people have talked about this before, and I've mentioned it as well. Uh, but finally, <laughs> there's a lot going on around Nijisan GEN. Uh, they've announced two of the things that we're doing for our third year anniversary. There's two more on the way. And it's apparently going to be a pretty big year just in general, like for like the next full on year like towards the end of like 2025 even um we've been talking about things that are going to be like taking place a year and a half from now which is kind of crazy to me but yeah they're working hard on like delivering a lot of stuff for everybody and just the same way i think i saw ray Mumu say it um yeah at this point it's very much like hopefully we've gotten through the shitty parts of this year <laughs> and so i think for a lot of us it's just a case of like getting back to streaming now and just essentially trying to say thank you to you guys for sticking around being nice to our communities because yeah it's been a rough time for everybody so it'll be nice to just hang out and be chill and be just fun <laughs> just sharing what we actually want to enjoy in the future but yeah thank you guys so much for being here hope you'll continue to love things throughout 2024 and through 2025 so many people are working on so many different things. Aya's going fucking nuts right now. Fish just keeps doing covers. Marty Dean's got a cover and a freaking... Yeah, okay, she did announce that. I was gonna say, Marty Dean's got a cover and an outfit coming out soon. So yeah, 
Everybody's cooking like a lot right now. Even the people that it seemed like just disappeared for a while. A lot of them were like working on things in the background. But yeah, should be good. We're cooking? Exactly. Cooking lots of things because yeah, we're so thankful to you guys for being such amazing fans, for being such an incredible community. So we want to try to reward you because you guys have been so sweet to us throughout. I mean, ever since I joined, but <laughs> just in general. Did you use cooking so hot? We can't wait. Yeah, hopefully it'll be worth it for all the times people have had to like disappear for sure. Whilst. It'll actually start to pay off now, which is nice. <laughs> um, oh, yo, Hachi, wa, Hachi, Washi, wa, Hachi, Washi, Hachi. Sorry, that name is a bit of a tongue twister for me. Your artwork is beautiful, by the way, though. I always love seeing it. Happy belated birthday, Fuchang. I hope you have another wonderful year. Thank you. I'm planning on it. Other than that stupid flu I just got over. <laughs> God, I still can't believe. At least it didn't. You know what? It would have been actually worse if it had hit one day earlier. Because I think it definitely was worse the day after that. Like, I completely lost my voice and I was straight up delirious. I had to go to a meeting. <laughs> well, I was super delirious. And I was just sitting there with like Albanyan like, uh-huh. And I remember like the manager's sons being like, Fuchan, are you even like understanding any of this? And I was just like, mm-hmm. Yeah, no, don't, don't, don't worry. It'll, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. <laughs> and it worked out. I figured out everything I needed to do for Azuki-san, setting up all the different scenes and stuff. <laughs> but yeah, that was, that was an experience. <laughs> the really fast recovery for a flu, especially for how bad it was. I'm just feeling like really lucky recently because I did. I, I mean, that flu has been like on and off for like, I feel like three weeks now. Where I've just been like getting little bits of like a sore throat and a headache and stuff like that. But yeah, the fact that it like hit real fucking hard and then disappeared real quickly. My throat was kind of fucked on singing day, but then my voice was completely gone the day after. And then I was fucking seeing shit. Oh, it was fun. It was fun. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much. Hachi, washi, hachi. <laughs> I'll try to pronounce that properly from here on out. I am planning on having another wonderful year, and I hope we'll all have a wonderful year. I, I'm just really excited. Like, I'm I, honestly, I'm finally at the point. Um, I've got my schedule ready for next week. I'll share that tomorrow. Obviously, when we do the Sunday stream. What are we doing tomorrow? <gasps> oh shit! Tomorrow is Tagainu no Chi Day. Oh, that's gonna be wild. Um, so yeah, we're doing Tagainu no Chi tomorrow and I'll share my schedule for the next week. Uh, I've got one day off and we're doing, <laughs> this is the problem because <laughs> we're doing a revenge stream for Archivist Advice and we're doing a revenge stream pretty much as soon as I can for the Zatsudan birthday thing. Because there were so many beautiful birthday projects and fan arts and everything else going on. So yeah, I'll tell you guys that. I mean... Night in the Woods on Monday, Zatsudan on Tuesday. Um, we're doing hot takes with Aya again sometime this week. I don't remember when. <laughs> sometime in the evening. Uh, 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 and yeah, we'll do Archivist Advice sometime. I think Saturday. It was either Friday or Saturday. Uh, but yeah, there should be some other fun things going on as well. Can't wait to see how unhinged the advice becomes. It'll probably become pretty <laughs> unhinged. That's just how we go. Shit goes wild. <laughs> it starts off with like normal simple questions and then it turns into people like asking yo there's a tentacle monster under my bed what should i do i don't want it to leave <laughs> so no april fools nah this like yeah i wanted to do something for april fools but just with the flu hitting and everything else that's been going on i really need a break <laughs> like i'm definitely going to take two weeks off in like a month I'm going to try to get most of the way through April, essentially. March? April? Yeah, April. Um, so I'm probably going to take a break somewhere around like the 28th of April for like two weeks until like, I don't know, the 11th of May. May. So no fuck boy over this year. We'll see what happens on Twitter. Um, definitely just like the stream for Monday is just night in the woods. <laughs> I didn't have time to like set up anything else interesting. So honestly... Once I get through this week and I've done like archivist advice and wah, 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 wah. the birthday tot no tot much the birthday is at Sudan I'm probably gonna have a pretty chill time so no Legardis day <laughs> don't worry about that 
<laughs> Aye. Just because I'm on a break doesn't mean some things won't happen. <laughs> Look forward to that. If everything goes according to plan, yeah, 505 may have something special going on in it. But that's if everything goes to plan. There may be nothing. Um, but yeah, if everything goes to plan, there's something planned for that. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. But yeah, other than that, I'm just like taking a two week break because this time, unlike with the Archivist debut, <laughs> everything seems to be getting ready pretty early for the um, for the Shepherd debut. Like I've now, I've got the backgrounds. Both of them are animated and done. So we've got our forest ready to go and they're animated. They're fully animated. Um, what else was there? They're still working on the big, big, big thing that I've only ever said openly on membership. Um, like some of the art and stuff that I've like requested has gotten coming in as already. It would be coming in as well already. <laughs> so yeah, it looks like everything will probably be done. Maybe even by Legardis Day, everything will be ready by Shepard. So I just need to, I still don't know. That, that two weeks is probably going to be like me switching off my brain for like a week. And then one week of like intense focusing on writing Legardis 505 and finding something creative to do for the Shepard debut. Because I've got a lot of things to share with you guys. And the Shepard, like lore and look by itself is going to be amazing. <laughs> so I'm very excited to share that with you guys. It's just, yeah, like, how do I do it? Um, Like I liked the things I did for the Archivist <laughs> where we like took group photos and stuffs and had some role playing going on with different characters. Wait, was that White Day? Is that White Day or the Archivist? No, the Archivist debut, yeah, definitely had the different pictures and stuff. See, everything's blurring together. <laughs> to be fair, I haven't had like a break that's been more than two days. I figured this out the other day since December when I took like a health related couple of weeks off. Um, So yeah, it's been three months, which is pretty unusual for me. Normally like every two months, I throw it in for a week or two. <laughs> which membership did I miss? Um... Just the membership posts. I think it was like three months ago on our monthly membership post. Um, I announced like the big thing, which I poured a lot of resources into because I'm very excited for it. I can't wait to see it. That one's not done yet, but oh God, I'm so excited. What happened to the White Day VOD, by the way? Um, it's down for now. It may come up in the future. It's, it's a discussion topic. Having said that... <laughs> That's what they told me about my Walking Dead VODs too, so <laughs> we'll, we'll see what happens. Uh, hopefully we'll be able to come back someday. But I know like a lot of people already like have other places to watch it, so it's all good. But yeah, hopefully we'll be able to put it back up someday so you guys can watch it on the official channel. I worked really hard on that one, <laughs> so hopefully. <laughs> oh shit, yeah, that's the other big thing. Um, so I've been cooking a lot in the background. However, <laughs> you know how I told you guys I've been recording so many voice backs? Um, three of them were turned down. <laughs> three of them had content where they were like, Fuchan, you can't put this in a, you can't put this in a voice back. So I'm just, I'm just going to release them as free videos on the YouTube channel. Um, essentially, because they're fine for YouTube. I think it's just like a voice back thing. Like it becomes like a marketing thing. So yeah. Um, it'll be fine on YouTube. They'll just be like individual videos without any like, I say videos, individual videos without like any animation. It will just be like a still image, maybe even just a blank image, honestly. But I'm not sure if I want to upload those as like YouTube videos or just like put them on Google Drive and just let you guys download them. I don't know. But I worked really hard on those three, so I definitely want to share them. Uh, the first one's very gachi koi kind of thing. Like it's very... It's not romantic. It's more like just taking care of you kind of thing. And I don't think I can talk about the other two because um, it might give away the themes for the next couple of voice packs. <laughs> so sorry, Fuchan. It's fine. I mean, I worked really hard on them. This is the thing. Like they tell me like, oh, I'm sorry. This doesn't like they gave me ways that I could have changed it so that I could have released it. But at that point, I was just like, nah, <laughs> like it would have changed the dialogue here or there and like some of the more like adult themes. So I'm just like, it's okay. I, I, I'll just release it my own way. I don't want to like take out parts. I'd rather just, especially since like when you've edited all the audio and stuff, it's a lot to do. But yeah, no, it's no problem. It's just, yeah, I'm sorry. I won't be able to release those ones as voice packs. I don't know if that means there's any like official voice packs coming out, <laughs> but I'll at least have three well edited audio things that aren't, that, they're just essentially going to be fan voice packs. I'm just going to release them like 
uh, the same day that the other ones all go live it's just yeah um they're just gonna be free for you guys to enjoy so they'll be on membership i wasn't even gonna do it on membership i was probably just gonna drop the file and be like oh here's mine um couldn't release it properly but go for it kind of thing Try princess thank you for donating the food funds uh no message but i hope you enjoyed this stream today i hope you have a lovely evening thank you so much for being here and please rest well and margarita thank you for the stream it was so much fun also i have a question oh here we go <laughs> what did baby corn said to the wait no it, wah, wah. you can't do that joke on me margarita that was literally one of the white day jokes <laughs> We, we we threw popcorn at Legardus. That, that was one of the, the, the jokes that linked up to one of the silly three, sec uh, four? Four secret somethings. <laughs> I, I used that joke like a couple weeks ago. <laughs> the white wave one doesn't exist. We do what we want. You, you can't steal the dad jokes I've already used. <laughs> God, I forgot. Maybe that's why it jumped at you. You saw it and you were like, something about this joke speaks to me <laughs> but the vod is gone i mean everything any niji sanji liver does gets like re-released in like a dozen other places <laughs> like uh, the vod isn't on my channel but it's elsewhere let's be fair <laughs> vivian thank you for donating the food funds Achifuchina. thank you for today's stream i bought the blind box right away after seeing your parfait photo yeah i'm actually i've got him right here with me I've got a little Legardus. He's actually attached to my... How do I make him make a sound? <laughs> but yeah, no, I've got him with his little panini around his head hanging from my microphone. Yeah, squishy toys don't really make a good sound. But yeah, he's chilling with me. Can I get it back attached though, is the question. Am I going to do what Albin did and get it permanently attached is the main question. Oh, let's try this. If I go on the Velcro part should be fine eh, eh, get on there you son of a come on can i oh god it's so stiff this is actually made really well i'm not gonna lie i'm so used to like keychains and other things being so fragile this thing i am having to fucking drag there we go okay legatus in a panini hat which has its own fucking holder it's so awesome is now hanging from my microphone again your pape yeah the legatus pape I'm still hoping someday to be able to do a uh, Archivist Pape. Or an Archivist Nui. Either one would make me happy. Um, I just want some more Archivist stuffs. <laughs> it's today RP day. I mean, it wasn't the plan, but it's delicious panini day. <laughs> Where are the Azuki sounds you got? Oh, I already put them downstairs. Um, yeah. I got so many Azukis. I got the giant uh, caterpillar one, which is pretty damn big it's not like full Daki Makura size but it's like half Daki Makura size so it's pretty damn long it definitely like goes the whole way from like my chest from my head down to my pelvis essentially um so you can't like wrap it completely around yourself like you can with full Dakis but it's close enough where like Marty Din said like sticking it between your legs is really good for your posture and then you can still hold it to your chest and stuff um I got the two 20 cm ones so I got the normal color and the pink color Azuki sign and then I got the blind box of six Azuki signs. I kind of wanted the giant Azuki sign. <laughs> when they said like, hey, these new ones are 20 centimeters. They're small. They'll fit in more places. I was like, cool. Give me the big boy. I wish to ride him into battle. <laughs> but yeah, my my bedroom is currently full of Azuki signs. And Legatus is now hanging out with me. He used to be down in my bedroom, but fuck it. If he can attach to my microphone now, fuck it. Legatus, you're there forever. Anyway, <laughs> happy late birthday, and I hope you feel better now. I feel much better, and I hope you enjoy the blind box too. I hope you get whichever of the Izuki signs you're looking forward to. I really want to watch that show now, because it reminds me a lot. And I couldn't say this on the stream, because <laughs> obviously you never want to conflate two things. But yeah, it reminds me a lot of like Law Shao Hei, um, which is another Dong Hua, so Chinese animation about like a cute little black cat. Like the early episodes of Shao Hei were just always... Xiaohei running around inside the house and doing like normal human things before he got like very shansha and there was spirits everywhere and like monsters and battles and stuff. The early episodes were very much like um, Azuki-san. I'm looking forward to seeing more of Azuki-san. Seeing how cute the rest of it is. <laughs> Ruby Lupine, thank you so much for donating the full funds. Hi Fuchun! I didn't get a chance to say this earlier in the week, so happy belated birthday. 
really is kind of weird that I'm almost exactly a year older than you. <gasps> Wait, when's your birthday? Almost exactly. In which case? Happy belated or early birthday. <laughs> Depending on which one it is. Thanks for the stream. No problem. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for being here, Ruby Lupine. Have a lovely evening. and Thank you so much. Have you seen the Xiaohei movie, Pinkroll? Yeah, I have. In fact, yeah, you're a member of the membership. Um, if you check uh, my membership videos, me, Uki, Enna, and Millie, and we all shared it, like we all did a membership stream of it at the same time. Uh, we did a group watch along to the movie prequel. I'd already seen it before that, but I wanted to share it with them. Um, and then we had to do multiple views <laughs> just to make sure nobody felt left behind. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It was such a cute and fun stream. It was. It actually, it made Uki properly fall in love with Xiaohei, which was awesome. I was surprised. I thought if anybody was going to fall in love with Xiaohei, it would be like Millie or Enna. It's just like, cute little cat. Adorable. <laughs> and then it got into like some aspects of it. Millie, I don't think was super into anything. But yeah, Uki is like super into Xiaohei now. I've seen him like collecting some of the figures, sharing some of the things. Uki had such a good time. Yeah, it's such a good movie. It's so emotional. It's got like that feeling of like classic Disney movies. <laughs> like Disney movies up until Encanto maybe? Is Encanto even Disney? Ah, oh, fuck it. Anyway, it's really good. It's got that like, it's fun for the whole family, but the older you are, the more you can understand about like the things going on as well. Especially when it came to the whole like, hey, humans suck. Let's just kill them all and create our own world. Shit got crazy. Encanto is Disney, let's go. See, Encanto is amazing. And I have not watched Enchanted, but I have not heard good things. Called Enchanted, the like, the one where they gave like the magic mirror a backstory and stuff. I don't know. I'm not interested in seeing that, but I heard bad things. <laughs> Alpi cat ears, thank you for donating the food funds. And look at this good boy. I too flew, have a good rest. Thank you, I will. <laughs> and maybe cat ears, they got a big old doggy. Thank you so much for donating the food funds and I hope you have a lovely evening. Enchanted was Chris Pratt. Chris Pratt? In Enchanted. Movie? Amy Adams. Tina Menzel. Oh, this was the live... Okay, this is the one where, like, Disney characters got summoned into the live-action movie. Wasn't Chris Pratt? Nah. Amy Adams, Patrick Dempsey, James Marsden, Rachel Convoy, Susan Sarandon. Um, that, 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 that was completely not what I was thinking about, though. That's the one where, like, Disney characters get drawn into the live action real world. Chris Pratt isn't everyone, right? I mean, he's somehow fucking both Mario and Garfield, so... <laughs> he's kind of everybody. I mean... If you need a white guy in Hollywood, you either go to like Tom Holland, who's like the super young one. It's like he could technically play a teenager, even though he's in his mid twenties. Um, you either go for Tom Holland for a young white guy. You go for Chris Pratt for like a slightly older white guy. And if you want slightly older than that, you go for what's his name? What's Daddy Dilf and everything? Ooh, uh, uh, Pedro Pascal. There you go. <laughs> it's Chris Pratt's universe and we're all just living in it. I mean, honestly, that's just crazy. I, 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 did Garfield ever release? Is he doing a Garfield voice or is he just Chris Pratt as Garfield again? Because <laughs> that's my main question. The funniest quote I've ever heard in my life was still him being like, yeah, Mario isn't Italian anymore. He's normal. And it was like, please try to write that better. <laughs> Ryan Reynolds and Ryan Gosling are good universal ones too. Ah, oh, hell yeah. True. I was just making a joke. They, they've, they've just been having a good few years. That three actors, they're like in everything. The fact that there were talks about making Tom Holland Link in The Legend of Zelda. No, he, he can't be Mar He can't be fucking Link and the main dude from Uncharted. That just makes zero fucking sense. I, I really hope they don't go for like a star-studded cast for the Zelda one. Just, just just give people who could actually do the voices. You have most of the voices. Just grab the voice cast from fucking Tears of the Kingdom. Then you only have to cast Link. We're getting a Zelda movie. Yeah. I'm very scared of it. I am very scared of it. Because that's like my favorite series of all time. 
Link doesn't talk much, at least. They're, they're going to make him talk. They're 100% going to make... You can't have an actual Zelda movie and just have him not talk. The real Zelda movie, Link won't talk. See? I'd be okay with that. Just, you know what? That would be fucking hilarious. Just give a reason for it in the story, even. You can be like, oh, yeah, no, he's, he's just mute. He um, saw some crazy shit when he was a child. He just doesn't speak to anyone. Just have him do that. Yeah, say, say, kind of stuff. Scared to leave my games alone. I mean, the Mario movie was pretty good, is the thing. And I was absolutely terrified of that one before it came out because it was Illumination, who I just know as the Minions people. <laughs> so Illumination proved me wrong and showed they genuinely do care about the source material, at least. Yeah, there was so much love and attention put into that movie. It wasn't amazing. It wasn't groundbreaking, but it was a fun time. Um, it also definitely, a lot of them didn't feel like the actual characters. But it was a good time. That's all that really matters. Princess Peach did not feel like Peach. Mario was just Chris Pratt. <laughs> Luigi was pretty spot on Luigi, despite everything else. <laughs> and you had like Donkey Kong and like the weird like group of Kongs and stuff and all kinds of other shit going on, man. Mario movie is pretty good. Honestly, yeah, it's pretty damn good. What up, Phantomos? What up, Mumu? Welcome back. I hope you're having a lovely time coming back to streaming. But hello, everybody. Welcome. Um, I'm just doing a wrap up. We finished Poppy Playtime like an hour ago, less than an hour, like 30 minutes ago. Uh, so we're just doing like super chat cat up, but, uh, catch up and chatting. So feel free to stick around if you want to or head out. If you don't want to, that's completely OK, whichever way you prefer. But thank you so much for the raid, Mumu. I hope you have a lovely day and welcome back. What was Mumu streaming today? Welcome, Mumu and Phantomos. Hell yeah. Chat up. Yeah, I know. I... <laughs> I need to stop sleeping for like two hours a night. Oh, God damn it. Okay, Ske, thank you for donating. Wait. Well, she also did Poppy Playtime Chapter 3? Are you shitting me? That's so funny. I didn't even know that was happening. Wait, I need to see how long it took her to complete. Damn it. She did it in four hours? Am I just really bad at video games? It took me five. It took me five hours. Oh, God. I know I'm bad at puzzles. I know I take forever when it comes to, like, visual novels and voice acting and stuff. Jesus. Oh. Oh, that was the second part. Ah, oh, okay. Now I feel better. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I speed ran one part and I glitched one character. <gasps> Yo, I glitched a character as well. Um, I'm not sure if you did the same thing that I did. Um... There was a point when it makes it very obvious that the cat, um, catnap, um, was going to be like behind you. And I just casually walked backwards out of the room thinking this way it can't surprise me. He got out of the room and turned around and he was just standing there. You glitched the school teacher. Oh no. That's my wife. Uh, by the way, both the English and the Japanese voices are incredible. I love her. Mr. Light is now my waifu. As soon as I am done with this stream, I am looking up everything to do with the character everywhere and anywhere and the two voice actresses. <laughs> but yeah, no, that, that, that scene was fucking incredible. <laughs> I, I've got to watch your stream now. I've got to find out how you managed to glitch her. I definitely didn't glitch her, but I, I ran into a couple of bugs just for fun. <laughs> School teacher was Tascaru. I mean, to be fair, the voice was awesome enough as it was. And then... She started talking about cannibalism and eating all her sisters. And then she started getting all like full on like yandere and talking about murdering us. And I was just like, ah, this right here. This is my vibe. <laughs> so down bad for Mr. Light. Honestly. I mean, maybe Sucker for Love was made for me because I end up. I end up like to everybody else playing horror games is scary. For me, <laughs> for me, um, horror games are just like a fun, different version of a dating game. It's just you never actually get to date them, except for in that like Seven Days Ghost one. I really need to play Seven Days Ghost at some point. Um, but yeah, I like the monsters, monster boys, monster girls. I'm really looking forward to that monster boy one that's still coming out soon. Um, it's like you don't know their language. That's going to be interesting. So many M men in Ninja Sanji. <laughs> Yeah, but you have to be a special kind of S to deal with me. That's the thing. For one thing, I'm versatile, so I go either way. But you have to be like a top shelf kind of like sadist. 
<laughs> to be on my kind of level. You can't just be like, yeah, I'm a sadist. I like whips. I like chains. I like tying people up. It's like, oh, cool. You read Fifty Shades of Grey. Now, let me tell you about real. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway. Anyway. Yeah. I, li I like the phrase top shelf fetish as well. I only heard that recently. It's just so funny. No Asterians here? Wait, what about Asterians? Oh, yeah, fuck Asterian. Asterians. Are, mm. Okay, Ske. Thank you for donating the food funds. Um, Otsufu, I'm happy to see you out. Flu suck. I remember not able to be speaker. Oh, that I remember not being able to speak at all. Because of the amount of coughing and throat shit. Yeah, it's fucking rough. Especially when it gets like really swelled around your vocal cords. And so you get to that point where it just starts coming out like that. That's the fucking worst. When you like really need to talk to someone about something. Like I literally had a meeting during that and I was like, oh no, I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine. I, I'll be fine by the stream. Just go ahead. Explain it to me. It's good. <laughs> but that's what honey is good for. Bro, that's me right now. Oh shit. Take care of yourself. Hot green tea with lemon and honey. Amazing. Apparently ginseng is really good. I still haven't tried that. Um, and also just like steam. Have a, like a nice hot shower. Fill a whole room with like nice hot steam. That'll help you so fucking much. So yeah. Good luck with everything. I hope it works out. Happened to me where I completely lost my voice before a super important audition. Oh no, that's the worst. Sometimes it's, yeah, it just isn't meant to be. I mean, it sucks. And a lot of the time it like, it sounds stupid to say. But I mean, yeah, honestly. Sometimes when shit just goes bad like that, it just means you'll get into like something different. Something different will come along and it'll be perfect. You need a humidifier. Nah, I'm good. I, my long hot showers do me. I feel so much better today. Miss Cherry Loliot, thank you so much for donating the food funds. This is my first time seeing chapter three and I was not disappointed. Everything was upgraded in this one. Man, the horror, incredible. Four jump scares. The fun. Yeah. Better. I, they seem to have gotten rid of the swinging mechanic, which I'm sad about. I wonder if too many people were like glitching and breaking that in too many ways, because you really can't rock backwards and forwards anymore. Whereas number two, you could do that, and that was so much fun. The movement was so good. Um, do, 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 do. The new mechanic, like the gun hand, freaking awesome. The purple hand, sick. I just wish you could use that on like any surface. Like if it just gave a recharge, you could do it like five times, and then you need to charge up like with the gun. I would love to be able to just bounce off of any surface, just up and down, up and down, up and down. <laughs> and yes, Sunako, I was getting to that. Mommy long leg has got a huge upgrade <laughs> in art style and everything. And then we honestly just gave up on Mommy long leg. As soon as we saw Mr. Light, it was like, you know what? That right there. That's my Oshi. That's my basis. That's my bias. That's my everything. My skin is clear. My crops are watered. Reality is flourishing, thanks to Mr. Light. My roommate is running around with Jägermeister. Good for them. <laughs> Let them have a fun day. My wife just uses whiskey as throat meds. Honestly, whiskey's pretty good at like dampening the pain. It it does not do so good for like long term healing. It slows down your actual healing. Any alcohol is a poison. So yeah, anything you're trying to heal from, even though alcohol will take away some of the pain, and it may be good in that way. Um, yeah, it'll definitely, like, slow down your actual healing. So careful with that. This delight is such a delight to behold. Yeah, especially when she goes evil. Although, I prefer the Japanese one before she goes evil. Her laughter is fucking incredible. Don't get me wrong. It's evil and terrifying as shit. Not sexy. <laughs> the English voice actress kept it sexy even while going full evil. <laughs> Anyway, uh, ba -da -bam, ba -da -bam. also, I think horror games should be scared of Fuchan with how many times you dodged jump scares and broke the game. <laughs> yeah, some people said one of the one of the puzzles I did somewhere. They were like, I've watched three people play this and I've never seen anybody do that. Y you did it, but you didn't do it right. And I was just like, eh, it works. <laughs> it works. <laughs> the amount of times I always got soft locked as well. <laughs> Her evil laugh. My first evil lady that I love. Your first? Oh, you need to go watch Fata Morgana. There's so many evil ladies to love in that. And some really... Oh, that's that's the thing. Man. Western horror has not been doing it for me when it comes to the monster guys. So many monster girls to choose from. So many like devils and ghosts and all kinds of different monster girls. 
I don't know, man. Japanese content is the one that hits the best when it comes to like monster guys. Ugh. Evil guys in Fata Morgana. 10 out of 10. Yuki Masa. Exactly. Yuki 1-1. One, one. Maria, my love. <laughs> Shit. I thought you were going to... Oh. Oh, no. It is Maria. Yeah, exactly. Maria was a fun time. Maria... Maria did some shit, man. Maria locked some shit in me. <laughs> Wait, no. Not even Maria. Maria. Shit, Maria was the blonde. Maria was fun. Pauline was adorable. Who, who's the one who, you know, has a fun long time with Michelle? <laughs> who's the one who marries one of Michelle's brothers? Because <laughs> she, she was fun. Maria, I'm... Oh, Amy. Yep, Amy. Especially when she did the fucking ultra evil smile. Holy shit. She needs to be in more of the official art. I can't believe. <laughs> Novak and the Father War Garda team were like, ah, but we'll redeem Didier. We'll redeem the brothers. Um, not Amy though. I, wa I want some more cute art of Amy. <laughs> Amy is messed up. That's the best part. She's full on psycho. That's the thing. So many people, like actually the same as like the Japanese voice actress who did Miss um, Delight. Miss Delight, you could have kept it sexy the whole time, but no, fucking lean into the evil. Go absolutely insane. You can fix her. I can't fix her. I don't need to fix her. <laughs> she genuinely, Folga being down bad for an actual torturer. And you see, why is it when I say I like Amy, people are like, yo, that's fucked up. And yet, whenever I say I fucking love Yuki Masa, everybody's like, yep, me too. Double standards, man. Double standards. <laughs> Let me enjoy both of my psychos on both sides. <laughs> she's good when she's bad. Exactly. <laughs> Sorry. Distractions. Thank you for donating the food funds, Miss Cherry. <laughs> Hope you're having a wonderful day. Thank you so much for the big donation as well. Rest well. Have a lovely evening. And thank you so much for being here. He wants Amy to destroy his brain. I mean, that's the thing as well. If what happened to Michelle actually happened to me, though, that's trauma. That's fucked up. Meanwhile, if there was a safe word involved, <laughs> if it was like a temporary couple hours a day kind of thing, there you go. Yuki Masa is top tier. Yuki Masa was so fucking awesome. The first time we properly met Yuki Masa and I had to do both the Yuki Masa torturer voice and the torturee voice. Oh my god. That was some of the most fun I've had in any stream ever. <laughs> uh, what if there is no safe word? See, then it's just straight up torture. I'd like to be funny, man, and be like, yeah, man, I'd go through it. No, that, that, would, that was genuinely torture. But, <laughs> you know. It's torture that can lead into other fantasies in the future. As long as you're with a partner you trust and you have a safe word and you trust each other and you respect each other's boundaries. But yeah, yeah, no, that, that was genuine torture. <laughs> like, I can admit that's torture. I can admit that that's fucking terrifying behavior. Still sexy. <laughs> Can't believe Mumu called you an M, dipped, and here we are. I am very open with being both S and M. Being both top and bottom, being versatile in all things. I have a lot of fun. Variety is the spice of life. And otherwise, you'd probably get bored with it. <laughs> Safe word is your sc scream. No, because you want to be able to scream. You want to be able to scream without somebody being like, yo, are you okay? It's like, no, don't stop. Don't stop. Just because I scream like a bitch doesn't mean that I don't like it. Anyway. <laughs> Tiffany, thank you for turning the food funds. <laughs> I'd see for the stream. It's so intense, especially in the last part. Sorry, I'm out of topic, but may I ask? If we can ask you to say certain things in the meet and greet, not sus, a yo, or parasocial. Um, honestly, yeah, go nuts. At the meet and greet, it depends on what you ask me to say. But I mean, yeah, if you want me to like record specific voice lines for a meet and greet, 100% you can do that. Um, beyond that... Like, obviously, if I'm allowed to use my assets, I'll use the assets as well you want to take like a specific photo i'll try to like do whatever photo you guys want to do specifically um but yeah no if you want to me want me to like voice certain lines or say certain things i will straight up tell you if i'm like that's too much for me 
But I won't do it in like a, oh god, that's cringe, get out of here kind of way. It will just very, very much be like a, that's a bit uncomfortable for me. Can we go with something else? I'll never be like, ew, kimoi, kind of thing. But yeah, there may be some things if you ask me to say it, I'll be like, that's a bit far for me. Can I maybe say something similar <laughs> kind of thing? Following up on this in the future, can we request Archan model? Hell yes. I'm wondering about something right now. Can I talk about that? We could record you saying good morning. I thought we couldn't use our phones. I think you're not supposed to use your phones when it comes to the actual stage performance because obviously they sell like online tickets as well. Um, when it comes to the meet and greet, you're good. I mean, we normally finish every meet and greet with a picture taking session for like 20 seconds as well. So you should be able to. I mean, obviously check the venue. Check the actual venue that's hosting the thing. It could be like a thing that certain places don't want you using your phones while you're doing the meet and greet. I would have no problem if people were just sort of like asking me to say certain things um, and wanted to like record them on their phone. Uh, I would ask about Ian Blanc, me dreaming. <laughs> Someday I really need to do something with Ian Blanc because yeah. Alan Bink has been around for so long and had like so many story points. He has his own daughter now, which is kind of crazy in a lot of ways. <laughs> but yeah, Ian, Bl uh, Ian Blanc hasn't really gone anywhere yet. How good is the sound quality is a thing? Yeah, that's the thing as well. Normally they have like loud music playing in the background and depending on the day, some things aren't super good. And people can't use phones to record during meet and greet. Just a photo is okay. Ah, okay. Vampire baby Ovidia? No, there's actually... I wonder if I still have her on here. Oh, I have an Ovidia. Where did she appear? <laughs> oh, she's down here. Okay, no, that's little. The second outfit, Legardus of video. I definitely, there's an, a, a literal, like, let me see if I still have it on my computer. I definitely have it on my computer. Can I find it amid all my other files named 1111.png, though? Um, there's the archivist of video. Do, do, do. I know, where's my little Alan Bink of video? She's so cute. She's so sc There she is. Okay. There you go. This is Alan Bink of video. <laughs> so yeah, just dressed very similarly to Alan Bink with the blood stains everywhere and the... I see all your secrets, eyes. She sees into your soul. Goodbye, video Bink. She's going to grow up interestingly. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, nowadays we have so many. We have doop -a -doop -a -doop -a -doop. so many different outfits for baby a video, but then also oh, I went way too far. Whoops. Um, we have a video bank. We have little baby archivist video here. Boop. <laughs> That's my daughter. <laughs> Love how she's got the short shorts instead of the trousers. This is so adorable. All the seahorse baby videos. Yeah. It's so many. And somebody literally drew a seahorse version of a video too, which is really cute. Um, but yeah, the vampire video is another one of my favorite ones. Boom. <laughs> she got the little fangies. I'd like to think this is a Halloween costume, but who really knows? <laughs> the Foodiverse goes wild. I love it. I mean, this one... Honestly, may match up with the... Sh mm. Little bit. Little bit. Let's get her out of there. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. I think I have like one more. Oh, yeah. We got one more drawn by a different artist. Boom. Our white day of video. Oh, God. Where did she go? C come back. A video. I'm going to need to untransform her. <laughs> She's going to be big. There we go. White day over here. This one's a bit more grown up. She's more like, I'm going to say like eight years old. The other ones I'd say are like five to six. Maybe a video battery. <laughs> Yo, sick. Honestly, she wants to become a vampire and bathe in some blood. Good for her. As long as she's happy. That's all that matters. <laughs> Tiffany, thank you so much for donating the food funds. But yeah, obviously, um, respect the wishes of the venue before anything else. They will tell you if you're allowed to. Um, but for me personally, I have no problem with it. 
Um, if you wanted to like record certain phrases or anything, if they allowed it, I'd be down for that. Good for young girls to have hobbies. Exactly. She's just taking care of her skin. It's important. <laughs> Do you have a favorite Vooniverse character to play as, sir? A lot of them. <laughs> Freaking lot of them. Alan Bink is always fun. The interactions with the videos are always fun. Anything for Goddess is always freaking hilarious to me. Especially seeing people's reactions to it. Like the, the school part. <laughs> I really didn't expect you guys to go for school until the final thing. But yeah, the school part was fucking crazy. Just seeing people like lose their minds while I was just trying to do the voice acting. <laughs> um, yeah, Alan Bink is always fun because it gets a lot of fun doing like the dark side. Having a lot of fun, like a lot of the voice packs coming up, uh, the Shepherd shows up in a few of them. The next one is actually a Shepherd one. Um, school was live. It, it was both. I had to, I had to record. In fact, I think I've still got them. Yeah, I've still got them. So I, I recorded a different side, um, but the other side was always live. So for example, let me turn off my music for a second. When it came to like the squat scenes, I had Legatus recorded. So. I want you to show me what you've got. 50 squats right now. So yeah, I've got like that that only comes out of the left ear. And while that was happening, I was voicing uh, Archivist through the right ear live. So yeah, Archivist was live during the squat section. And then when it came to... Doo -doo -doo -doo, Archivist push-ups. Okay, I'm going, I'm going. Dude, I just did 50 squats. Can't you give me like a second? <laughs> so yeah and the second half because i wanted them to be on different sides for each version and i wanted to be able to voice each one live um so yeah anything coming through the right ear was live anything coming through the left ear was something that i'd recorded beforehand and i just knew like from the counting what kind of like scenario i had to be doing at each point but yeah that was fun definitely want to get that white day one back up eventually <laughs> worked really hard for that one but yeah it was fun doing that live and just seeing people freak out <laughs> Um, on in shrouding. Oh, that's so loud. Damn you, Legata's being so quiet. In, in one ear. That'd be great, hopefully. Anyway. <laughs> Personal trainer Legata's voice back when? I mean, that's basically what the full goddess, like, white day school stream was. I mean, if you want to be able to do 50 squats and 50 push-ups while being degraded... Go for it. You can just watch that every day. <laughs> okay, Paradox. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> Lumiere. Atsufu. I super got sent to the void. Um, maybe. I hope not. I still haven't gone through the past supers just yet. I'm working my way through them. But thank you so much for donating the roof funds. But I want to know your thoughts on Dog Day calling you Angel. That was interesting. I didn't even think about that too much. But yeah, he was referring to me as an angel. I didn't know if that was just the idea that I'd come from outside, so like above to try and save some peoples. Um, but yeah, it'd be interesting to find out. Like that. I still think I'm tied to the prototype somehow. Like I'm the final part of it or something. Like when it all is revealed, I'm gonna just gonna be like an exoskeleton carrying the two hand things. I, I, it's just like so few games nowadays that don't have you have like at least a first person perspective being able to look down at your own shoes and parts of your body and stuff oh I feel like they're trying to hide something there plus everybody having like the interesting dialogue with like the you lived how did you live like you you used to work here but something why would you come back like the continuous questions, it's like there's something going on there. It's gonna be an interesting reveal when we finally get to it. But yeah, Dog Day calling you Angel was kind of cute. I wish I could have put him out of his misery. I mean, he died eventually, but I mean, like before he got taken over. I was trying. I was fireballing the shit out of him. It just didn't work. <laughs> How about Fudanshi friend ASMR voice back? I told you, I'm only gonna do that if we ever hit zero memberships. You guys have to all cancel your membership for a month. Just like let it pass for a month and like a couple of days. And then when everybody's out of the membership, yeah, that was that was the agreement that as long as there are people in the membership, I won't make that kind of ASMR. <laughs> Poor dog. Yeah, he was a good boy. He did his best dog day. 
being tortured just because he was the cool kid and the leader of the group kind of sucks as well. Cats, man. Cats are always jealous. Cats are always jealous about how fucking badass dogs are. The hell? Oops, okay. It happens. Adamarius, thank you so much for donating the full funds. And thank you for the big donation. Atsufu! Not me falling asleep as it's already past midnight and I haven't slept in two days. Oh my god, get to sleep. <laughs> the VODs will always be here. You need rest. I hope you enjoyed. I can't wait for all the things that are coming up. I'm hyped. Also, I'm on a Dan May binge and God, I feel alone. <laughs> See, that's why you should read some of the spicy Dan May that don't have like happy, sweet romanticisms. Instead, read the fun Dan Mays where they just beat the shit out of each other, then fuck each other and then move on. That happens a lot in Dan Mays because I mean, I read a lot of the Shansha ones, which is very much like, oh yes, you'll be my eternal cultivation partner. That doesn't mean I'm going to catch feelings. I have to be detached to the earth and all that after all. So yes, we can smash and like recharge our chi, our yin and yang energies. But other than that, leave my bed when we're done. <laughs> Good shit, honestly. Exactly. Thank you for donating the food funds, Adamaris. I hope you have a lovely evening. Please rest well and take it easy. Bum -ba -da -bum. Kidiva. Fuchan. Fuchan. What's every cat's favorite book? The Great Catsby. Oh, no. 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 Come here, you. No. 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 Terrible. You know what? Where's the moving one? This one requires the moving one. Just no. The whip, it's come. It's back for me. <laughs> God damn it. Well, now I have to turn those all off. Whoops. <laughs> hey, get out of here, Spray. Thought I already turned you off. Thank you for playing with Catnap. He was just lonely. No, he wasn't. He was a zealot. A religious zealot who was trying to kill me and probably feed my parts to whatever the fuck the weird machine. How have they been alive for so long now that I think about it? I just realized Poppy talked about the fact that they killed the humans and ate them to stay alive. But I mean, it's been decades. They, they shouldn't have had food for that long. Do they just not need to eat? And they just did it for the fun of it? Yeah. I don't know. He just loves prototype. Well, love does make us do crazy things, as Hercules once said. But murder should not be one of those crazy things. Well... I just professed how much I loved the psycho Yandere hunting me down and trying to rip off my face. You know what? You do you. <laughs> you do you. They started to eat each other. Oh, I mean, I know Mrs. Delight ate all of her sisters, but... I mean, eating six of your sisters shouldn't really sustain you for like the next several decades. Unless it was just a thing like they were hungered, but they can't die even if they start starving. So maybe they've all been starving for a really long time as well. At first, they ate each other to, like, get some sense of fulfillment. And now they just can't die and they're constantly hungry. Like Dog Day, the toys probably started to eat each other. Oh, yeah, they definitely said that. Um, just, yeah, I just suddenly realized Poppy definitely talked about, like, they ate each other because they were so hungry. And I was like, at the time, I was like, yeah, we saw some of that. But now I'm like, it's been decades. <laughs> Surely they should have died of starvation if they were hungry, but I guess, yeah, they can exist in perpetuity, just constantly being starved and feeling like they're dying. Fun. Anyway, thank you for playing Catnap. He was just lonely. By the way, I left you the Viejo Sabroso meme info in the live tag. <laughs> thank you. I'm going to be very interested in that too. So much to Google after this. Thank you for downing the food funds, and I hope you have a lovely day, Kidiva. Sounds like something that could happen. Yeah. God, imagine just constantly feeling like you were going to starve to death and not being able to fucking die. Maybe the toys just need Uber Eats. Honestly, maybe if my man came in instead of with this stupid grabby pack thing, maybe if he just came with a couple McDonald's Happy Meals just to rule them out to all the good boys and girls. I don't know. Brought some sushi. Um, I don't know. Some Indian food, like a couple of different dishes for everyone to enjoy. Maybe they'd be fine. They need a Snickers. <laughs> you're not yourself when you're hungry. <laughs> you give a Snickers to the prototype and it's just like, ah, thank you. I will allow.
allow you to live. Hey, do you need nuggies? Oh, yeah. Well, being hangry does do a bitch, man. <laughs> I see he's goatee. Thank you for telling the food funds. Actually, yeah, they could order from Fa Freddy's uh, Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria. That would be perfect. Then they could do both. Mr. Light needs a Wendy's. Mr. Light is definitely a Wendy's girl. Mommy Long Legs strikes me as more like a KFC kind of chick. Kissy Missy, that's definitely a Wendy's girl. Huggy Wuggy. Basic bitch. I bet he likes Burger King. Nothing wrong with Burger King. <laughs> they need to make a real Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria. I'm surprised they haven't. Although considering it was like very obviously based around like Chuck E. Cheese. I mean, I wonder if you'd run... Maybe they'd run into issues if they tried to make a Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria. Because it would be like, I mean, this is just Chuck E. Cheese. One thing making a game about like how creepy the animatronics could be, but actually making a pizzeria. <laughs> Would anyone aside from a certain demon want to go there? I would. I really want to go to like some of those like zombie themed bars and like the vampire themed bars that they have where they like straight up pretend you're drinking blood or drinking potions or eating raw animal meat. It's always fun. They're so cool. Yeah. I see a lot of videos of those, specifically the ones in Japan. Like I saw like a ninja bar. I saw like a Resident Evil zombie bar. Uh, I'm pretty sure there was a vampire bar at some point, too. Imagine the profits. Yeah. Better go to those macho bars with the aprons. <laughs> see, if I want to see macho men, all I have to do is go to the gym. I don't have to go to a bar and spend money for that. Although, I mean, if you're going to go to that type of bar, why not just go the whole way and go to like a host club with big buff bar guys? How? Yeah. <laughs> I see his goatee. Thank you for donating the full funds. I see food. Jimmy Gat. I don't know if that's a meme. <laughs> that's just a different name. Um, so excited for the birthday chat soon. You got that cake finally. Hope you have a lovely rest of your day and thank you for everything you do. Aw, oh, thank you. I see his goatee. I've had a wonderful day. Um, I do have that cake finally. I do have that cake finally. And nice. <laughs> Paradox Mint, thank you so much for donating the full funds. Yeah. I went to school thinking I'd be staying late, getting one-on-one -on -one tutoring with Fu Sensei. I got something so much better. I'm not sorry. Long as you had fun, that's what it was released for. <laughs> White Day was revenge for the Halloween uh, the Valentine stuff that I missed, so that's completely fine. Remember crawling around in the mouse holes at Chuck E. Cheese? Gave me a secret passage fun vibes. That sounds kind of crazy. The, I've never even heard of those. Mouse holes just sound so dangerous for a child. Probably isn't. It's probably a very safe like play area, but it just sounds terrifying. You got that gat? See, that's what I was... It's it's that Jimmy gat, yeah, isn't it? Okay, okay. <laughs> I was like, damn it. This may be this person's real name. I definitely shouldn't be like, how dare you do a gat joke. But okay. <laughs> Remember my hitting my head on one of the arcade games? Oof. Yeah, they definitely need to make things like softer edges there. Do, do, do. Satsuki the Satsu Sheep. But do they make a drink with their arms around you? No, but to be fair, I don't think I'd like that. <laughs> I, think, I think like, like fan surface aside, if like somebody made Big Bar a person at a club, um, uh, even fucking like vampire at like a cosplay themed bar kind of thing. If you wrap your arms around me from behind, I'm going full like fight or flight mode. I will either like dip underneath your arms, roll along the floor and run for my fucking life. Or my instant reaction will just be like shoulders and arms up to the side and accidentally like smacking people in the face with my elbow. Um, I'd imagine they warn you before they do that. And so you can choose whether you want that to happen or not. But yeah, I just, yeah. Uh, personal touches are no no for me. <laughs> Unless I trust the person. Uh, somebody just grabs me randomly. A fight is starting. It may be a fight that I lose. But it'll be a fun one. <laughs> Fuck. Tried to fix my comfy grabber. And I realized the last thing I copied was viejo sabroso. Let him suplex you? See, there you go. Now you're talking my language. It just turns into a fight from then on. That's way better. 
<laughs> God damn it. <Anton. laughs> Fair. <laughs> Kiwi, thank you for donating the food funds. Your horror game streams are the comfiest to watch for me for some reason, but it's super fun regardless. There is honestly like something so relaxing about horror. Um, I mean, I've talked multiple times about how I listen to horror stories every night to fall asleep. But just in general, like horror stories, horror movies, they've always been super relaxing to me. Like, I always feel comfortable, like, falling asleep to them and just being like, oh, this is nice. They're trying to give, like, a creepy atmosphere. Meanwhile, I'm just laying there like, ah, it's quiet. And then there's a huge, loud scream and a bunch of blaring music and you wake up. And then it goes back to being tense and tension building again. And you're just like, ah. Especially Skinnamarink. Skinnamarink, goddamn, I've fallen asleep so many times to Skinnamarink. <laughs> I gave up trying to actually watch it properly. <laughs> so what about muscle lady bars? Eh, same thing. I'd visit one. If somebody touched me without asking me first, I'd probably elbow one in the face again. And yeah, I would definitely... But that's the thing. That would be like so uncomfortable. Not even in like a... Not even in like a... Oh, how terrible kind of way. But in like a genuine... Oh my God, I'm so fucking sorry. I did not mean to do that. It was a natural reflex. I really thought if you were going to like, you know, do anything like that, you would ask me or warn me first. But yeah, I think it's just natural like reaction. <laughs> like being woken up by jump scares. I mean, it puts you into a deeper sleep, honestly. It puts you into a deeper sleep. And to be fair, there are a lot of people who say they fall asleep to my streams and sometimes they're nice and calming and relaxing. And then sometimes I just screech like a fucking devil while I'm being attacked by a giant cat thing. <laughs> Let's say I accidentally Pavloved myself to fall asleep to your streams. I would rewatch the VOD when I was preparing for bed and well, yeah, that's fine. I mean, as long as you go into the stream planning to fall asleep, that's all that matters. <laughs> Wonder if there's a Yaoi bar a bar? There would definitely be our bars, so I would not be surprised whatsoever. Like, there are BL bars where specifically... It's like a host club kind of thing of, like, good-looking young men. And just, like, randomly they'll play out, like, little skits in front of you. Like, one of them will deliver your food, and then the other one will be like, Oh, I was meant to deliver that order. It's just, like, little fight break out from there, and a little push here and there. And it's like, oh, come on, man. We're supposed to be friends. Let's hug this out, kind of thing. Shit like that. Like, little BL scenes. But Yaoi is 18 plus... I mean, that's a different kind of bar. You can definitely find those kinds of bars in Soho, but <laughs> you may hire. Thank you for toting to the food funds. Fu, I just wanted to say thank you for being someone that inspires me to step out of my comfort zone, to meet people and to take chances. I buy you and the sheeps. Oh, thank you so much. You may hire. That feeling completely you know, reversed. I was not a fan of singing. I was kind of scared of sharing like my silly voices. Um, definitely not good at games. Like all of these things <laughs> are things that make me terrified to do this job if it wasn't for the fact that confidants have been so supportive and so sweet. And even then, if I still get like scared every now and then. At least I always feel like cheered up again by you guys. So thank you. I'm glad I'm able to do that for you guys as well. Thank you so much for donating the full funds you may hire. Have a lovely evening. Please rest well. And thank you so much for being here. Bum, ba -da -bum, ba -da -bum. Our story videos for you is basically your alien isolation stream for me. It helped me sleep through most of a 15 hour flight. I mean, I didn't scream too much in that one. Because even when it came to most of the scares, it was just me hiding in a locker like. Don't hurt me. Um, keep, keep, keep walking. Yeah, they're a clever girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You were more aggravated. It took like a special moment in the game to make me aggravated. Um, I only really get aggravated when two things happen. One, if I feel like I'm actually doing well and the game continuously like, makes me die or lose or fail or whatever. Or two, if there are like a bunch of backseating people. <laughs> if there are like a bunch of people like, Fushan, just touch the electric thing, you dumbass. I'm like, what if I don't? What if I, you know what? I'm going to continue looping this boss fight for the next two hours. Just to pretend that I didn't read that comment because I hate being backseated. <laughs> Kitan, thank you so much for the raid. How are you doing? How was the stream today? What did you guys stream? And what is up, Nakarats? I hope you have a lovely day. Hi, Kitan and Nakarats. Welcome. Of being a confidant and a Nakarat. Hell yeah. What up, Marie? It's lovely to see you here. Yeah, what was Kuchan up to today? Baldur's Gate. 
Wait, was this her first time playing Baldur's Gate 3? How far did she get? How far is she if it wasn't the first time? I, I remembered she was going to play it at some point. Second time? How far? What are we up to? This is going to be good. Do, 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 to the hag. Oh, okay. There, there are some fun ways to deal with the hag. Um, We were at the hag. I don't know if you guys finished the hag, so I won't say anything yet. But I can tell you there are some very interesting ways to deal with the hag. Baldur's Gate 3 has so many funny things. And I got to the tea house and it was a time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The hag is a lot of fun. Kunai, Kuchan, thank you for being here. It's a super fun game. I don't know how far I am. Oh, as soon as they said the hag. Yeah, no, I remember that scene. I'll remember anything up until Underdark. And then my party disbanded, unfortunately. <laughs> Um, I may replay it myself someday, but probably not on stream. I am getting my ass handed to me by the hag repeatedly. Oh, have you not finished it yet? She... She has some high level magic. <laughs> okay, so I won't say anything. I'll just say... You need to think of Baldur's Gate 3 a bit like a D&D &D session. There are often a lot of actions you can take that aren't super well spelled out to you. But if you attempt them, you'll be like, holy shit, this works. <laughs> Oh, she's decided to keep it an offline game as well. Okay. That's awesome then. I hope you continue to enjoy it, man. Oh, God. Aya's going to be so happy. <laughs> Aya's going to be so happy you're able to talk to her about it. That'll be fun, though. I hope you have a lot of fun with it. Yeah, if I ever play it again, it will definitely be offline. Oh, yeah. There's so many other games I want to play, especially long games. I really want to do The Witcher 3 when The Shepherd drops. But I mean, we haven't even started and we've got like two weeks <laughs> of single games to do before we even dive into like Fire Emblem Three Houses and the second part of Fata Morgana. So yeah, I was really happy that she streamed it. Yeah, it's like Aya's favorite thing. So <laughs> no surprise. But thank you so much for the raid, Kuchan. I hope you're having fun. I have to meet Karlak. I must go get food. I'll be lurking. No problem. I hope you have a wonderful time. And yeah, Karlak. Where you are, you can definitely just go meet her whenever you feel like. She's definitely a fun character. Um, where you are, I'm not sure. You might not have run into my girl yet. The drow. But when you do run into her, have fun. She's fun. <laughs> you ever actually played Witcher 3? Is this your first time? Oh, yeah, I played it. Um, I fully beat it once. It took me something like 90 hours. I did like all of the side quests I explored for fucking ever. And then I think when the second season of The Witcher show on Netflix came out, um, yeah, I played it again then, but I think I only got like just past the bloody Baron kind of bit. Like I only put like six hours into that run. I just really wanted to see Geralt a little bit more and control him a little bit. And the bloody Baron storyline's really freaking good. Took me over six hours to figure out I could jump over gaps in Baldur's Gate 3. Yeah, there's a lot of mechanics that unless you've like been told, oh, did you know you could do this? Like if you watch one of those videos where it's like tips you didn't know about Baldur's Gate 3, there are so many. Yennefer or Triss? Yennefer. 100%. Not even a fucking question. Triss is a fun time. Yennefer is love. Triss. Cute. Silly. Literally, Mrs. Steal Your Man. Um, <laughs> and she knows what she did. Um, but yeah, Yennefer. Both are great in the games and books, though. Um... Really not a fan of Triss in the show. I'm really not a fan of Yennefer in the show, and I'm surprised they managed to do that. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Uh, when Yen shows up for the first time, yeah, you just know. As soon as you run into her, you're just like, yeah, that's that's Yennefer. She's the golf girlfriend. She is the perfection in this universe. <laughs> she liked Triss in the game, but books Triss. Wait. What's wrong with Bookstress? I didn't mind. Well, I've only read one of the books so far. But Bookstress? Wait. Did she even show up in Sword of Destiny? Oh, maybe I haven't even met her in the books yet. <laughs> Either way. Mr. Steal Your Man to an extreme. Yes. Mm. Yeah. Kind of fuck Triss. <laughs> fuck, fuck, fuck Triss. The only one for me is Jaskia. Jaskia is fun. Although Geralt is still... Oh, Geralt's a fucking sex icon, man. The fucking trailer for number three. For one thing, that's where I got, like, the Legatus, like, monsters getting into that Legatus voice kind of thing. It's just that final line of, like, one of the trailers for Witcher 3 where he's just like... 
No, there's a bunch of guys that were about to hang a witch who clearly wasn't a fucking witch. And they're just talking about how much they're enjoying torturing her. And then Geralt just walks over and murders all three of them, leaves one of them hanging. And he's like, well, what are you doing? And he's just like, killing monsters. It's such a fucking good line. Geralt's so fucking sexy. And then, yeah, the fucking bathtub scene where he just lays back in the bathtub, legs up on either side. <laughs> Morgana needed a Geralt. Yes. Everybody needs a Geralt. <laughs> Geralt, but yeah. Sexily HMS. Oh, the yeah. That's one of my favorite things about him and like every stoic character. When you can convey a lot of meaning just through like size and like exasperations of air, just shit like... Mm. Shit like that. Oh my god. Lam Wang Ji in the Grandmaster of Demonic Cultivation, um, Dong Hua does that incredible as well. Basically, Mando? Mando. You mean Mr. Butter? Mando. Yeah, I'm gonna guess you mean Butter Mando. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, that's the thing. Mondo is actually a pretty normal name. So I was like, I'm going to assume they mean Dang and Rumpa Mondo. <laughs> you did not just call him Mr. Butter. Yeah, I did. What are you going to do about it? Oh, you are, whoa, whoa, you Mr. Butter. He a cute little butter. I, I put him on some toast. It'll be delicious. A little sad with what they did with Siri in the game, but it's okay. I, I definitely haven't met Siri properly in the books yet. It'll be interesting to see. Um, Siri's okay in the TV show. Siri and Geralt, so far, I've actually liked in the TV show. I can't believe they made me dislike fucking Yennefer. <laughs> I like Jaskier in the TV show as well. The butter. Butter Mondal. The Mondal with the butter. <laughs> She's my daughter. I would never let anything happen to her. She's Geralt's daughter. How dare you? Siri in the books is so sad. Oh, God. I have some reading to do. Never seemed sad before. God. Bum, ba -da -bum, ba -da -bum. Emma Jacob, thank you for donating the full funds. Have a wonderful stream, Futsan, and an amazing day. It did. It's been fantastic. Thank you for being here. Oh, my baby girl, Siri. That's the thing. Even though she grows up, like there are some characters like that where they grow up in front of you and you're just like, no, they're still my baby. I, I don't care that they're now technically a grown up and adult. They're just, they're just my baby. That's all I care about. Little baby. <laughs> Pat their heads and tucked them into bed. You'll never run out of books to read. That is so fucking true. <laughs> I already have like two bookshelves worth of books that I have not read. <laughs> and I actually just picked up, um, fuck, what's it called? Sarah J. Maas or Sarah J. Haas or something. Um, A Court of Throne of Roses. And I got a court of, I got the first two because they had like um a deal going for the special editions of the first two. I've got like the special editions that are really, really pretty. I haven't taken a... Did I take a picture? No, I haven't taken a picture of those ones yet. I think I got them like a week ago. Is this still a lot younger in the books from what I remember? Yeah. I mean, they, they always do that with like novel adaptations. It's like, oh no, a 10-year-old girl wielding a sword. We couldn't possibly show that. How barbaric. And it's like, fuck you. Show the 10-year-old fucking shit up. Why I loved kick ass so much. You had the little girl with the guns. <laughs> it was crazy. Is it super popular in recent years? Wait, which one? Uh oh, <laughs> I've talked about so. Oh, the books. Yes, Throne of Glass. Yeah, I think it's a, thro a a court of thorns and roses, and then Throne of Glass. I've got those two. I think there's like five of them, isn't there? Um, but I've heard they're really fucking good. Um, probably not gonna read them. For like a long long time <laughs> but i bought them it is sarah j mass ah thank you bum, ba -da -bum. awesome someday someday i'll read them <laughs> um oh shit we actually got through all the super chats let's fucking go okay I'm gonna check if there were many stream labs today um just to check <laughs> we'll see if we're gonna read them it depends I've been really bad with actually getting through all of like the donations recently. I'm really sorry about that. I'm trying to fix it. I just got Murtag. I had no idea more were coming, so I need to reread other inheritance books. There's a new inheritance series book. They did more than just like the four. Murtag. 
Oh shit. Keratin cycle number five. <gasps> Release 2023. I didn't even know he could. Ooh, the cover art actually looks sick. Murtag was actually a really good example of like a like the whole hero of another story kind of trope where it's like this person is kind of an anti-hero in this story but at the same time he's doing his best in his own way yeah i might have to grab that i wonder how well christopher paulino writes now i mean jesus it's definitely been more than 10 years since he wrote the original inheritance cycle interesting to see what he's like now also a small spin-off book in that series that tells the stories of side characters. Interesting. I liked the magic system in that world. Um, the magic system and the way it took like forever. <laughs> For the... Aragorn. His name is Aragorn. For a moment, I was like, is Aragorn the dragon? I had like a Zelda Princess Zelda moment. <laughs> but yeah, how long it took like Aragorn to learn like basic swordsmanship and magic with the elves. That shit was awesome. Dreaded Realm series, I think it's called. Ah. They really did spin off, huh? Added realms. Books. <laughs> Comes up with so many. Oh, here we go. Flamecaster, Shadowcaster, Stormcaster, Deathcaster. Oh, these are a completely different thing. I thought you meant these were the spin offs. <laughs> these are by a completely different person. Um, Safira. It's Safira, not Safina. I remembered it after I thought about it. Oh, a lot of people. Wait, is this Safina? Have I been remembering the dragon's name wrong this whole time? Um, I thought it was Safira rather than Safina. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, well. Bam, ba bam, ba bam, bam, ba bam. Reminded me of the Earthsea magic system. Yeah, I like magic systems that had to do with like words and old languages and stuff. Bam, ba bam, ba bam. What was that about King's Avatar? For some reason, this made me want to reread everything King's Avatar. So I guess that'll be my next week on Productive. Yeah, that's a long fucking series. Have have fun. <laughs> that's... God. I think I read like the first 80 or 90 chapters and then I was like, that's that's enough for me. I'm pretty sure didn't Butterfly Blue like release like 1200 or something chapters? <laughs> that's that might, that might take me more than a week, but I hope you have fun. <laughs> Seven Realms, not Shattered Realms. Ah... Oh, they were just similar to Throne of Glass. Okay, got ya. The, 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 the Dagon is the only name I remember because she started my love of dragon fricking. Ah, this is the reason I get so much shit for not wanting to fuck real sized dragons, huh? Sephira. There we go. It is Sephira. So many people lied to me. Everybody was like Safina, and I was like, is it doll? <laughs> you can make it work, Borg. Look, I'm not denying that I could make it work. Do I want to make it work? I, I'll go at Mrs. Delight. No fucking problem. I don't care that she'll stab me to death before I get to actually do anything. I'll die with a smile on my face. That's fine. But would I die for a dragon? No. <laughs> Try, princess. Thank you for telling the food funds. There's no message, but thank you so much for always supporting the channel. I hope you have a lovely day. Thank you so much for being here. Please rest well and have a wonderful time. You wouldn't smash the dragon? We're not getting back on this topic. We've had we've had our monster fricker arc. It lasted all the way through last Halloween. We did a monster fricker stream. Comfy Kara MJ Lin. Thank you for telling the food funds. Artsy food child. Thank you for the stream. I'm also glad that you've recovered from your birthday flu. Yeah, my throat's still a bit iffy. I had a really bad headache yesterday, but I'm so glad that cleared up by this morning. Um, ba -ba -ba -bum. I had fun listening to you play PPT while working earlier. I'll be played up. Oh, my mind was just like PPT. Um, definitely going to watch the first five hours of the gameplay. Take care. Rest well. As always, bye you. Ah, thank you so much, MJ and Lim. That's so sweet. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Thank you so much for being here. Please rest well, and I hope you enjoy the VOD when you get to watch it. Yeah, thank you so much for being here. Twinsies with that, I got a stomach flu after my birthday lunch. Maybe they've been poisoning us. Maybe it's their plan. <laughs> oh, and Def Kuzo, I see the two parts of this so far. I'll pay attention for the third one later. Thank you for donating the food funds, and thank you for the sweet message. Very nice to know. Yeah, second one definitely hits pretty hard. 
Jules, what's your food I only caught some parts, but I hope you have a good time. Very interested to see where they take us in the next chapter. Me too, although it may be freaking forever. <laughs> it may be freaking forever until we get to like chapter four. I know they've been taking quite a bit of time between each game, and honestly, I'm happy about that. So many other games just try to rush new things out so that they can just milk a franchise. But yeah, from Poppy Playtime, like I've been pretty fucking shocked. I came into this one expecting like nothing interesting, just like some silly jump scares. It's actually been really interesting. <laughs> I'm really enjoying it. Full size dragons are kind of addict tier. No other shelf can reach. Jesus. That's like that top shelf stuff for you guys. <laughs> Me waiting 10 years for the final chapter of your turn. To... Whoa. Wait. Wait. How long has it been since a single update? Your turn to die. I knew it'd been a while. Is it really been? Oh. The game first released in 2017. Hold on a minute. <laughs> that hasn't even slightly been 10 years. God damn it. I believed it. I believed it. This is fine. I didn't know that was an RPG maker game either. That's impressive. I need to stop reading this. I'm going to play it someday. I want to go into it blind. <laughs> Kill a Virgo? Damn, dude. 2017? Yeah, that's surprisingly long ago. 2017 sounds like it could just be like two years ago. Uh, who was it the other day who was like, yeah, no, time stopped moving at 2020. <laughs> so 2016 was only four years ago. It really does feel like that sometimes. <laughs> 2017 is almost 10 years. Yeah, it's seven years ago. Which is insane. Okay. Round, thank you for donating the full funds. Oh, you did? Hang on. Wait. I don't even know what this is in reference to anymore. <laughs> thank you for donating the full funds, and I hope you have a lovely evening. Niji Sanji was born in 2017, right? Well, yes, actually. Yes, it should be, because 2025 will be a big year for Niji Sanji. It tells me when folks say 2017 was a long time ago. It's not a super long time ago, but it's seven years ago. It's just weird, because like, when I think about 2017, I'm like, oh yeah, that was like yesterday. That's nothing. Anything that came out in 2017 is practically a fucking baby. Meanwhile, yeah, it's been seven years. That baby would be attending primary school. Doing pretty well. Had five or six years of poppy Christmas. Fuck yes. Can <laughs> get more. She's crazy. No, Ian, thank you for donating the food funds. There's no message, but thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for supporting the channel, and I hope you have a lovely evening. Rest well and take it easy. I was being dramatic. Oh, that's fine. I got it. It was just, I, I genuinely believed at first. I was like, wait, 10 years? I was, yeah. One really does forget how fast time flows by. Indeed. Time moves. It moves. Anyway. Oop. I think that's where we'll stop the stream today. Because, yeah, my, my throat's kind of getting a bit wrecked. <laughs> my throat's getting a bit wrecked. We got through all the super chats. We got through all the stream labs. We did good. Why am I? Oh, I forgot. <laughs> Fuck. I forgot I had the voice actress for... Oh, um, uh, uh, Miss Desire? I forgot her name. Um, For the character I really like, open up. I have a Twitter open. And I just like... I started closing pages and I was like... What is all this scary shit? And I was like, oh yeah, that's why. Miss Delight, yes. And she is a delight. But with that said, thank you guys so much for being here. I hope you enjoyed the stream today. This was awesome. I was really surprised at how fun, like I said, the sponsored stream was crazy. So much fun with it. And worth waking up at 5.30 a.m. for. I'll say that much. <laughs> now I've got my little legatus puppy and a little panini. <gasps> La Goddess Papinini. La Goddess Papinini. <laughs> but yeah, no. It's been a great day. I'm glad to be back now. I'm glad that I'm not feeling bad anymore. And we will be back tomorrow. Oh shit, tomorrow's a fucking big day. Tomorrow's the guy no chi. <laughs> it's the guy no chi for all I know. That's gonna be like another 10 hour stream. I I forget exactly how long the last dr uh, dramatical murder the demo was, but that demo was fucking huge. So 
We'll see what happens tomorrow with the guy who no chick. I might not be able to do much more than just, yeah, do that basic stream and then pass out. Can't be that long, right? I mean, dramatical murder was like a good seven to eight hours. <laughs> it was crazy. Maybe split it into two days. No, that's quitter talk. Maybe. We'll, we'll see. <laughs> After the year, the eight hour, yeah, dramatical murder. It was kind of crazy. <laughs> With that said, final donation for the donation? Donation for the day. Marie, thank you so much for donating the full funds. Rest well for turn. I will. Thank you so much. Hope you rest well. Hope you have a lovely evening. Thank you so much for being here. We're already taking bets on who your best guy is gonna be. I am very interested too. I've been told that I'll probably like this game a lot. I've been told if I would like any of the games more than anything, I'd probably like slow damage. Because it's like pure angst and pain and suffering. Fortunately, I don't think I'll ever be able to allow to play even the demo version of that. <laughs> Which is sad, especially since... Oh, the artist just did an amazing, beautiful piece of archivist artwork for my birthday as well. I, oh, man. I, I would love to play that someday. But yeah, at least we're going to do Tsukai Nunochi. Someday, maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Yamada your son. Yeah. Oh, God. The artwork is fucking incredible. I already loved the Legata stuff. Legata stuff was always so sensual and interesting. But man, the archivist one just laying back on the bed. The beard looks so good. God damn. Anyway, um, was there anything else to say before I head out? Probably not. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll do my stream tomorrow. Um, I've got a really beautiful... Somebody made a really, really nice, um thumbnail for it but yeah i'll set up that stream sometime tonight and tomorrow we will have our weekly schedule all ready to go It'll be fun Should you have that as my lock screen yeah it's really good <laughs> i was impressed <laughs> anyway thank you guys all so much for being here i hope you will have a wonderful evening as always do not <clears throat> yep Okay, that's definitely the limit of my throat right now. <laughs> As always, do not be led astray my confidence, and I will catch you guys next time. Bye-bye. As usual on the way out, I'd like to say a special thank you to everybody who joined the membership, including Asahi's Goatee. Thank you so much for the gifted membership. Timu, thank you so much for the gifted Miss Jerry Lawliet, Rishi Sama, Panic Shear, Susan Air, Khan, Pamela JCH. Oh shit, that was the other thing I wanted to say. Um, one thing, yes, thank you, moderators. You did an amazing job, as always. Uh, we had a lot of people breaking rules today. I'm very sorry about that, but thank you for everything. Um, and then the other thing is the second and third year membership badges. Um, the design's finalized. I'm thinking they'll probably be ready to go before the next membership post, like monthly membership post in like two weeks. Uh, but yeah, hope you guys will enjoy them. Came up with some really fun ideas, so it should be fun. <laughs> Yui, thank you so much for the five gifted membership. I hope you enjoyed the stream and I hope you have a lovely evening. Drehid. Bobo. Clowny. Neruda. LP. That is. Sorry, I'm having to translate this name. YouTube is being slow as usual. Thank you, Foo. No, thank you guys for waiting. Can't believe we're going to be at like two years and one month by the time we get to it. Su Long Shang. Yi Sun. Ah. Sushi. Kiwi. Apple Hyacinth. Chris. Thank <laughs> Wait. Kissy Missy, thank you so much for the gifted membership. <laughs> Charlotte. Claudines. Mbrosa. Wes. Jasonet Paul Kiwi. Tori. Spicy Water. Ayato P. Ayate. Yiping. Yisha Ovo. Stupid dog. Apple spider. Rum coffee. Sounds so good right now. One more month, Fuchan. A month and a half. Close. 
Eri Nini, Agumi Kim, Paradox Mint, Miratris. Iwi, thank you so much for the gifted. Miss Jerry Loliet, thank you so much for the gifted. Shofu Shofu Meow Meow, Mao Tien, Rebel Tiger, Lila Gade, Kim C, Skylar Rose, Sari, 52 Hertz, Mom Mom, Ocean Sheep, thank you so much for the gifted. Bamboo, thank you so much for the gifted. Mira, thank you so much for the gifted. There were so many gifted. Right before the stream started. Holy crap. Thank you guys so much. <laughs> Jay, thank you so much for the gifted. Def Kuzu, thank you so much for the gifted. Happy birthday again. Hey boy! Sorry. I want I don't know why that name made me excited. Just seeing the double P. P O I. Hey boy. <laughs> Jay, blink blink. And finally, Fuyu Papa. Thank you all so much for joining the membership today. I hope you enjoyed the stream. I hope you continue to enjoy the streams in the future. Thank you so much for being part of the sheep pile. And yeah, I hope you enjoy the membership content. There are many OSTs, a couple of <laughs> special videos. We don't really do many membership streams, <laughs> but a lot of good like artwork as well. Nice backgrounds and wallpapers. I cannot read into anybody. Wait. Kuchan's doing his Zatsu too? What the? Wait, when is she doing his Zatsu? <laughs> eh. Now oh, it disappeared. Wait, is my YouTube glitching? It might be glitching. Um. It's tomorrow? Oh. Weird. Oh. And for some reason it says Dio Chan's Shinkan Sen Zero is upcoming. I know you raided us from that. Whatever. We won't raid anyone. <laughs> I, YouTube's glitched today. I don't know what's going on. Everybody have a lovely evening. <laughs> As always, do not be led astray, my confidants. Also, Comfy Kara, MJ and Lim, thank you so much for donating the full funds as well. Um, donating a membership. Everybody have a lovely evening. We're just not going to raid anyone today. <laughs> I can't figure out who's next. YouTube's being weird. Oh, I am 30 minutes. Okay, that works perfectly. Thank you. And I redirect fire. Yeah, supermarket simulator. Okay. We'll be back tomorrow at the normal time, 10 a.m. EDT. And hopefully no more illnesses. Four more weeks of serious thrimming. And then I take a break for a bit. And then I come back recharged just in time. Well, not just in time. But I come back recharged in time to start working towards the shepherd. Everybody have a lovely evening. As always, do not be led astray, my confidants. And I will catch you guys next time. Now I shall proceed to drink so much water. Ah, and then green tea. I'm glad to be back. I missed you guys. Don't tell anybody about that. I'll say it's a lie. Bye bye.